Emma Emma Everybody's wondering what's behind that door. It's not really Comics Division's house. <laughs> Comics Division. That's a normal door. <laughs> I really want him to come out of that door one night during We're the night time. Do it. Hey, hey. <laughs> Shit. Little fucking dick. What a dick. <laughs> the last night, we had our own little middle of experience. We did. We did. Yo, how did it feel? <laughs> it was so cool. And the cocktails were very nice. Oh. Mama just killed a man. Stuck him up against a tree. Watched him die and then he peed. <laughs> Mama. His rings just begun, and now I'm gonna burn it all away. <laughs> Mama. Just a little taste of the behind the scenes <laughs> action. Yep. Wow. 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 Hi. Perry Chan. Hi. Crazy son. Hey. Perry. Hey. 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 hey, hey. <laughs> Perry. I haven't done that one in a while. Oh, I, I, wasn't to, I wasn't able to watch the, the intro, so I don't know what Perry did to me today. So I can only Actually, imagine. Actually, it wasn't you. It was you you didn't get really. No, you were pretty. Yeah, he he just with it he was just it was as in comics that got it. Yeah, yeah. 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 Thank, God. Thank you, right. Barry. <laughs> Gave you a break. I love this mine. Week. I'm proud of that. I want to watch that over and over and over. Again. <laughs> I think we'll watch it again because Adam didn't get to see it, so we'll watch it again. I got to bit. see the ass part. I did see the the golden showers. It looked like <laughs> nice. going on <laughs> for a little bit there. As was handling something golden earlier for my <laughs> right. hey. golden rod. Whoa, X-ray <laughs> girl. This this is is right. No. The girl gets married quickly, you see. <laughs> mm -hmm. You say shit like you that. You can't leave me now. <laughs> uh, yeah, did you act for that ass? Yeah. Did you uh did you actually act for that? Did they did they Oh that's the stuff you see on my <laughs> Batwoman reviews? Yes. This is what happens when, when Batwoman drives you insane. Oh well, you just cool. start singing and shit. 
Yeah, was that wasn't saying. by request. You just did that. That's just how he Yeah, is. that you just happened. On Elden Ring, and I had to turn you off because I was at work because I was like, oh my god, everyone's going to hear this. <laughs> you turn it up. What are you talking about? No. Yeah. As has a beautiful yeah. singing turn voice. It up. I went, turn I it went up. for the note. I went for the note as well. X-Ray yeah. Joe. Excellent. I went for it. <laughs> yeah. The only person you turn down at work is Ryan because you never know if, a, if an N-word is going to slip up. So <laughs> you don't want Ryan to, so. True. That's true. Yeah, yeah it's true. not the thing and it's the words. Yeah. The words. You're, you're not. You're not wrong. Uh, if, yeah, if I was playing, I, if I was playing Elden Ring and streaming it so everyone could watch me fail, there'd probably be a lot of gamer words. Uh, so if I can imagine. I saw you play Pokemon. Mm -hmm. Just that that's enough. true. That, that's on my level right there. Just catching a million Pokemon where they're like, we need to do this for the better of all Pokemon, so our relationship can be better with Pokemon. It's like. You realize you're asking me to go out there and make them fucking slaves and battle each other, right? <laughs> this is to better the relationship <laughs> between humans and Pokemon. Got it. I Ryan's like, this is my kind of game. Them fight. <laughs> what? I'm in. Uh, welcome. <laughs> this is the gladiatorial games all over again, right? right? Except with like little, I don't know what the hell Pokemon are. I don't what should I do, Pikachu? Pocket, 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 Pocket monsters. Pikachu. Uh, welcome to Friday Night Tights, everyone. Uh, my name is Gary Beekler. I come to you from nerdrotic.com and my mom's vagina. And today we're going to talk about Lord of the Rings. You're right. I'm not done talking about it. At least three more <laughs> weeks. Maybe till September. I don't care. I'm having fun. And I, I know you are too. The ratios are going up. Videos are getting unlisted. It's beautiful. It's glorious. It's glorious. And it's all because of you. You're doing so well. Give yourself a hand, fandom. <laughs> Chef's kiss. Well done, fandom. Well done. Kicking Amazon's ass. A trillion dollar corporation. It's, uh, God, it gives me geek wood. It really does. Uh, Jeremy, the most What's above up? average man on the internet, uh, made uh, it home. I am low. I'm Jeb Bush today. I am low energy. I'm exhausted. <laughs> um, I just got, I got in late last night, went right into a premium stream for geeksandgamers.com. So we went to Dallas. Um, we went, we were at the blaze studios. We got to make, uh, you know, we were supposed to be on, you are here. Um, but apparently even though I can drive out of the city of Dallas <laughs> and even though Ryan and I could make it to the studio, apparently the entire city has to shut down just because there's a little bit of ice on the ground. Welcome to Texas, buddy. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it, it, I was just blown away by it, but yeah. it was cool. We had a lot of fun. We did get to make an appearance with Sarah Gonzalez. That was great. That show was awesome. Great turnout over there. Um, and yeah, it was cool. We got to meet young Ripa, and uh, it was a lot of fun, but I am exhausted. So essentially, Ryan's flight got canceled. So I had to drive him from Dallas to Atlanta, and then from Atlanta to, and I came back to Pensacola. It's whew, it was and Ryan still on the road. Ryan's still on the road right now. So yeah, I'm in the uh, I'm in somewhere in the middle of fucking Georgia. So wherever that is, uh, I hear <laughs> I hear banjos playing. I can tell you that much. <laughs> but it's real. You it, should it, be worried for your keys, buddy. It yeah. was worth it. It was worth it specifically for one reason. So I'm sure you guys saw this uh, on Ryan's live stream or either on Geeks and Gamers clips or on Tuesday night's main event because we've oh, been God. showing it everywhere. But Ryan had a really bad experience uh, on the road. Fast food restaurant <laughs> messed up his order. It's a great <clears throat> clip. He's just so mad. So then me and him were on the road. I'm sharing my screen now. We go to McDonald's. They got my food right. <laughs> he had to go back up there. He was so fucking mad. They messed his order up. And this was after the night before when we went to IHOP. They got uh, my order right, and they missed Ryan. <laughs> what is it about your face that they're just like, I'm going to fucking forget everything he says. They everything saw, I'm going to give him. They, saw the they, they know, man. man. They know to screw up his order wherever he goes. It's so like, keep the yeah. meme going. At, at, going. One, at one point, like three out of the past five meals have been fucked up by absolute fucking retards. Why does it look like you have a red man bun in that picture right it there? Does. It does. It does. It's That's the whole like thing. thing. It's, like the it's all out thing. Of no yeah. It, because the of the light, meal. it looks like his head shaved, it's tied back, <laughs> and it's an orange gun. <laughs> oh, oh, look, look at that one. Oh, that one's good. That one's yeah, great. 
<laughs> it keeps getting. Listen, these memes would actually be valid if they were fucking my shit up. But they're fucking my shit up. That's what a Karen would say. Ryan what Karen, the hell Karen. Is Karen. Karen. <laughs> 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 I would like to speak to your manager. This shocks me. No, I would just like to pickles? get your fucking food. I would like to get my fucking food. That's all I want. All I want is my fucking food the way I order it. All you people out there, all you dumb fucks who messed up my shit, you will be replaced by robots, and I will fucking laugh as you die in a street because you can't breathe. Wow. It's true. a fucking burger, Ryan. Harsh, but it's true. a burger, and not the end of the world. Jesus, <laughs> Ryan, <not> man! <laughs> I will see your family destroyed. I will find him. <laughs> I'm just saying, if I was a massive world superpower and another country treated me like oh, that, I'd probably no. invade. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh. Too soon? <laughs> no. Yeah. You can go in and look for the laptop and find lots of laptops. Okay. Uh, what but, the uh, hell is even that? <laughs> It, it was it was worth it just to see Ryan get frustrated at fast food establishments. So uh, happy to be here. Friday night tights. Got a few things to talk about. We got Lord of the Rings. Uh, we got the Galactic Star oh, Cruiser, oh which is a fucking God. disaster. Oh. It, it is so bad. But yeah, happy to be here. I'm ready to get so back bad. on some Elden Ring. Uh, As was playing it earlier. So it's good. It's good shit. Gary needs to play Elden Ring. I'm sorry. <laughs> it, it, Oh, dude, Gary just play Elden that. Ring. Yes. <laughs> oh, yes. I, I, I can't even play it. What? I refuse. He, 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 nah, he, I refuse. George R. R. Martin worked on it. Fuck that. It, it delayed him from finishing Wins a Winner. I will never touch anything he touches that delayed that book. Kiss my ass. <laughs> Trust me, the only thing that J fucking Mr. Dick had to do with it, like, yeah. What the fuck? He ate the <laughs> As that might have been your greatest take of all time. <laughs> I need to go in for a repair. Fucking brain just <laughs> looking to wipe clean. Um, yeah, he I had some of the catering. I did, much, I did too much streaming. There's too much crap in here right now. Oh, all right. Okay. You're like a kid playing one of those fucking maze games in like Highlights <laughs> magazine, and you just got to a dead end, and you're like, fuck this shit. Like, yeah, just <laughs> squiggled everywhere and fucking threw it away. <laughs> He had, he had, look, Gary, I promise you, he had basically nothing to do with any of this. You probably just, yeah, I'll come in the building, I'll eat some of your catering, and you can put my name on it. Yeah. Yeah. Consulted. I said, yeah. Yeah, I, yeah the I, consulted. I imagine that he, like, on a napkin, you could have fit, like, just some of, like, the broader ideas that he had as kind of a, a story. Like, that's probably it. What if there was one the ring that ruled them all? Yeah. <laughs> and a brother <laughs> fucked a sister. Is George, that in there? that's great. We'll get back to you. Thank you very much. Right, get the ring, smash <clears> the <throat> ring, let it fly everywhere. And, okay. Touch the ring? I saw we somebody gotta... in the chat saying, touch the ring. Touch the ring. Depends touch on... my golden ring! Depends on where the ring is, that's for sure. <laughs> uh, hi, Az. How's it going? Hi. Great. It's going good. Cheers. How are you? I'm great. Batwoman's back. Wonderful. Yes. Naomi's back. Yes. Elden Rings out. Disney Star Wars <laughs> pissing on the walls <laughs> and calling it a hotel. To be fair, this that bathroom's so small. That bathroom's it's, it's, so small, it's pretty easy to piss on the walls. Yeah, so. yeah it's, it's difficult true. to make it into the small toilet. Yeah, I like the way that the woman who reviewed it, uh, without prejudice, uh, didn't actually go in. She kind of like more just stuck her head in round and pointed at stuff. And I was like, yeah, yeah. But those beds look tiny. Uh, $6,000 to play space bingo. <laughs> <laughs> and to do some space line dancing. And then to have Ray fucking, even, not even Ray, like discount Ray. How can he even get a discount Ray? She's already fucking discounted. To get a discount ray to come in and put a lightsaber on the floor so she can pick up another one. Quite frankly, I thought it was a better performance. <laughs> that actually is Daisy Ridley. Yeah. That's what she's actually, doing now. <laughs> well, she has no that career fight now. Was so badly choreographed, I thought this could oh, have been in the it sequel. Was, it was awful. I'm just I'm just really glad that it's finally confirmed that Disney Star Wars is truly, you know, they're not doing anything with the sequel trilogy anymore. Uh, I'm just glad <laughs> yeah. we got confirmation of that with the Star, Star Wars, Wars Galactic Star Cruiser Hotel. 
It's been retroactively changed, Ryan. It's been ditched, didn't you know? Turns out that the Halcyon Star Cruiser is actually going to go to the world between worlds, <coughs> and Ray's going to erase everything. So nice. <laughs> Can't wow. wait. Wow. 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 Hi, baby boy in Georgia. Yeah, uh, I'm in Georgia. I'm on the road. Hopefully, I'll be home soon. Uh, hopefully, I'll actually be home by tomorrow night. That's the goal anyway. But yeah, we're crashing another hotel. I haven't even fucked it up yet. Usually, the first thing I do when I get a hotel is just destroy it. Put my Can't shit everywhere. Confirm. Can't <laughs> yeah. confirm. I've Word seen confirm. it. <laughs> Word of I can see it. I usually just demolish it immediately, unpacking stuff. But I haven't even had time because I literally got off the road and did this. I have a pizza coming, though. So that'll be good. I'm excited for that. But yeah, lots to talk about. Pineapple? Fuck no, bitch. Ooh. Spicy pepperoni pizza. That's going to be good. From? Pizza Hut. It's the only thing I could get here. Yeah, that's hey, okay. Ryan picked two good pizza places in mm-hmm. Dallas. So very <clears throat> good choices. So got to give him a shout out for that one. <laughs> he I, I, get served in fair, one of them, but <laughs> to be fair, to be fair, I would have eaten Little Caesars. I don't even. Know yeah. But yeah, these places were good. I did. Yeah. I did try the Batman calzone at Little oh. Caesars, and I actually really fucking liked it. Oh, so I was gonna did. say review. <laughs> you did. I went. I, I went to. I, yeah. I went to an In and Out Burger with Ryan. They got his order right, and he liked it. He actually oh, wow. liked it. He didn't it did complain. Take, it did take a long ass time though. I did complain, so don't lie. Uh, to yeah, me. okay, yeah, that's right. You did. You were like, "Oh, it took too long." I said it pretty loud too. It was, a, it was like a pretty empty in and out. I was like, "What the fuck is taking so long?" It's called in and out, not in and wait. <laughs> Good point. Can't argue that. You can't argue that. And then we're just like, oh, fucking hell, Ryan, Ryan like, Kinnell's cold, in here. It's cold outside. Give us a break here in Dallas. <laughs> Fuck you, pussies. Everything's bigger in Dallas except the balls on every Texan. Is everybody, is everybody new? <laughs> yeah, dude, it pisses me off every time. There's just a little bit of a drizzle. Everybody's got their blinkers on, driving five miles an you hour. You have to understand, dude, Texas do not know how to drive in the rain or snow it's or nothing. ice. Yeah, it's the Californians, weather. dude. I'm telling you. like It's, it's always snowed and been cold in Dallas. I remember watching the Cowboy yeah. games in the 70s when they had the roof in the, the hole in the roof, you know, so God could watch his team or whatever they said, and it was snowing. So <clears throat> yeah, yeah it, it's not new. It must be California. That's, That's all I gotta theory. say. That's a good theory. Yeah. Uh, hey, Comics Division. Hey, how's it going, dude? Oh, good. Sorry, I couldn't help. How's you. that? How's uh things settling in with that new house? Oh, uh, okay. It's fine. I got okay. the rest of my stuff. <laughs> all right, on, man. I, I, yeah, like I, yeah, I might be cured of my. Uh, Getting hot toys for a little while. The rest of my life. (laughs) Is that underground, Gary? You look like you're a little bit in a bunker. I am actually upstairs. Okay. Attic. Attic. So there's opposite. uh, (laughs) There's attic on both sides of me, uh, and it's got some weird. I kind of like it though, like weird dip in the roof. But yeah, I've I've heard the lines in the walls that look like brick. But I yeah, guess it is. That's, yeah. it's like the, the sound. It looks like material. cinder block. Uh, it's like an base. insane. Asylum. It, 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 lo- it looks <laughs> like you're in a Ukrainian subway. Yes, you can, <laughs> you can play that up. You can definitely play that up. Uh, uh, yeah, that that's the, the no, do the bomb shelter thing. Right. Yeah. Uh, you can sell a, uh, barrels. It's awfully of appropriate food now with yeah. you the whole you know thing going on in Ukraine these days. So yeah, bomb shelter look would be good. Well. We can't. It'd be the worst bomb shelter in the world because it's upstairs. But I mean, yeah, yeah, well, yeah. fair. But, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, it's just it looks nice though. Out. Yeah. Bomb, sadly, bomb I, sad, sadly, sadly, I should have been at Gary's on Thursday, but the whole, all the change of plans and that's my fault. So, well, it's not necessarily your fault, but American Airlines. Yeah, he had to go to yeah. In and Out. Oh so. God, American yeah, is so. worse, dude. They always cancel flights, dude. Well, it was there was like twenty five hundred flights over two days, like canceled out of Dallas. It's something insane. So I don't. It probably wasn't just them, but I blame yeah. them. Yeah. When I was doing consulting, I fly them it. a lot, and they are terrible. I, I'd be down with that. Just let me sign. I don't give a yeah, fuck. Who cares? Like, <laughs> it, it, you know, if, if the if, plane if, skids off the end of the runway, <laughs> you know what happens? <laughs> no, yeah, they're fly. fucking fine. They're like, it's not that big of a deal. I've seen a motherfucker land a plane in a goddamn river. I, yeah. It's not really that big of a deal if we crash it. So. Hey, yeah, we saw Sully. Saw Denzel Washington fly a plane yeah, upside so down. Man. Like it was just <laughs> yeah. all good, man. About, I think he was drunk too. What about yeah, Sully? if you crash, yeah. you can land on an <laughs> island. You'll be fine. You make a friend with the football or something. Sully landed in uh, in New- what the hell is that? Uh, what band was that again? 
in New York, the guy who landed the plane in the in the water. Sully, uh, Sully, 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 yeah. Sully, yeah. Sully yeah. Sully, yeah, yeah. I thought that was mm-hmm. in Delaware, though. Was no, it, it was, it was on. It was the river Hudson, that runs like Hudson river the Hudson like river the Hudson. Yeah. Sully, yeah. Sully wasn't Denzel Washington in the movie right that's not the same event that's like no. a different that was about a dude who like had drinking up. problems yeah, yeah. They, yeah. didn't Tom yeah, Hanks like, play Sully yeah it was Tom Hanks yeah. that played Sully yeah. yes yeah different we could have made movie. videos back then about race swapping Sully if that I know that's what I was so thinking that would have been good Denzel yeah. plays Sully <laughs> well that's the remake that'll happen trust me oh, they, they probably would have like race swapped like a flight attendant or something that we could have got upset about so yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then the like, it, it, turn, out, it turns out that, Sully. Yeah, <laughs> racist it turns out that like oh the first flight attendant was actually the key to the entire thing she yeah. gave him the idea <laughs> she, she, no she actually <laughs> lands like, the plane if you land in the Hudson? she lands the plane like like Sully ends up pissing his pants and going Out in the back the and getting in a fetal position and crying. She's like, I got this fucking shit. She puts yeah. her tray down. <laughs> and, then she, and then she goes out and starts lifting obese men out of yep. the oh my God. Of, Two of them at a time. Yeah. And yeah. then swimming with them on her back. And if you don't like it, you're a sexist. That's right. That's right. End of discussion. Uh, I think we've got a pitch, right boys. I, I think we do, too. I think we do. Uh, what's up, Quarter Black? Garrett. Yo, uh, unlike my brothers over here, I actually was on your game. Ah, Yo. oh. <laughs> oh really yeah, dude, I was I was mad because I was excited to watch that <laughs> show. Uh, but your boy got on. That's right. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm excited. Uh, we, you know, the world's going to shit. We're all uh, it's uh, kind of crazy out there. But Lord of the Rings, you, uh, dude, you can't say the world's going to shit. COVID's over. Yeah. <laughs> I forgot about Hopefully. that. Hopefully. <laughs> This is the fourth variant. War. Okay. War. Yeah. <laughs> there is a bit of a disagreement going on, yes. Well, oh, I also passed uh, 30K subs on my channel, so oh, no, well thank done. you, everybody out there. Wow. Well done. And all of my orders were correct. I, I literally just got off the phone with the people from Pizza Hut and they fucked up my order. <laughs> <laughs> So there's this thing, Ryan, it's called karma. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe you've heard of it. I would rather my karma be I die at the age of 50 than have the, my entire life till then fucked up. Oh, That's what I mean. that. <laughs> so you hit 50. Ryan, just to confirm, though, do you wish any of these families dead <clears throat> at Pizza Hut? For the record. Oh, or yes. are we okay? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Not just the ones that are directly involved with this. And he wonders yeah. why <laughs> his food orders continue to get fucked no up. No collateral damage. Just <laughs> unless they're watching my live streams. I was I mean, gonna say they watched our live stream. It's karma, Ryan. It's karma. I believe I'm in karma. So. They have a whisper network, and <laughs> Ryan is the very top of that list. For yeah, they got, a, they got a Twitter DM group, and they just talk in it all. All the Friday Night Tights panelists are like, "We're gonna fuck his order up." So. <laughs> <laughs> they, they call me they're like uh hey i see there's a root beer on this order uh we, we don't have any root beer we never have had any root beer i'm like i didn't order a root beer <laughs> i'm trying to give you stuff now and so yeah, yeah they're like they didn't put the breadsticks on they put a root beer instead so now i gotta fucking yeah. make the breadsticks it's like what the fuck is wrong with these beach tragic <laughs> Root beer's good. Oh, oh, second oh, string time oh, is yeah. breadsticks. Oh, look at that, just in time. He was just waiting Hi. for the he, when he was getting close <laughs> to being introduced. <laughs> Adam's also. like, "What the fuck is going?" Yeah, it usually takes about half an hour to introduce our guests. Sorry, I didn't know Adam could exist without Sitch. What's going on? I know, right? Yeah, it's it's incredible, isn't it? Nice to see you, buddy. We, you you all this time you thought we were Siamese twins. I did. Digital <laughs> ones. How are you doing? Oh, good. You know, good. I got a video done. That's how I rate my wellness. I oh, saw damn. you posted it. Oh. Yeah. It looks like another is it two hour opus. Wait, what do you mean I posted it? I uh, saw a screenshot of Oh the... fuck. For a second oh. there. Did I make it public when oh, it just like that dumb pile of like yeah, I just I just watched it. Video some... draft. <laughs> it, literally it's, it's called like Uber Final or something. If it was released, I'd be like, oh my god, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh dude. Uber no, no, no. I, I saw a screen cap of the edit, which is always I mean like ten thousand cuts. Yep. <laughs> 
Yeah, I look at that. When all you need wow. is a knife. Oh no, yeah. okay. It's not not the same. I, I mean, hey, I I, we were singing Mahler, I've no. accidentally like <laughs> put stuff into playlists, but left it unlisted, and just didn't think about the fact that you can totally see everything on the playlist when you leave I've it unlisted. Yes, uh, yes. I set up a, a schedule to come out at seven thirty in the morning. Came out at seven thirty at night on a Saturday, which is fuck. yeah. God dang it! I Dude. done it. Yeah. Peak Peak hours. Was, um making its TLJ videos. I I remember when I was still in a Facebook group for like people spreading the videos and stuff, and I I just accidentally control V and entered into a DM conversation with some random person the fucking videos, <laughs> and I was literally, I deleted it straight away, and then they were like, "Thank you." And I was like, "Oh no." <laughs> 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 Oh, wow. They were like, I won't share it, but I'll watch it. I was like, I, I, okay. Please don't share it. Yeah. <laughs> just please. I've worked you on it. You just got to comment on it like a million times before it even. Uh, first, first. Mahler could release a video at mid, no, freaking 11.59 on Saturday. It'd be fine. People yeah, be totally. Be excited. Mm -hmm. uh, X-Ray Girl. Uh, Hi. Hi. How that are won't, you guys doing? It's good. That won't count against your nine words. Oh, I mean, I already <clears> said at least... 25 words earlier. You did. Whoa. At least it was funny. Oh, oh, All right. I'm muting her. I like, I, like, no. I, like, <laughs> I like Gary when Gary like asks people, hey, extra girl, how are you doing? And then she's like, Good. How are you guys doing? So we all literally just fucking told you all about it. In the intro. Yeah. We would, but what's our I'm still in work be? mode right reaction. now. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> no, I started playing Elden Ring and then I watched Az's live stream and I'm like, I don't remember this being in the game. And I'm like, I skipped the whole tutorial. That's why I really suck. <laughs> That's what I do every time. Always you, don't, you don't skip these tutorials. I don't know how I skipped it. It just was there and then gone. I'm skipping anyway. it. I'm streaming it. I'm going to skip it. I'm gonna you, went, you should have gone down and you went out. Oh, that's what it was? Mm -hmm. that's oh, what wow. That's the whole up and down thing. I, was, I didn't understand that. Up, up, down, down. I just oh man, um, I should have gone down. Oh, apparently. <laughs> that's that's good. good. Girl. I'm sure Martha Sorry Bork would appreciate <laughs> yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. gonna get red right now. <laughs> whoever Harry? makes a clip, whoever makes a clip of that, uh, do that, and then the next thing, just show that picture of Mark smiling with a thumbs up. So I'm good. <laughs> Apparently, uh, Hassan is threatening to DMCA clip channels because they're uploading all of his horrible takes. Recently really? Oh, can me. we show uh -oh. some later? Oh, Whoa. God. What an interesting take he has. <laughs> it, was, it was just like three months ago where he shared all of the clips channels as a reason for him to not ever be DMCA'd. Yeah, he's uh, he said some stuff recently that has bitten him in the ass. Oh, <laughs> hell yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He had like Fuck his him. worst take ever. Well, I don't know. Is the America deserve 9-11? That's probably yeah, that the worst take. Bad. Yeah. The Even worst. the left got him on that. They were like, oh, you gotta I, come in here and apologize. So we'll I'll call never this understand one the how he managed worst to take. maintain his platform after saying that when everyone else gets banned for way less. Fuck. The the uh jank sitting him down though is <laughs> internet gold. Like that is <laughs> am amazing the internet best. history there. Yeah, you can tell like Jank expects a full apology out of him. And he basically is like, nah, fuck you. Mm. <laughs> uh, Jank also has some of the worst takes, too. Oh, of course. It runs yeah. Especially well, about you mean, bestiality. Yeah, yeah about horses. Mr. I want to fly. I wanna well, did you see his like recent the rules one? on fucking animals? About how uh, if the horse says it's okay wow. as, what's the problem? Uh, that's basically <laughs> Jank's take. Yeah, his one from yesterday was pretty terrible. Yeah, which was then he ran for Congress in Southern California and did like terrible <laughs> and lost and so yeah, lost bad, very bad. Yeah, come on, reel this in, Gary. No, We're going I, off I think, on the I think, I think if he ran in <laughs> San Francisco, yeah, he'd win. No, no Lord, Lord of the Rings, Lord of the Rings, Return of the King. <laughs> no, uh, yeah. I had a little technical difficulty I was working on. Uh, uh hello, Adam. Friended. Hey, how are you? You finally made it. I'm good, man. Yeah. It's I'm glad you're here. We we had to reschedule Adam like it like six months ago. I don't know when it was. Oh. Hey, we finally got you back on. So that's good. I'm glad you're here, man. Yeah, thanks. Things happen. It's no big deal. Yes, I I'm Adam. I do a show on uh on 
Sunday with my very good friend, uh, PSA Sitch. Mahler's already giving me a hard time about not having Sitch here, but I mean, we can get this him. <laughs> some other time. Yes, we can. So, yeah. But uh, yeah, thanks for having me on. Hey, yeah. uh, my, our pleasure. Our pleasure. And thanks for being here. There's plenty to talk about and anything. Uh, yeah, we could walk you through any Lord of the Rings stuff. It's very that's, easy. That's cool. It's it's, it's and, the basic shit. It's they want before, to tear something down yeah. that we love. Before before we get started, I know people are gonna you know like oh how you guys talk about pop culture? People are dying. People, we've addressed what happens in Chicago every week. Yep. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and we still feel that we should focus on you know pop culture. So we know people are dying in Chicago. We know. Good job, Obama. Good job. You're aware. But we're we're gonna focus on pop culture. That's what we do here. So I yep. want to clear that up. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, Gary, we actually do have a special guest along with Adam and Mahler. Uh, are you ready to bring this special guest on? <gasps> Mahler, say hi real yeah. quick. Hi, Mahler. I, I like just talked to you oh, Hi, 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 hi. Who, hi, who hi. is it? <laughs> <laughs> who knows? Who, who, who knows? Let's find out. Oh, oh great. Grace, Grace Randolph, everybody. Hi, Grace Randolph. Hello, hello. Can you hear me okay? <laughs> hello. Hi, Grace. Hi, Grace. Hello. Unfortunately, yes. Yes. Hello, <laughs> geeks and gamers and nerd radicals. Hi. <laughs> I don't know what to call you people. It's me, your favorite film critic from Beyond the Trailer. Boy, oh boy, has a lot happened. So many trailers have dropped. The Batman tickets are finally on sale. And I just got back from the Ukraine. <laughs> oh, wow. oh, no. Or as I like to call it, that Eastern European country where everyone looks like Ryan Kennel. <laughs> uh, hey, uh, by the way, Ryan, I loved you and Jerry. Jeremy on the Blaze show, you are not here. Because <laughs> <laughs> you weren't there. <laughs> Thank you, Chris. Yeah, well, yeah, we yeah. were. They just weren't. Yeah. That is yeah, true. Yeah. Uh, we, true. We said we sat in a uh, I sat in the heartfelt chair and took a picture and everything. So yeah. Mm. Turns out you're rude to women, and then Mother Nature just Nipped you in the bud. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that might be true. That might be true. Yeah. Congrats again to Quarter Black for making it on. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Appreciate it. You know, he's a quarter black. <laughs> <laughs> the Rings of Power. Boy, oh boy. Reminds me of Shadow and Bone. Another great fantasy show. Shadow and Bone is also the courtship style of the gentleman on this show. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what that means. It means you're sketchy. <laughs> <laughs> it lacks nudity, which means it's going to be hard to fully see all the diversity, especially where it counts. <laughs> hey. We know you like John hey Cena's diversity. Yeah. I, do. Oh, yeah, I do. He's one of the few whites that I will tolerate. <laughs> <laughs> now, again, with Rings of Power, it looks beautiful, yet it's bad. It looks very bad, according to the trailer, but I'm still rooting for it because you guys aren't. So many people are not rooting for this. Mm -hmm. It's just, ah, I have such a hard time saying anything bad about the corporate or anything establishment. Ugh, who knows if they're listening. <laughs> uh, the it's safe. It's probably safe. Yeah. It's a good, chill. it's a good chilling. That's good. Well done. The Oscar nominees <laughs> were just announced. Among those in the best picture category are Dune, King Richard, and Don't Look Up, which, interestingly enough, is also what every one of Jeremy's lovers have to keep reminding themselves <laughs> when he's on top. <laughs> that was good. That was good. Although, to be fair, it doesn't matter to me as long as I'm getting mine. So. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. You know, so it you're really doesn't matter to me. Got it. Selfish stuff. Yes. The working title of. Why did you uh, answer Don't that, Ryan? Up, the working title of Don't Look Up was actually Don't Look Down, which is what Odin has to say to himself whenever he takes his pants off. <laughs> <laughs> Getting roasted ain't even here. Oh, wow. That's wow. weird. 
<laughs> you tell him, bro. You're cooking. Person. Wrong person. He's cooking, y'all. Not here. Okay, well then consider it for as then. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take it. The Oscar nominees were just announced. Among those, uh, I already said that part. Okay. <laughs> uh, <laughs> also, exactly nominated, like also nominated for best picture is the Japanese drama Drive My Car. <laughs> Starring Rika Kurishima, Toko Miyuri, and uh, Exo Rea Girl. <laughs> <laughs> the original title paid more homage to the Oriental culture, uh, and it was actually originally, originally called Drive My Car at 20 Miles Per Hour in the Left Hand Lane, not understanding oh, no. why everyone is honking at me. <laughs> no. <laughs> That was too long and wouldn't fit on the marquee. <laughs> well, Paul uh, Thomas Anderson is nominated for the third time for Best Director for Licorice Pizza. Uh, the original title was going to be Pineapple Pizza, but the production team said that nobody with any taste at all would waste any money on something like that. It's wrong. True. It's just fucking true. wrong. Very true. It's just wrong. very true. Very true. Very true. That was Get her thing. off. Shade. Yeah. Shade there. I was uh, inspired by fellow blonde and recently viral Anna Lynn McCord. So I decided to write my own poem, which will surely end this awful Ukraine Russia oh, no. conflict. Oh, no, no, no. Are oh. you? I just. Get ready. Oh, no. Oh, no, no. Get ready for surely world peace. Oh, no. <coughs> Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, President Putin. My name is Grace. Please subscribe to my channel or you're a disgrace. <laughs> if I were your mother, I'd take you to the movies. I'd change your little diaper and feed you milk from my boobies. <laughs> oh, no. I know that you're upset, but war is not the answer. Did you know that Hitler was a marvelous dancer? <laughs> <laughs> no. That was a little bit of a stretch, I gotta say. That's what uh, you said. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, there once was a man named Joe Biden who was always said to be hiding. <laughs> he saw a 12 year old girl, thought he'd give it a whirl, <laughs> took his dick out and tried to slide in. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, don't tell my sponsors. Don't tell my sponsors oh. I said that. <laughs> I gotta go. I can't be seen on this channel. It's <laughs> Frost. <laughs> well, it's Amazing. nice to see that she, you know, put a brush through her her, her hair for us. She yeah, did. She well, did. I, I yeah. think yeah. she's still a wife disgrace. I think uh, Grace mm. might have just ended the conflict right there. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> or or the like, show forever. I'm not really sure. Just, I haven't decided. Uh, I, I love all the tweets that are like breaking. Biden is cutting off Disney Plus to Russia. <laughs> <laughs> Stuff <Yeah>. like that. <laughs> Neil Young removes his. No, music from you need Spotify. to get more Disney can we, can Plus we talk to about Russia. Why That's John Cena follows me on Twitter. Yeah, what he the follows hell? like What's he, up with that, dude? he follows like a million people. Ass. Yeah, no, he doesn't. It's yes, three hundred eighty-five thousand people. It's like, it's like, a million. It's like four hundred. It's like four hundred. And he has thirteen point five million following him. So the ratio is, I'm okay with it. I'm all right with that ratio. All right. That's what like Amazon's somebody, trying to justify right now. So. It's like somebody who's got like two people following them follows like twenty people. That's okay. You know, it's all right. I'll do it. I'll take it. It's weird though. It's weird. Clearly, he's weird, a fan weird. of yours. Oh, that's what I think. I think watches all my videos, particularly the Batwoman. Probably. <laughs> oh, yeah. He wants to be your friend. Check your DMs. Yeah. I'm sure, I'm sure he reached have, out to you. Well, I, I sent him one. I said, John. I said, Johnny boy. What are you up to? Do you fancy, mm. uh, do you fancy having a bit of a chin wag about Batwoman? And he said, um, I'd rather talk about Naomi, if that's all right. Did he? I, hey, we're all into different things. Did, I like how he was like, if I could have the powers of hashtag the peacemaker oh, yeah. right now, I would. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, dude. And he like, does hashtag, a plug in there. He does ha yeah, he does hashtag pe peacemaker to to shout out his fucking show uh, on a on an anti-war fucking tweet. That like 
Oh, adult pretenders, man. You got to love them. <laughs> hey. Uh, uh, you think? Well, wow. I, was he talking about the re- Ukraine, or was he getting ready to apologize to the CCP again? Uh, Taiwan's a country. Oh. Hashtag Taiwan's a country. Fucking CCP coach. Yeah. Bitch. Guess I guess no, he ain't gonna be gonna following me. He, he, he'll be apologizing yeah. to Russia soon. I'm so so sorry. I think I will quicker than you lot will. <laughs> Gary, yeah. you're not going to get your Disney Plus Just simple Plus show geography, now. that's all. Just simple geography. I think Disney, yeah, Mahler, I think Disney Plus should be pumped into Russia and be considered a sanction. That, that's <laughs> what I would do. That's how we weaken their structure. Yeah. Yeah. That's part of we the will sanctions make right you there. watch Falcon the Winter Soldier. <laughs> I think we should send all those self-righteous people who have messages to say then, mm-hmm. and, and that are so disgusted with, you go, you go forth. You go forth and you preach to them in their country. Let's see what happens, eh? Yeah. Yeah. So we're going to hear. Oh, uh, Chrissy's back. Oh what God. do you mean back? She's back. Been here she, I mean, yeah. she, she just got here. Time. Sorry. My bad. Back. What's up? She's late. Sorry, Chrissy's I'm late. late. Yeah. Yeah. So, I have to never be late. I don't want to be replaced for that crazy lady. Man, that yeah. was fucking hard to watch. Oh, <laughs> that that You're in the fuck. backstage the whole time. I, I thought it was interesting that Grace had an American flag in the background. I, I just didn't see yeah. that coming. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, didn't that peg as a, is weird. As a patron. I just thought <laughs> it was going to be like a flag. Disney or Warner Brothers banner. So. <laughs> probably forgot to probably move is. it. Just like Prince Andrew and a five-year-old. I just didn't see that coming. What hotel are you in, Ryan? <laughs> um, I'm in the town, uh, town place suites. Ooh. Address is what room? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what room? <laughs> what room number? With a pizza and a root beer Maybe on the way. Get his pizza. No, not a fucking root beer. <laughs> yeah, the last no root beer. Security code, please. Yeah. I well, I did. I guess I did kind of give my geographic location. I said like butt fuck uh, Georgia. So if you can find that, <laughs> that encompasses a lot Down of Georgia. sweets and butt fuck Georgia. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'll be there next yeah. month. Mm. Wow. Savannah. Right down in butt fuck. That's not butt fuck though. Oh. That's an actual city. <laughs> it's regular fuck. Yes, it's, it's just Savannah, fuck. Savannah's fuck, front, Savannah, front fuck. Savannah's really nice. Savannah's Georgia. Really nice. How, how bad was the snow in Texas? It, it wasn't, wasn't it's not bad for at all. Texas people. It was, it was an ice they storm, have, though. It was, no, it was an ice storm. It, it, the, the, the roads. The roads were it was a, yeah like bad. I went over a couple of bridges and now I was sliding a little bit but I mean I literally there, drove there was out. a lot of fucking so, accidents there yeah. out there wow. though because, because people can't Texas fucking people. drive. Yeah. Well, they go ninety miles an hour bumper to bumper. That's why. Like everybody everywhere thinks that they live where people can't drive. People just mm-hmm. can't fucking drive everywhere because people are fucking stupid. Get out of the left lane, you dumb fuck. It's for passing, you fucking idiots. Like True. that's everywhere you go. So it, it's not that it, Texas people can't drive. Literally everywhere has stupid drivers. Anywhere because, in the South, though, yeah. specifically, whenever they have to deal with ice or snow, they can't handle it because they're not used to it. And the city is not ready for it. So there's not plows there's not salt vehicles like on standby ready to go like you right. have in the midwest and the northeast and shit so combination of those things doesn't make it good you think yeah. texas though would like invest because every 10 years it happens it's like a massive blizzard hit if, if something prepared. happened to you every 10 years and then it was done like the next day would you give a fuck i know but a bunch of people died I last wouldn't. time so i think maybe yeah maybe uh, invest in a couple got 10 years yeah Ryan Did said, if they're violent. fast food workers, I don't care. <laughs> well, <yeah>. Let them <laughs> fucking freeze. I, I think the vast majority of the people that froze to death were probably crackheads and fast food workers. Oh, they're so. not fast food workers' families, Ryan. Uh, don't be, this, don't be the son of a fast food worker, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> the only boy I could have is <laughs> the son of a fast food worker. Fast food man. <laughs> when I was he just knew last... just how to flip patties when I was, uh, <laughs> last last year i think it was when they had that first like bit, well not the first but the snowstorm that wiped out all their power yeah uh, i was like i think it was last february yeah it was, it was uh, the it was it actually started um valentine's day 
Yeah, it was it was really nuts. Like the my hotel blacked out. I had to get like candles and like warm myself by them. And then we drove to Raisin Canes and there was still a, such a huge line. There actually was like a truck full of like Mexican landscapers who like drove up. Yeah, they, they, took all their, they took all their landscaping tools. They flipped them upside down and they were like scraping the snow off the drive through with their landscaping. I was like, I give these guys. Wait, we need credit. to get our chicken. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> I had respect for them, but still nobody have, has blo- like bought one plow in a year's time no it's crazy yeah well, it snows a, for a day and then it goes away there's a bunch every of, 10 years it'll, it'll <clears> there's, 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 there's a bunch of dead trees around here from that last year still uh that you can see yeah. including a couple in my yard uh, uh well they're gonna go hey, hey you want to pull up that article quarter black hair the one that gave, put a little smile on my face yesterday and it's not even lord of the rings we'll get to that oh, get to that <laughs> not even lord of the rings not even lord of the rings it's it's remember lord remember, remember disney Return remember the disney game. marvel you know they've they've done such a great job interpreting their own comic books um including king valkyrie uh uh-oh studio report disney dives as sony soars and it's just confirming you know yeah, well, I mean, that last one, Paramount Rises, that's all I can do, by the way. Like, they've been, <laughs> it's at the bottom. They've been at the bottom for <laughs> yeah. so damn long. Nowhere uh, else to go. But there's a little graph that's confusing as hell, but it, basically it, it initially said that Disney profits were down 50%, uh, but then it says on the side there, uh, what does it say? It says, on the bright side, for its latest fiscal year, ending in October 2nd, the company posted a higher $567 million operating profit than the Hollywood Reporter's calculated figure for the calendar of 2021. That's the same report where they posted a $65 million loss when it comes to their yeah. films like Black Widow and Shang-Chi. <laughs> they were success. <laughs> Take the L. Take the L, Disney. Take the L. Run with it. Sleep with it. Marry yeah, the L. The entire have company. Kids they did that well. They did. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, I'm confused. Why is uh, okay. why is Warner Brothers doing so well? What do they do recently? What am I forgetting? What did they, what did no they do? idea. Snyder cut, free, brother. Snyder cut. Right. <laughs> no. Free cash flow. A profit. I see out there, Mikey. The ability to fund <laughs> operations without external financing swung into a 159 million loss, but is expected to be paused from here. What's that talking about? Is that Warner Brothers? Yeah. Yeah. And and Netflix just made a, a shitload of money. Yeah, Netflix. No, it's go. Netflix. It's the Netflix. crazy it's thing with Warner Brothers is that like Squid Game. Uh, obviously, so many Hawk of their game. so many of their properties got released on HBO Max as well. We all kind of shit on it because it really affected stuff in the box office. But I don't know how much of the HBO Max revenue and all that stuff is factored in here. Yeah. Because Matrix Disney, Four. Like. like Oh, God. <laughs> because obviously this is that's what you're taking, forgetting Mahler. yeah this is only taking in like actual entertainment stuff not like theme parks and everything right gary like this is just straight up like fucking movies yeah and tv as far as i know yes this is their film yeah. division so yeah. i always wondered if netflix was doing well or not because they spend so much money but i guess they are looks like they're doing pretty good yeah tenet is a warner brothers movie too that's kind of controversial um, and it didn't do well. That was, yeah, it did not do well. No, it was right didn't. around the pandemic, which I thought the movie wasn't. That well, I love anyway, about this. So. What I love didn't... about this is it play. It, it confirms all of the things we said whenever Spider Man came out that Spider Man was a Sony victory. Disney was lost in this situation. <coughs> Every film that they released before that was a <clears throat> bomb. It was not critically, or I mean, I guess it was cr- critically because there's a lot of shills, but it was not commercially successful until spider-man and that's a sony victory so mm-hmm. every time somebody says some shit like oh no well it was really disney mcu that did this show them this no. article and we so will they're, they're blaming it on higher spending and not that the products were tanking that their products are crap. of course and they yeah if you scroll down they 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 go down they talk about uh for Netflix. one the uh they they call spider-man a sony film which is what it, it is. Was. Uh, and yeah. that's why Sony made a shitload of money. And Which they, is sad for them because it's the only thing in Phase 4 that's like yeah. the public like. Well, mm-hmm. I say that. I, I guess there's some people who like Shang-Chi out there. There sure is. <laughs> yeah, but it didn't make uh, a lot of money. 
Just yeah, a couple of say, bob. Yeah. Extra girl loved Shang Chi. Yeah, she, 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 saw, she finally saw herself and one to <laughs> another. Like literally <laughs> saw herself. I, I am Simu Lu. I thought you guys knew that. God. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. It's true. <laughs> I'm, ex I'm excited about your success, X Ray. Thank okay. you. Thank you. Oh, Rich finally. Case, what the fuck was that Instagram post about, bitch? <laughs> uh, LOL. Living uh, a secret uh. life. I had to keep up appearances. <laughs> All right. Okay. Oh That's wait, right. you guys are Venom letting it be carnage. Did that do better than uh, like like Black Widow and Shang Chi and stuff? Yeah. 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 Yes. It had a low <laughs> especially, budget. Especially, that's, that's, especially that's pretty fucking funny. Like it, so, Sony were trying to sort of leech off of Marvel at one point, but now they're kind of just like doing fine. The like, tables have turned. Yeah. That yeah. movie only costs like eighty or ninety million dollars yeah. to make. Super low and it budget. Made like five hundred globally or something like that. Yeah. Power of Spider Man, huh? Power of Tom yeah. Hardy. Speaking uh, yeah. and grunting, I, 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 yeah. I still say it's more about Venom and just the Spider Man connection because I mean, the first one did really well. The first one did really well. I didn't really care for either one of them, but they weren't offensively terrible. They They're just, both like they fives cool. in my book. Yeah. Um, I, I wasn't so. a super big fan of the first one, but I, I didn't like seeing it a second time three years later quite as much. <laughs> uh, like, that's what Venom 2 basically was. Yeah. But this one had Woody Harrelson. Come on. <laughs> Uh, yeah. White men can jump. It, it's like it's like they <laughs> cast a movie twenty years ago and just made it. Uh, that, yeah, he would have been good twenty years ago. So yeah, caught, it, budget of one hundred ten million, box office five hundred million during the pandemic. Yeah. So. Yep. Uh, scroll down to the Disney part. Disney. You're gonna have to read that part because it's too small for me and I can't bring that screen up. I can burp, 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 burp. Look at that. Oh yeah. After, After reorganizing. Go for it. You go for it. Were you going to read it? You go. No, you read it. I can't read. I'm retarded. <laughs> I what do you think I am? You, <laughs> read retarded. Yeah. Uh, after a reorganization for the streaming age, anal analysts see the content sales slash licensing and other business for the Disney Media and Entertainment Distribution Division as the closest equivalent to its former studio, Uden, it includes the sale of film and episodic television content to the TV, SVOD, boring bullshit, blah, blah, blah. Uh, and it says they're opening, pro uh, it says Disney subscriptions are not part of this. So Disney Plus subscriptions hmm. are not part of this. Uh, calendar year 2021 operating profit here, a calculated as calculated by the Hollywood Reporter, fell $281 million on lower revenue and higher expenses, such as for the theatrical marketing, which tends to rise with a higher number of theatrical releases. Revenue dropped 8%, even though the theatrical rebounded 87.3%, despite key titles such as Black Widow, uh, which lost money. Uh, being released day and date on Disney, the company's top theatrical performer was Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings. At $432 million globally, it made enough money to pay for one caterer. Uh, but fewer <laughs> the releases. Uh, but it was a good caterer, Gary. Yeah, it, yeah, yeah. it was delicious. It really was. Everything was on time. Yeah, and uh, delicious. <laughs> but fewer theatrical releases and production delays have limited the availability of film content to be sold in distribution windows subsequent to the theatrical release. Also, what they don't mention here is no China, and uh, they don't mm -hmm. mention the Eternals. Oh yeah. They don't make the right. Eternals. And I think China might be done with like Hollywood. Uh, it certainly seems Good. like it's done with to, Disney. To, to be fair, you said they didn't mention Eternals. Well, they have a separate section about the amount of lives that were saved per movie, and it oh. leads that list. So oh. that's in a different section, yeah, Gary. It's, so, it's lower down. So please have a little respect for the lo the, the saved lives from Eternals. I am okay? so a lot. disrespectful. A lot. All yeah, the yeah. Lives and, and on their, you know, on their defense, it's yeah. easy to forget about Eternals. <laughs> it is. It really is. I it forgot really the movie is. came out. Yeah. And it was only. I remembered like, the other day when I went into Walmart and saw the uh, the markdown <laughs> section of toys. Yeah, the five dollar <laughs> everything, <laughs> everything must go. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> please, God, please take these. <laughs> we will give you five dollars to take them. <laughs> so uh, uh. I think I think uh, that Disney. Marvel will destroy the goodwill of Spider-Man No Way Home within eight months, maybe six. It depends on when uh, female Thor comes out. Mm, I think yeah, that we'll movie is going to be a trash out. fire. Is that this year or next year? That's this year. 
I think later this year. They show, announced right? the uh, the casting for Ironheart today, didn't they? Oh, did they? Yeah. Is it going to be yeah. Leslie yeah. Jones as female Thor? Oh, God, that'd be hilarious. <laughs> that might be. I would love that. I hope so. Been Amy I've been Schumer. waiting for yeah, I've been waiting for Leslie Jones uh, to lead a Marvel Cinematic you know, Universe film yeah. for a long time now. Uh, I want her to be uh, I want her to have four kids. Uh, I want her to just be like screaming at him when she's trying to save the world. Sue Storm. Like, you know, so, I want her to be. Yeah, Sue Storm. Be based off what Thor has shown off, and based off what some of the cast have said, I could not give less of a shit about this film if I tried right now. Thanks to Tessa Thompson's big fat fucking <laughs> trap. And, she is and a thanks retard. To, to King Valkyrie. And thanks to the Space Karen fucking toy for Natalie Portman. It's just like, this is going to be a, a, a surprise, surprise. Another feminist Marvel fucking film. To go with all their other feminist agenda Marvel films. To go with all their feminist agenda Marvel TV shows. To go with all their... In production, feminist mar are just fuck right off. I could not care. I could not give a shit. You ain't getting a penny. Go fuck yourself. I'm gonna wait for season two of Reacher. Thank you. Good night. Oh, don't go. <laughs> I can still see you as <laughs> goodbye. It's, it's very difficult to hide me, more. <laughs> and and uh, goodbye. You broke good my vision, bro. <laughs> I'm gone. You can't see me. Now you, got, now you got to stay that way. Look like you're giving yourself head. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. I was it's, told not it, to look down here. No. It's called self-love, damn it. <laughs> Self-coupling. It's natural. Self coupling <laughs> oh. There's nothing between us, well, apart from this gut. She gets a new oh. name. Oh, my God. She's Kang Valkyrie because King uh, is a higher King rank. Valkyrie. He was King. It's Kang Valkyrie. Dude. Kang. Oh, my God. K-A-N-G Valkyrie. Because Queen is a lower rank than King, according <laughs> right. to the intersection. I'm glad I can finally see myself in a, in a position of power in the Norse mythology. You know? Mm. Garrett was Kang's. I, Garrett was Kang's. Mm-hmm. Dancing with Kangs. Well, and like, I mean, we had the part in Endgame, right? In oh, Endgame, no. that's that's what Thor said, uh, as God needs a king. And she laughed and he's like, you're, you're the leader that I could never be. I have to be myself. So dumb. You know, so uh, the it all up. Yep. And it seems, I was thinking the exact same thing, man. Disney loves to like just completely undo what the entire first fucking Thor movie was about. Uh, they undid the entire well, the first two seasons of Mandalorian for one, you know, stupid message scene. And yeah, it's it's the Disney way. Uh, undo all they didn't undo Hawkeye. They never did Hawkeye. Hawkeye just <laughs> hung around to to pass his mantle later on. Uh, and that's why I think this Lord of the Rings thing is great because it's it's making Marvel look even worse, even <laughs> fucking worse. It's indefensible what they've fucking done. And people are just loving that shit. And, well, a lot less. It's a lot less. They can't hide this stuff anymore. I think Disney is just better at Amazon with working with the media and finagling shit mm -hmm. uh, than, than uh, Amazon was, even though Amazon and they has. they probably own a lot of it. Well, yeah, I think they do. I think they do. And ABC, they have yeah. ABC, ESPN. Uh, ESPN, yep. And I'm sure they got their fingers in a lot of other holes. Gross. <laughs> Probably bung holes. But, yeah, Ryan, whatever. are those ballet slippers on your shirt? What? <laughs> 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 the they're, they're, they're dog tags, numb nuts. Okay. I don't know. They look like ballet slippers. I can't believe it. Ballet slippers. My time at the New York Performing Arts Center. <laughs> Did you see, is it Nick, what, what, uh, Top Secret, where they go to the ballet? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking love that movie. That is such a great movie, dude. It's so good. Oh, oh I need to see it. I haven't seen it so such a long time. I need to see Your schnauzer good. is on my Wiener schnitzel. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That sounds like a Friday night type like mini series. Ryan has to go to oh. ballet. You know, that's gonna be Perry's next fucking intro. Thanks, Chris. Yeah, <laughs> you're welcome. Sensitivity training. 
<laughs> right, yeah, I would love to. I want to see Ryan in anger management. It'd be so funny. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh, well, yeah, I, 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 we, I hey, have to say, Ryan would be a good guys. ballet teacher. Should we have an? What? No, you wouldn't. <laughs> no, they yell at you like that sometimes. Oh. Back, you know. Stand up! Yeah. You're too fat. You're gonna, oh my god, your legs are not skinny enough. Yes, extra girls see me dance. Oh yes. Ooh. Yes. Um, yeah. I, pretty good. I, I, I could probably do it if sight. I was forced to. Um. You think we need an HR department? Maybe uh, Court of Black Garrett can be like my chief tokenism officer. Here at <laughs> yeah, I can take care of that. Yes, inclusion officer. Yeah, yeah tokenism at, at and inclusion. One point in time, Same thing. At one point in time, if you guys can believe it, uh, I was put in charge of uh, equal opportunity. Uh, and <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Okay, um, I was. I was. I was put in charge of equal opportunity stuff. Uh, at, at my at who my with command. a bad judge of character put you in that position? <laughs> there was a, hey, I'm just gonna say there was a lot of white men at the place, so we didn't have a lot of options. I'm just saying. all right. Man. That's why we operated so efficiently. <laughs> oh <laughs> Jesus! Oh my goodness! Yeah, that, I got a lot of stories about that shit, though. I bet you do. Stories. Mm -hmm. About white men. <laughs> no, about the oh, things we focus we on instead of war fighting. Oh. oh. I just seen this tweet from Star Wars UK, and I, I actually want to oh. slap it. What is it? Let's see it. Yeah, you know, just is it about the Galactic Star Cruiser. Han can't catch a break, can he? Oh, Watch God. Return of the Jedi and Solo on Disney Plus. No. Oh, I did not. I didn't even. Fuck I mean, I, I the film was terrible. I did they do this in Solo? Isn't he's in the mud though? Yeah, yeah he's, he's in the mud, oh, yeah. but it's like are they, are they saying that's supposed to be a visual foreshadowing of Carbonite? Yeah. Uh, yeah. It's, in the, oh, it's in the scene that. after he gets his name and after he meets Chewie oh. and before he gets the blaster. So it's one of those scenes. Is it oh my friend? god. Everything, Milking everything you've learned about Han Solo throughout the three original trilogy movies, it all happened in a span of 48 hours, and yeah. it's in this movie. <laughs> yeah. oh that God. is crazy. Han Solo stuck in mud, stuck in traffic, stuck in line. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually the film. That's pretty yeah. good, actually. Yeah. It's not bad at all. It's also... <laughs> God damn it. That movie's so fucking stupid. It's, it's the origin to story of all his gear. <laughs> How he met it's every the origin fan story of his name. Ever met. And his fucking ship, and his gun, and the his belt, was and great. his name. Fuck. You know, when, when Solo, Han Solo was like a down on his luck uh, guy who couldn't get a woman, who was subservient to every woman, and who was friends with a guy that fucked the robot up the ass. <laughs> no. But remember when Watch he, this film and you'll see. But remember when they made up a story just to make him and Leia go on their honeymoon on the new Galactic Star Cruiser? Oh. So that you can pretend I want a that you UV that bedroom. I want a UV that bedroom Damn. right now. Who who wouldn't love a story about what we clearly know ends in a tragic fucking divorce? Uh, and their child <laughs> growing up to be like the biggest villain in the fucking galaxy. And, that's and they wrote when he goes to the hotel. Memories. <laughs> it's, it's Disney canon that he sold uh, Luke and his medals for drinking money or whatever, right? Yes. Yeah. He sold like, oh, like Chewbacca. Yes. He's like, Chewbacca, I know you yeah. never got one of these. Look what I'm going to do with mine. I, I give so little of a fuck. I'm going to sell it for a Carillion <laughs> Ale. Um, Lord. Yeah, they treat him so, real well, sad. Disney canon, you know? Was um, this the Star great. Cruiser you were talking about? Oh God! No! Did she just swap swords there? Is that what happened? Yeah. I'm telling you, that is Daisy Ridley. There's no way the choreography can be this bad. Yeah. Oh, my God. oh my God! Oh shit, dude! Star Trek experience is better than this. And it closed in 2008. I've seen high school plays that yeah. have better fight scenes than this shit. <laughs> Oh no! Oh, wait. So, just so you know, so just so it's really clear that everyone understands what she did there. Yes. The the lightsaber that she lit up, the one that like you actually saw extend, that was like a big thing that they debuted. People thought they were going to be able to buy these and interact. Yeah. With them. yeah. Right. Right. It's literally just for that because it doesn't go back down. You have to like oh. actually like fucking smash it back down. Wow. So 
And she, she switches picks it up them. another one. Yeah. She puts the one that's real yeah. cool down, and then she yeah. picks up like uh, one for the duel. Wow, that was so natural looking too. Like you yeah. Yeah. totally yeah. missed yeah, it. Wasn't at all. Any, he looks so clumsy. They've been doing like stage oh trickery since before, like Shakespeare. You couldn't figure this out. Yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> I went to a, a Jurassic World experience for forty five dollars. Okay, I took my kids to a, for forty five dollars. <laughs> oh. The exact same level of quality. She didn't wow. even do those six thousand dollars. Look over there. <laughs> no, look at the kick you're right, right here. Adam, this kick is my favorite. Adam, you're you're right. Oh my god, what did she even kick? She kicked the air. It's like that she scene used the the force. when Bart Simpson was like, "I'm gonna kick the air, and if any part of you fills this air, that's your own fault." <laughs> that's on you. <laughs> and Ooh, co co correct me, co co correct me if I'm wrong. Because I don't. Did her and Kylo even have a fight with him in a mask in the movies? So they should. Well, no. they did in The Force Awakens, but mm. it was destroyed during Last Jedi. It was but remade the, no, but, during no, Rise he, of Skywalker. No, he had they, his they mask didn't. off in the end of The Force Awakens, right? I guess that's yeah, true, he yeah. dropped it. Yeah, he already, he already had it yeah. off. So, so yeah, so at no point in the films was he ever in that fucking mask, yet they've, they've tried to make that part of the marketing. God, yep. it's so bad, man. Well, that's because Adam Driver said, I will do this gig. As long as I get to cover my face up, right? <laughs> uh, well, well, look at this real so that Nobody can recognize right. who this is, and we can just say I'm a regular stunt guy. Well, well, can, can, if there's a face Skywalker begging to be covered up, I'm trying. Yeah, somewhere. in Rise of Skywalker, they remake his fucking helmet, mm -hmm. but donunt they like show it being remade in that movie yeah yes yeah so how does he it's have like that beginning. if it's in between last jedi and rise of skywalker because that's when this is supposed to be set because i think that's the least of this thing's because problem. Disney Star Wars <laughs> yeah. oh, oh no it, it absolutely is uh but but it just continues to show that they have no there's no continuity there's no focus of anything so i'm sharing my screen i, I talked about this in my video so this is so from lynn testa lynn testa i've known who lynn testa is for a long time he runs touring plans very very knowledgeable on disney the theme parks inner workings i've known of this guy for over a decade so he tweeted this out uh, with the Galactic Star Cruiser media embargo ending tomorrow. This is, I think it's yesterday. So many writers are about to tell you how great this is. Don't believe it themselves. Mm. Uh, Disney's pressuring media outlets to say only positive things from Ooh. people inside right now. Uh, the talk among the media is interesting. $6,000, no way. Problem is, I don't think anyone will print that. And uh, we get to the event and are told that if you don't write positive stories, you're not going home while a guy wow. stands there menacingly behind <laughs> oh, the spokesperson with brass knuckles. Now, 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 no, now that's again, a fucking as joke, he says, obviously. yeah, yeah, yeah. no, yeah, because he says yeah. the second joke, one is yeah. obviously high, high per, uh, you know, hyperbole, but obviously, but it shows that everyone who gets an invite knows exactly what Disney expects out of them from the media event. Um, there will certainly be people who come out of the Star Cruiser who genuinely think it's the best thing ever. And if that's your honest opinion, great. No beef there. I'm thrilled you, uh, that, you're, uh, that you got to do it. But if you work for an independent media outlet that has 100,000 or a million readers uh, you, and you write something positive that you don't actually believe, the question is, who are you trying to help with this? Because it's not the consumer. Uh, Disney knows uh, that exclusive access to these events brings millions of clicks. Uh, most of the websites earn their money through ad revenue. Uh, for most of these sites, ad revenue is the life cycle. Disney exploits that with pressure campaigns. Uh, I, this is 100% on point. Okay, we're, we're, Again, we, are, we cover the theme park stuff. These theme park people hate us. They hate us because we are there like this is dog shit. And they are all trying their best to say, oh, it's the greatest thing ever. It's the greatest thing ever. It is dog shit. Just like Galaxy's Edge was dog shit. It's terrible. Me and Gary have been there. Galaxy's Edge is terrible. It does not represent Star Wars in any capacity. Now all of the Disney parks, all of the trailers are either being ratioed or close to being ratioed over on the Disney Parks YouTube channel. People are not happy about this. It sucks. It is terrible. And the, the footage we're seeing just continues to, to confirm everything we've been saying. It's really bad. And I'm loving it. I'm loving it's that they're getting roasted. It's worse than I thought it would be. <laughs> yeah, like, it yeah, it really is. is. Food. Yeah, it's way worse. <laughs> oh, the, the food, Adam? Uh, I'm I, curious. Like, Disney food just is not good. There's no. space pizza. Oh, God. And space spaghetti. <laughs> 
I mean, for six thousand bucks. Oh, there I'm was actually lobster. No, yeah. Well, dude, no. I'm joke. thinking it sucks my uh, my dick. That's what I should there fucking do for six thousand dollars. There is a blue lobster? milk and a green milk dispenser. <laughs> oh. I'm staying away from the green milk. Okay. The yeah. green milk is dog shit. The blue milk is great. That's the report. The green milk there. turns you into oh, a really? fucking mm, pussy. Fox jizz. No. Yeah. Wrong franchise. Wow. It's my. like the Hulk green ketchup. It wasn't the franchise. It was the fact that you went. Uh, you, okay. You went to Hulk. I, I was watching a. Uh, uh, green. Drunk stream. And I guess somebody said that uh, they think the uniforms are repurposed. Um, they are. They're uh, repurposed from Star Tours. Star Tours, yeah. Oh, that was, that was wow. confirmed. Wow. Like, uh, I did a video about like. A couple months ago, someone okay. caught that shit. Yeah. And uh, yeah, they, they didn't Tours. even create new shit for this. Well, wow. it, again, it kind of, and I've talked about this multiple times. Disney, the Imagineers at Disney can do unbelievable things when the right mindset is there. So like the land of avatar, James Cameron mm -hmm. was involved with that. Mm -hmm. James Cameron, crazy enough. And you get the creator of something to work with Disney Imagineers and there's no agenda involved. You can do something incredible. I don't like the avatar movie, but I go to the land of avatar at animal kingdom and I'm truly blown away. It's incredible. Disney star Wars. This is, this just represents what Disney has been doing with star Wars. This is completely doesn't it doesn't feel like Star Wars? It doesn't represent Star Wars. It's trash, and people are looking at this, going, "This is bad." Now, a lot of these shill sites, uh, these YouTube channels that will suck uh, Mickey's dick for just anything at the parks, they are trying their best to offset the negativity, and they really don't like the negativity that that people are are having towards this. But it's happening, and even just random Disney park fans are looking at this, going, "This isn't good." This is not good. And a lot of these people, gen genuine fans, get genuinely excited for this. And even they're looking at this and they're rejecting it. So, yeah, try yeah to this is what happens when you build a subpar product and roll it yeah. out to the people. If they actually went and cared about the product, they could build an actual experience for people. Well, they did. But no, it's basically Star Tours. Star, Tour, Star Tours is is infinitely better than than galaxy's edge the indiana so jones fun. the indiana yes. jones ride at disneyland is freaking brilliant it's uh yeah. great get it girl <laughs> oh, yeah. so, uh, oh, oh, oh so god talking. what is this Goodness. supposed to be that's a dj it's a dj so i mean is it like a it looks DJ. like a worm person like is this what that's character Greedo. is this Okay. Uh, what they called R Ron R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R R no, I was trying to explain this to to my wife because she's not uh, as much into Star Wars, but she loves the Harry Potter. I'm like, imagine if they made a park surrounding, uh, uh, made a park inspired completely by the Fantastic Beast universe. Yes. That's a yes. great fucking yeah. analogy. Of like, it. And that, didn't that even is. do that right. Yeah, that is a great. And because again, I, I've talked about like I've never really been a Harry Potter person, mm -hmm. and I went to Universal uh, about a year ago with the uh, with Jay and the Park Hopper crew, and man, I, I saw that. And I'm like, this is amazing. Mm -hmm. I want to know more about Harry Potter because this land is so cool. You go to Star Wars. Uh, you go to Galaxy's Edge and you're like, man, I really want to learn more about Iraq since this is basically inspired by <laughs> like, Iraq. Because yeah, of what it looks you like, like laser my it, memories you, away? Yeah, you, <laughs> so so if, it would be like if you made the Wizarding World of Harry Potter, Harry Potter Land, but you made it about Fantastic Beasts. And instead yep. of putting it in Hogsmeade or in Diagon Alley, you made up some random place in the middle of the UK that wasn't a part of anything. And yeah. you decided that Harry Potter and his friends once visited there. Literally, all you have is a poster. It. You have like a poster of like the greatest wizards of all time, and that's that's the one thing <laughs> they have. Yeah. 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 No, and and wow. uh, we all did videos on this. This is Kathleen Kennedy's idea. They wanted they wanted to do Star Wars. They, they initially wanted to do Star Wars. She's like, no, nah, nobody's gonna be in. No, what she didn't she say fifty year old fans? That that's when she made the comment like nobody cares what a fifty year old fan thinks or some wow. shit like something that. like that. Yeah, that's well, what we like want, we want to get rid of the fifty year old fan or something. Yeah, that's yeah. what like an ex VP of the parks leaked or something yes. like that. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Yes. Uh, and now they're gonna have to change it all. They, I mean, they you know they're gonna have to do that. It, Within a couple of years, it'll be going through a complete revamp. Six thousand dollars for a family of four, or it's like oh, twenty four hundred for two. You can well, go. You can go. I put. I responded to Nina Infinity on this. You can go to fucking Egypt and Jordan and a Nile cruise for sixteen days. 
for Jesus. like three thousand bucks right now. But can they wow. guarantee a murder stay on the home? home. Instead That's of going to a shithole country. I, yeah, I, I would but is Ray Skywalker going to turn up with a bad lightsaber? I don't know. <laughs> no, Wonder Woman will. And she'll say, you can okay, kill people, denial. <laughs> people were sort of in costume. You could ask to my kids. Do they give away, do they like costume no, people? No, you have to pay $150 no. for the, yeah. like, the costumes from <gasps> the Chandrilla collection. But what? look, but look, look, but it's collection. gotta be, it has to be understood, okay? Walt Disney World is the busiest place on the planet. Mm -hmm. I'm serious. Like the, the, the numbers that that place and, and then Universal's mm -hmm. puts insane numbers up to Orlando's the most visited tourist destination, uh, surpassed mm -hmm. New York a few years ago, surpassed Vegas, all of that. Like you don't understand how many people come there. It is insane. And these people spend a lot of money. Now, when you hear things like the, the people that aren't, knowledgeable about theme parks or know about like they'll hear like it's almost like what i don't even want to know what it is now i think it's like 200 dollars for a single day admission to walt disney world right now or something like that that's oh, not Jesus including food Christ. that's not including all this shit that's based on the market and universal has the same exact prices universal and disney essentially have the same prices to go in their park and that's based on the market that's based on the fact that their parks are packed so that's crazy the point i'm that trying is to crazy. make here the point i'm trying to make here is they already have a massive install base there's already a massive amount of people that go down there to spend all this money and it's going to give them a bump but what but the the most important part here is that i've seen launches at these theme parks i've seen harry potter i've seen cars land i've seen pandora i've seen you know uh new fantasy land i've seen all of these new releases and they've all been relatively good even from the general theme park fans they are being very critical of this that's the big problem for Disney right now. Even the regular <clears throat> people are. So it, it's going to be interesting to see how it all plays out. Yeah. And the problem with it, Jeremy, is that it, uh, unlike those other things that are accessible, you know, that as soon as you buy a ticket to Universal, whatever land and Universal you're going to, like you can walk in there and you can try it and you can give it a shot for yourself without having to pay six grand to be locked in there like a fucking prisoner for 48 hours. Yeah, that's that, my that's question. What Is there ins about. and outs or am I? No, you, okay, you are I'm going on a mission. <laughs> Did yes. any of this stuff pan out? Because I mean, I'm reading some crazy stuff from from 2001. They're saying an immersive experience, role playing, uh, lightsaber training, working with the bridge crew, droid racing. None yep. of this stuff panned out. Yes, all, well, all of it do, does, but when you see what it is, it the did. lightsaber right. training. You want to know what the lame. lightsaber training is? It's you stand there about 10 feet away from the wall, and uh -huh. they send, like, a, a light that way, and you're supposed to intercept it with your lightsaber. Mm, like this. Okay. That's the lightsaber training. So that it's you just over-promising and under-delivering. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And, and you do, like, Typical have, Disney. Like, it basically looks like a, a scaled-up version of Galaga, is like mm -hmm. the op interacting with the bridge crew, but you, you're on there for 48 hours and you have to be at every certain place at a certain time because it's all scripted out because it's supposed to wow. be this immersive experience for everyone. But that's the reason like the rooms are so small. They don't want you in your room. They want you out there paying $16 for a drink uh, of alcoholic blue milk <laughs> and all that shit. Oh, wow. Okay. So yeah. it's, uh, th that's the thing that makes this part tough to, to see the response to because the general public can't do it. You have to pay forty eight hundred bucks for a couple, or six thousand mm -hmm. bucks for your family of four to actually right. go and do this. It just here's looks the, here's so the lame. Fancy, here's the fancy truck. I'm sharing my screen. Here's the fancy truck uh, that they uh, transport their guests oh <laughs> for just wow. six thousand dollars. You and your Whoa. family can, can be transported yeah, in truck. this. Yeah, I that's, feel that's like I'm going only, into space. The only time that you get to leave. Is when you go, they transfer you in this, which you they take you to Auschwitz, which is going to be full of Mexicans. <laughs> so, good at squeezing. I would almost rather go to the place someone else said <sighs> than go to where they're taking you because they're taking you to Galaxy's Edge so you can spend more money. There. No! <laughs> yeah. At least Auschwitz oh, takes you. Now, what did you get? Welcome like, to Disney. Like, like, bring oh. money. There's what do you get people, a base there's driver? More people that take smiling selfies there than at Galaxy's Edge. I can guarantee you that. Now, what did you get a base driver who was a part of the Canadian convoy? <laughs> They could. That's what I want to know. They couldn't. Have, paint, they couldn't have put a slap some Star Wars paint on the freaking like make the, it look the thing like is, Gary, like you won't ship. actually see it because. So the only part that is, if you click on it, Jeremy, so you can actually make it bigger. Yeah. Um. So the only part you'll see is the side of it. 
Right. And that's like the door they put people through because it'll be up against the side of a yeah, building, yeah. basically. Oh, that is okay. so, so low effort. you don't know that you're in that. Everyone else can see <laughs> the loading thing. Still, yeah. mm -hmm. that is yeah. low effort as hell. Like, it's so God, bad. It really it's is terrible. Yeah. Man, all that for me, and it's like, this is the 50-person one. Oh. 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 Are you blindfolded I mean, it, it, while you're in here as well? Shackled Probably. in like cattle. <laughs> All sardines. Oh are you God. are you chained up and blindfolded with a hood over your head? So it's a two day immersive experience. That's awful. that's the Fifty Shades of Grey experience. Ad. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah. Unfortunately, I I'd bought pay the, for that. I'd go to that. I bought the you're you're gonna get raped by sun people uh, experience uh, from Disney. <laughs> I can't wait. Sounds um, rough. Imagine even for the Shmi special. Imagine oh, even oh, if it was oh, like oh, no. even if it was awesome and you know kind of exactly what you know we would want imagine like a parent like and your child convinces you to go there and you pay thousands of dollars a night and you're just stuck there for 48 hours oh, kill like me. you can't it do it so anything else. Like, you turn that around be hung over and miss a thing turn, turn, like yeah turn that around what if you're a kid that your parents are like these huge star wars fans and you could give a oh. fuck oh. you gotta go oh. with your parents it's gonna be terrible Ow. And yeah, good luck mm -hmm. being on time anywhere with a couple of little kids. Uh, Credit to my kids luck. who got us so deeply get invested in get... our story on Star Wars Galaxy Cruisers that the experience with both of a dizzy blur and was one ending up with caring so much about that we cried when it was over. Oh, uh, one hundred percent. These kids are crying. Why? Yeah. Tears yeah. of joy, more yeah. like. God. That was yeah. actually when God, it is over. They, they were crying yeah. because they tried to make them wear masks. Actually, so, <laughs> yeah, that's what happened. They Those kids do not look away. happy. They don't Those look. Those kids happy are like they all. just found out Joe Biden's president. That's what they look like. <laughs> like that, is, that is terror. No, terror. Like, we don't care about Star Wars. We don't know what it is. <laughs> Mommy, why you dress me up in a bathrobe? Why did you yeah. take me to the Vagrant Queen experience? Because that's what it looks like. Like, I'm the only person. Why did you buy me this should be me special? Six thousand dollars and you get that to wear. No, you, you have, have to pay, pay for, for that. You have to Fuck, pay, you for, that. pay yeah. for these. Holy shit. Oh, yeah, 150 bucks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's you gotta pay for them. Wow. What the fuck? And 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 this has got hasn't this got like uh, things that every Star Wars fan wants, like a woman's boutique where you can buy dresses. Like woman's touch. Sorry. <laughs> no, but no, it's true. It's just like it's weird. This weird, is what Dis weird. All right, so you think Disney fans just like fucking uh, soccer moms in their forties and fifties that want to buy fucking dresses that's worn by some bint on the stage that's squealing some fucking horrible tune? Oh yeah, uh, darling, I really must get that for when I go home. While she's fighting for her race's right to exist or something. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. That's it's part of mommy. What is this? <laughs> That's part of Gaia's storyline and the reason Gary broke his computer screen. Yes. That's yes. yep. <laughs> why well, I have a brand new monitor right here. Because the internet worry, Gary, you're probably going to interact with for 30 These videos minutes. are going to pay for it. With an Dude, <laughs> I need the video of her talking about, you know, social justice for, for her species or whatever. Jesus I need Christ. that. Justice I, for really, my people. Really like lives matter. Breaking. Uh, I actually have a picture inside the box truck from oh, Disney God. Star Wars. Oh, yes. Uh, right <laughs> there. <laughs> oh, no. Are you sure that's the right knock? <laughs> oh, <laughs> Must have swung by the uh, Texas border. <laughs> Shut up, <laughs> Renee. Everything I imagined it would be. Oh, Renee. <laughs> <laughs> Hashtag the magical Disney's experience. complicit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is so good. <laughs> Everybody follow oh, Renee, dude. Uh, and and yeah. Uke, they're both great. <laughs> what Only the best from Renee. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to at Disney in right now. <laughs> oh, oh. Yeah, can't wait to experience best. Galaxy's Edge. I missed the best part <laughs> of that meme. I missed, I missed the best part of that meme. Hang is on. Is there right something here. in there? Yeah, that's the uh. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, <Kat>. uh. <laughs> one more taxpayer <laughs> not funding your bad <laughs> idea. Yes, that wasn't on there. Don't recognize that. Uh. <laughs> 
Oh, shit. <laughs> a face that launched a thousand memes. Listen, listen, I, I want to I, like, I make sure that no matter how big Gary's channel gets, no matter how much of a star he becomes, that face always has to be used for his memes. Yes. Always. <laughs> it is the greatest <laughs> meme face ever. Especially because it's not like it got captured in a random live stream. No. He posted that himself. He's I like, was, 10 year difference. Dude, this was like before the channel got big, right? So I'm just like, ah, I just put some you never know what shit's gonna haunt you later on, dude. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> Like a ten year challenge. I still don't know what you were thinking about during that phase. Why did you uh, post that? It's it's like a mix of I didn't give a shit like what kind of picture I put up, obviously. <laughs> it, it, it's it's like the face, a mix between wow, I just ran over someone's cat and, <laughs> and or, or then just I'm like absolutely And did I leave the gas on? <laughs> <laughs> did I leave the oven on? <laughs> <laughs> he's like trying to make the, the decision the mall? whether uh, to turn around and tell the people whose cat you uh, that's that's I like, think uh, I may have pooped my pants yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was more than a fart <laughs> it was a shark it was a shark <laughs> that's definitely like oh damn I'm gonna the his pants oh, the rest of the stream. Thing I keep hearing about <laughs> yep uh, uh, <laughs> yep, yep, oh, yep. I own great. it, baby. I own it. Uh, <laughs> hey, oh, John, C John Cena left a super chat. <gasps> no, no. <laughs> he said, I How can you, how can you, yeah, how can you see it? I don't thought you can. John Cena's John Cena's uh, for twenty dollars says pick a voice first as you are the bestest ever. <laughs> <laughs> would, you, would you let me spoon you if I said Taiwan was a country? As is love. Uh, John, I'm still not following thank, you though. Thank you for the twenty dollars. I know you follow me, but I'm still not following you, John. I'm, I'm just... you, you didn't follow him back. You didn't follow oh. him back. Dude, that's all right. That's okay. Wow. That's cold, man. That's cold. That's cold. That's cold. No, no, no. no. Me, and, like me and Ryan, me and Ryan were talking about it the other day, but it, yeah, it was like, not like you specifically, but when you posted that, and I was like, as is freaking out over John Cena, I'm like 400,000 people following. But if you didn't follow him back, Chad that's a move, bro. Yeah, Chad, Chad move. move. That's yeah. Chad as fuck, right? Yeah. Cold, dude. So, that's um, probably yeah. how he got to that's 14 cold. million yeah. followers. Yeah. Like, <laughs> he follows yeah. people hoping they'll follow him back, and he unfollows. <laughs> so why you do I don't want to be used. <laughs> I don't want to have my heart broke. <laughs> mm. don't, I'm going to check see if he's still following me. You got to hang about. Uh oh. Yeah, he's, he's still following. He's still following me. Okay. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and it's three hundred eighty-six thousand eight hundred yeah. people that he follows. Okay, that's crazy. So, are you one of them? Are you one of them? Jeremy, I don't know. Um, didn't make see. it into the club. No, I didn't wow. make one either. Exclusive. I just gave him a John. follow. We'll see if he follows me back. I'm, I'm hoping. Follow me. Um, John, I follow no, I can follow the back. Club. No, no, John but, Cena, but I follow back people who follow me. <laughs> I'm gonna no, follow him though if he follows me. I'm no, following what right I, now. He, he's not following me, but to to just to solidify that he will never follow me, I'm gonna tweet. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm gonna. Oh my god! I'm, I'm gonna. Jeremy, I'm, I'm you to, fuck up my follow. If you I'm, about to, up my I'm follow. tweeting right now. I'm tweeting Cena right now, and I'm saying Trump 2024, and he'll never oh, no. follow me. No, 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 and then he unfollows me, I'm gonna be like real mad. So, now he'll never follow me now, he'll probably block me if anything. Now, 
It wasn't that guy's whole shtick like he was all about America. What Ray. <laughs> Remember Ray. when Luke and oh Leia were fucking hell? She looks over at YouTube. She's just like, oh I have no fucking God. clue what my like, oh my God. <laughs> I'm a Scott. Uh, uh, I'm Ray. I'm Ray Skywalker. It's, yeah, it's Ray. <laughs> I'm right Man, something. The heroin <laughs> really, hit, really hit Leia hard there. Yeah. <laughs> the that spice, was, that sorry, was, that was Carrie Fisher two minutes before the plane took off. That's that's see, that's the kind of shit that I want Dis that it could actually get me invested in Disney Star Wars. <laughs> Instead of being like, they went on a honeymoon to the Galactic Star Cruiser. I want to hear a story about on that Star Cruiser. They thought they're gonna live happily ever after, but instead Han loses a bunch of money playing Sabak. He uh, does a bunch of spice in the bathroom, uh, Ryan, and then Leia catches him space, fucking that space guy. Space bingo. Bingo. <laughs> That's when everything happened. Like started to go wrong. That would be entertaining. Show me that. Be down. How about this? That would be good. Uh, <laughs> a sex slave story. No, 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 no. Oh, no. no. Oh, someone's been doing crunches. Why, why would you? Uh, hold on. Stop that. Like, oh, think of, yes, look at that. Why wouldn't you clap. just put like my whole head on there instead of like chopping off my face like a goddamn serial killer? <laughs> this is better. Oh, it makes it so it much looks better. better this way. It looks yeah, much yeah. funnier. Like, yeah. and also, I have this question. Yeah. Why is your face not sunburned? or something i mean yeah did you put like a mask over it and then <laughs> well he's that white masked up? he's just that white the face i just never <laughs> i just never turn into the sun there oh you uh, were a mandalorian and they took your helmet <laughs> off and, uh, yeah and one uh, hole made his way i know <laughs> well, for, Kevin. I, I for one appreciate i appreciate the intent of uh making the meme look really bad with the face like I do that. Too. ryan doesn't understand yeah. meme etiquette yeah. clearly it's disturbing so. <laughs> how easy it probably was to find the rainbow fucking star wars logo oh uh, but yeah that was probably the yeah. easiest yeah. thing to find very easy yeah mm. oh Good you name. guys are great i was just going through and uh <laughs> oops ray girl i just saw that oh oh people have been i like to retweet everybody's like showing their meal or their booze before watching the show Wow. They're boo. They're what? They're booze. Not yeah, they're booze. Booze. Oh. booze is good too, though. Uh, at a large oh, yes. uh, now that I'm definitely interested in this tour. Yeah. <laughs> you can find those in the DMs. Hey, I got to read a super chat from last week. Uh, uh, X-ray girl missed it, so she was uh, reprimanded. Wow! Wow! Throw her under the bus. No. Fire uh, her. Uh, no, no, we all missed it. Uh, <laughs> Axel we, Ray Go. We, we desperately Axel Ray diversity. Girl. Hold on, let me go <laughs> beat her. Axel Ray Go. Axel Ray Girl. It's, uh, from it's, uh, from Ray Biz. Biz. it's from KBiz4. Axel Ray Girl. 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 It came after the show ended for one thousand dollars wow, what the wow. Hell? wow. Oh, what wow. The hey whoa hey who is this man who what? is this man uh k-biz k-biz you assume it's a man just because oh yeah k-biz yeah, yeah. <laughs> don't miss gender what's up k-biz didn't you didn't we do this last week no we did no he did you read it on real bbc one. as well i read it on real bbc but I'm gonna read yeah. it on Friday Night Tights too. Oh, all that serious, was on Real BBC, right? Okay. Um, all seriousness, ah, I hope Texas. It's all the kicks, same shit. It really is. <laughs> wow. We're just wow, wow, wow. All, uh, all seriousness, I hope Texas kicks ass, Gary. It does. <laughs> Uh, what I've seen of it, which has been a, all of an hour and a half right now. Uh, come visit in Florida sometime, <laughs> and I will be there. I will be in Florida in October. October. Big right. fucking meetup. Whenever that is, wherever it is, we have no idea, yeah. but we're working on it. We're working We've on it. We've gotten a few so, prices. We're still oh, yeah, still way. trying to pin things down. Irons in the in the fryer. Is that the expression? Yes. I, I think it's in the fryer, not the fryer. Fire, fryer. Fire in the fryer. Jumping well, in. Chips are in the fryer. If you're, <laughs> black, if you're black, it's in the fryer. Yeah, yeah. You guys everything fry everything. Fry. We know. We get it. But yeah, I think it's in the fire. Russia would have killed me by then, so. <laughs> yeah, good uh, luck. Mikey Gussler for $50. Thank you, Mikey. Mikey. <laughs> I wonder what this is about. My setup isn't up yet. So, yeah, I'm looking way over there at a screen <laughs> that I had to set up like two minutes before the show. Uh, uh, yes. 
It's about the air cut. More photos of the air cut released today. According to Midnight Sedge, they are going to announce it next month. So that's uh, why they're uh, they are released. This will be better than Jeff John's cut of the film, just like Snyder's was better than Whedon. Ah, uh, poor Jeff John's. He can't ca- catch a break. Can't catch a break. Um, hey, he, he should keep bad. writing comic books. He should. <laughs> he should. He's better at it, uh, quite frankly. And uh, yeah. I'll watch an air cut, though. Hell yeah. Watch the hell out of it. I'll review it. Is it it worth writing a modern day comic nowadays? Not really. (laughs) No. No. No, maybe that's why so many comic book writers are throwing in the towel. Uh, That Grant Morrison thing that came out three, three, four days ago, where he basically just like regrettably is quitting everything and kind of apologetic for some of the shit he did in comics because it got twisted. Uh, Alan Moore did something similar to that, too. He, He Got a little yeah. yeah, he did. Uh, for everybody just remaking the Watchmen and redoing the Watchmen, and now we've broken down heroes so much we can't reconstruct them. But it's partially because the people who are getting hired don't know what a fucking hero is. Uh, yeah, true. that's mm-hmm. they yeah. think heroes are villains. Mm-hmm. Yep, because they're villains. Yes, because they think good is bad and bad is good. Yep, mm-hmm. they, t- they talk about it in the Bible. This is a big. Yeah, book. I was gonna so, say like I am no theologian. But I remember that from the Bible. So yeah, Odin heroes was that in the Bible? Pull it out! Pull it out! Um, <laughs> get, get it out! Get, get it, it out! Get it out! Do we have a get chapter? It out. Do we have uh, a chapter? I think it was we in do? Isaiah. It was Isaiah somewhere? Anyway. Isaiah Thomas. Okay. Yes. yes. I'll get back. You wrote to the you. Bible. I'll get back yeah. to you. Oh, cool. Very yeah, talented. Yeah, you- <laughs> <laughs> it's tough to tell whether you're quoting Isaiah verses from the Bible or just Isaiah Thomas stat line. Uh, 3110. <laughs> <laughs> Aye, that is a good one. That would be yeah. 31 points, 10 assists, not rebounds. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 No rebounds from Isaiah Thomas. What the deuce? Well, uh, Isaiah. Why you... Well, there is no Isaiah 3110, interestingly. Damn enough. it. Woe to those who call evil good. There's only and good nine evil. verses in, in chapter 31 of Isaiah. <laughs> <laughs> just missed it. Oh well. Woe to those. Did we Woe find to it? those who call evil good and good evil, who put darkness for light and light for darkness, who bitter oh, wow. sweet and sweet for bitter. Whoa. Woe to those who are wise in their own eyes and shred in their own sight. True. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Impressive. Boom. But what you didn't expect that. What's this, what's this book, is, what's this book is, called again? <laughs> well, it's called the the Bible. Have thick thighs. The Bibliotech. It's Bibliotech. Bibliotech. Isaiah five twenty to twenty one. The only oh. book to outsell Lord of the Rings, I think. The Bible. The Bible. Yes, the Bible. Yeah. Oh, similar I thought it was respect of Superman, theme. son of Krypton, number five by Tom <laughs> Taylor. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you listen to Tom Taylor, then yeah. Nobody listens to Tom what Taylor. You that call evil I thought it was Vagrant evil. Queen by Max Visaggio. That put- I actually no, thought the quote that, uh, off of a sci-fi. And I actually thought the quote that Garrett was reading was Alex Jones, October 2021. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah. That put bitter for sweet and sweet for bitter. Yeah. Hey, Friday Night Tights, Bible verses, dick jokes. We there get you go. biblical here. It's, yep. it's the come to Jesus moment. We gotta it even is. it out. Mm-hmm. We, we gotta use the old the old school Dewey Reams version. There you go. All We're all gonna give it seven here. days for the Ukraine stuff. Though. We like our audience. <laughs> They're smart. We don't want to talk about sexism and gaming unless it's like more of it. As he said, we gotta, Ed said we got to give seven days to talk about Ukraine. It's, it's way less than uh, Biden's. He said, come back to me in 30. Come back to me in a month. And talk about yeah. it. What's that you we're better not. Hey, Russia, what is that playing? Not. What is playing? That was that's my, this my, It's always ass. It's always ass. <laughs> All right. That's contrary. Perhaps we could get one of the females to breastfeed you. <laughs> yeah, next <laughs> year. It's really low. Oh, he was on Buffy too. That, that guy. Um, yes, he was. He was uh, Buford T. Justice for ninety nine, ninety nine. Buford. Buford. Uh, this guy's a legend, man. 
uh, yeah. to all those that listen to Sargon of Akkad, this is probably from yesterday, uh, just be aware that he knows less about international relations than he knows about pop culture, which is to say nothing at all. <laughs> Fight your own wars, Europe. <laughs> America isn't coming to save you this time. There he goes. Shout out to Buford T. Justice. Buford. 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 Roasting Sargon. That's funny. I like Sargon. I like, I like Sargon. Sargon a lot. I did too. Really too. The, there was this moment where like Drinker and Sargon go back and forth whether America will invade. Me and Gary just have to look at each other like, so. Yeah. <laughs> Lord of the Rings. Lord of the Rings. Like, yeah. Dude. <laughs> that Lord of the Rings. I'm eh? on Drinker's Ooh. channel. And I know shit about this, so I'm like, I don't know what to say. I don't like war. War bad. I don't like a war game. <laughs> war bad. Yeah, war game. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, if you if if you if you want to know about war what's going game. on, just go to Twitter. This is what you're gonna get yeah. right Hell here yeah. over on Twitter. Just go to Twitter. Sharing you're my screen right now. That, just go to Twitter. There you That's go. Like the worst. <laughs> <of God. laughs> yes. <laughs> you know, I'm something of a Ukrainian. Oh, wow. That's so good. Holy shit. It's pretty fucking accurate. <laughs> oh, poor Will Defoe. I like how they subtly made him fatter too. Like that's good. <laughs> that's the greatest thing I've ever seen in my life. The right to bear oh, memes is a great. The right to bear memes account. is fantastic. Account. <laughs> Highly recommend right. following. Awesome. Oh awesome my memes. god. So, yeah. <laughs> that is so That is good. Twitter right there. That is Personify, Twitter. dude. I want a poster yeah. of that on my wall. Shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it, it's so true. Yeah. And, and it, it it applies to it applies to both sides too. Because yeah. there, there's people yeah. that just want like just want to go in there. You gotta you gotta tell Putin yeah, you can't cross yeah, it. You gotta totally. do this. It's like it, you wanna start World War Three over yeah. Ukraine. Yeah. My yeah, thing is like, yo, really let's not do any do. of that, man. I don't like the idea of us going into open war at all at the at the moment right now. We cannot do it. I mean, nope. if you watch the the army commercials, we definitely are not prepared at all. <laughs> right. Those yeah. brave and beautiful two gay mothers, like, uh, it's not going to work out. We yeah. just, yeah. This this would this is not some, uh, hey, going to Afghanistan, going to Iraq. This is a different this fucking story. Totally different. Yeah. This is yep. a different geopolitical oh, nightmare. Yes. This is. Completely. Well, I'm a bit of an expert on World War One now because I watched The King's Man uh, a couple yeah. days ago. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, that totally makes you an expert. Uh, yeah, but it got me to like look up World War One a little more, and yeah. it's like little things can kick into much, much bigger things. Yep. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh yeah. And, uh, I, I got another right to be. You should watch 1917 <laughs> instead. Oh, <laughs> 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 yes. Yes. There it is. There what it is. is. What is you <laughs> you <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> It does. Yeah, it does kind of. Yeah, he's it looks like, like he's quarter black without the fashion him. sense. Yeah, you would have to work out. Yeah. So all I want to know is pounds. who took that photo of me and why? <laughs> <laughs> and why what, did you looks, make that meme? Is that from Idiocracy? Is that where that screen screen cap is from? No, I think that dude's just a. He's like one of those stock photo guys. You know, like, oh, the, yeah. like the why like would the there smiley be a stock old man? photo of that guy? Like, no, no, like, trust me, it's like there. Simil Lou. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> hey, so, so since, since Quarter Black's uh, fashion is is being discussed, so this was a debate that we had. This was a debate. Uh, we took this picture, and oh, someone no. said. Jeremy, feed the homeless veteran behind you. So I thought it was a right, but, but Quarter Black actually does look like the veteran, the homeless veteran. Like he, does. he looks like a yeah. Vietnam vet. Yeah, he does. Yeah. Yeah. I don't like to talk about my time in Nam. He looks, he looks like he's on a wheelchair in the corner just fucking ranting. <laughs> Just Lieutenant Danning it up. You, yeah. you know how, how Charlie dresses and it's always sunny when he wants to look like an injured war veteran? <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's what he looks like. I'll take but a comparison I, to Charlie I, every day. I assumed it was about me because I I had the fucking sweatshirt on again that I had on when I got called homeless in Boston. And I actually am a veteran. So we need the person yeah. who said that. To fucking to tell us who you fucking met. yeah your yeah. hair is not long enough to look like a homeless vet i don't know where's the comment at yeah, but mine like, is that's what that's exactly. what fusion is exactly. yeah. 
Who knows? God bless you, Jeremy, for my back that. Like, no. <laughs> Do you mean Brian or quarterback? Yeah, we need clarification. <laughs> clarification. Uh, I think it's pretty clear. <laughs> pretty clear. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's so funny. Ryan looks like a Y'all fed. just mad. Y'all just mad. Garrett looks like a homeless vet. That <laughs> my hair's. I will my take this as a compliment. That Thank you. To be a fed too. I got standards. Oh man. Hey, y'all want crazy shit. Y'all want to see Grace Randolph react to Lord of the Rings? I do. Oh, <laughs> oh no. I have not really. seen this. Oh, my God, it's I so bad. It's this. So this is bad. gonna be gold. I've saved He's it. like, so He's so trying bad. so hard not to say anything negative. I've got my cock out. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> Hold on. Well, you didn't have it out before Cena. when she was here. <laughs> How do you know? Not that you can see. How do you know? <laughs> That's my Grace is, it's Grace's always hair looked way better before. <laughs> Just really? what I'm saying. Mm. Disheveled, you know? Look like a beaten wife. No, I mean before I, tonight. Grace, Grace looks like she gets laid a lot based on her hair. <laughs> right. So. Or she's just actually the walk of shame. Does it own a 24-7 bedhead. Yeah. Bed hair. Well, she's constantly getting fucked by Disney, so. Hey yo! Oh. She getting fucked or is she doing the sucking? She gets a lot of free stuff. Well, yeah. Oh my god, I almost, I almost Sucky shared that, Garrett. I'm so glad I didn't. Oh shit! Yeah. Wow, I'm just so not going to share anything. I'm just going to let you do your thing. Okay. So, <laughs> so we're waiting for the Grace Randolph. Yeah, where's Disney? Grace? Where we- like she's yeah. in bed. She's in bed with a guy. Happened? She's like, I'm going to wait and yeah. see. I don't know. Garrett's <laughs> looking it up. I got it. Yeah. I just didn't want to show that was there. It was all your oh. all your dick pics. <laughs> no. All my dick pics. I was yeah. trying to. Share. I was about to share those. <clears> yeah. I'm so, so lost with what's going on. Well, he's got a file of them, you know, so he can send them out. Yeah, like, everybody what, meets. What is, we you talked about it on trying you. Trying to solve here, world so. hunger here, Garrett? What the fuck's taking <laughs> so long? I am hungry. I thought Gary was getting it, so I was looking at <laughs> the, you know, keto. my dick so pics. I was appreciating. Yeah. <laughs> Were you we got, like Grace Randolph oh, hot or something? Grace Randolph hot? Is that what Where's you this bitch? Grace uh, beyond now, the trailer. Now, what do you say? Where's this bitch? It's very hard to find on her channel. It took me a minute. Yeah. Rings of power. She probably put of rings power. of power. Rings of power. Rings. rings. Is it further back or is it? Oh, here it is. Got it. Got, got it. it. Got, got it. it. Got it. Oh, God. She's fucking so annoying. Okay. <laughs> That's how you know what? I got it. Wow. Okay. Why would you say that? <laughs> wow. Well, here it is. <laughs> oh, oh, my. Oh, oh boy. That is a there. terrible Good picture baller. of her. Oh, Who's that right. with the pink top and the big milkers? What? I'm asking for a friend. Uh, what? They're gone now. He clicked it off now. Oh, I clicked it off. All right. Here we go. Yeah. Thrones. Even Game of Thrones. Oh, Jesus. So I mean, Game of Thrones couldn't even finish strong. That's how difficult fantasy is, oh, especially live action like... fantasy. Oh, uh, Amazon that, seems to have had some success with Dude. the Wheel of Time. Not Would a lot you... of people ever talked about it, like anywhere on the way. internet, except maybe the <laughs> pockets. But it was successful. You know from the Nielsen charts that a lot oh, of wait. people watched it. Stop! Stop! Uh, people stop. sure are talking about. Okay, these Nielsen. God, that voice. These Nielsen charts yeah. are bullshit, by the way. They're absolute bullshit. They're based on what fucking Roku or whatever, which is like, uh, whatever. Was anybody talking about Wheel of Time? Did you see it out there Fuck in no. the ether? Was it fucking trending? I, I don't know. We talk about nerd stuff. No. Not that I recall. She no. even said it wasn't. She even said of, it wasn't. Well, I saw a lot of Wheel of Time people saying that the Wheel of Time was shit. Yeah, that's yeah. all yeah. I heard of that. Is. So the way that the they do the ratings and everything for like specifically for streaming is always going to be off because unlike traditional television where you have a time slot, uh-huh. this isn't it. So Cobra Kai, when they track minutes watched for like a 10 or 8 episode season with like 30 minute episodes, it's going to be much different than the way something's tracked that might have 10 to 15 episodes that are hours long. You know, like that's it's just very different. And that's what they're trying to do. They try to show how much streaming time it has combined and what market share that is for a given mm. day. It's it's so it's identical it's, to YouTube that. analytics. It is. There's a click through rate. There's how much time you watch. They know exactly. And the reason we don't hear about it ever exactly 
uh, is because the the numbers are astronomically low in most cases. It's shameful. Right. Yeah. People hide shameful things. Yeah, they would brag about it if it was good. Absolutely. The only people that talk about it is Netflix openly. Mm-hmm. And that's, I mean, for all that stuff, you have to, well, is that true? Well, they have, they have released them for years in terms of like minutes watched. The but most, again, that only means what it means. The most watched shit on streaming is still like The Office and Friends. Like that's what people are yeah. watching. Also, she said uh, Lord of the Rings couldn't even finish strong. It's like oh, it no, couldn't no. even finish bad. Like, <laughs> yeah, what an understatement. Holy shit. Yeah. <laughs> that's how tough fantasy is, guys. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that, as if that explains fantasy. why Game of Thrones is bad. But yeah. yeah okay. <laughs> show but it's a really controversial show before even airing before even this trailer dropped uh which i think is a shame i think i i love the fact that the show is so inclusive and you know oh. how can you be against it when you see how much it means i love the well, fact that it's so inclusive why even though it means nothing to the actual lore it just yeah, fuck that <laughs> right, shit, let's, fuck let's hear man. her let's hear a follow-up sentence and then pause it to a number of fans of color <laughs> of fantasy Okay, I stop. agree that it should fans reflect color? The, what? the audience that's watching it. Okay. And they would- an now FOC, a fan of color. Fan of color. Yeah. Fan what of new color. audiences are they going to, like, are, are people going to say, oh, a look, a, a dwarf that looks I, like I me. don't give a fuck. I don't give a yeah, fuck. So let me get this straight. A lot of nerds like Black Panther, so therefore we should have a white right. Black Panther, because those nerds happen to be white. It, it, oh, no. Uh, I mean, it's the same yes. fucking logic. She just white dis- people yes. don't matter. <laughs> she exa- well, she just disproved her own point again. Ryan brought this. Everybody's brought this up. All right. But uh, mm-hmm. if you were already a fan. So apparently yes. you're okay with it because you were already yep. a fan. Fuck. And this is such bullshit because you wouldn't do it with anything else. That's the thing. We're only doing it with North, Norse mythology. And the reason it means so much to fucking activists is this is just another statue they can pull down. Another symbol. Mm-hmm. They don't give a fuck about the story. Well, it's Marxism 101. Yep. Gotta, you know, yep. gotta continue to divide. And that includes even in pop culture entertainment, including something as amazing or what should be amazing as, as the Lord of the Rings. Man, this could have been yeah. such a... And you wonder why countries Dude. just fucking walk all over other countries. Could have been a great. Yeah. Just some guy great said show, it at yeah. the end of his video, and I, I, w- I said I would be happy to eat fucking meals of crow to be wrong about this. I want to root for the <laughs> show. I love. I want to like this show. I want it to be fucking good. It's not going to be good. It's there's no way. Mm-hmm. And and to repeat what a lot of people have said, if it doesn't matter, because that's what gets. Well, why does it matter to you so much? Well, then why does it matter to you so much? Then why change it? If it's if it's not that big a deal, then why change it? Yeah. Same shit we yep. heard with Doctor Who. Same fucking shit. To save lives, Gary. Yep. Save lives. To save and lives. And pushing the like we, we left to... that part out. Yeah. Okay. Uh, can we, do you want to rewind, you re- rewind that? Like go back a little bit so we'll we can hear her it. wise statement here. <laughs> Jibber jabber. By the way, I finally to was a number of fans of color of fantasy. I agree that it should reflect the, the audience that's watching it. And they would like everyone to watch it. They, you know, inclusive entertainment means. It's open to everybody to come uh, watch it. Okay. Well, I don't know. So I so didn't know. Black Panther dumb not open to everyone. Talk. Yes. There Black you go. people can't turn their TVs on <sighs> yeah. for some reason. <laughs> yeah, they don't or know they, how to do it. They can't, they can't they, vote. So they can't. They don't know how to register to vote. They don't know they how to do They need an any. ID. They don't know how to get on the internet. Um, the the audience for Avatar exclusively blue, right? Like yeah. Based off of her logic, I should not have liked a Korean TV show. Right. Because right. I'm not represented in that show. Yeah. That yeah. is the most ridiculous statement I've ever heard. None of us so should have liked stupid. Squid Games. Nope. Yeah. yeah, That's yep. condescending as fuck. That means you <laughs> think that they have a, a child's brain. Yeah. Yep. Chrissy, we I go think, white How many times do I keep games? saying it is, the, it is the Western lie? It is the Hollywood <laughs> lie is diversity and inclusion. Mm-hmm. Yep. That's exactly what it is. It's just it's bullshit. The grift. And it and it's and it's telling people terrible lessons. Hey kids, unless you can superficially see yourself, then you'll never be able to write to something that has depth. It's a yeah. it's a massive grift. Uh, <clears throat> that's why they they do uh, uh, it. Shit, Eric Larson just added himself <sighs> recently when he came out and said, oh, "Let's go make Punisher gay." That will own the right. I mean, that's why they're making all the changes. I, well, there's other reasons. So there's financial reasons, but they're they're also yeah. like, <laughs> let's totally own these motherfuckers. And uh, Michael Shaban admitted it. Showrunner of Picard 
uh, yeah, they're they're ruining this stuff so they can own people. These fucking petty yep. little bitches. Uh, yep. M- Mahler, did you say there's white people in Squid Game? Yeah, yes. remember the, the oh old shit, old. I might watch yeah. it now. Oh yeah, the yeah. the rich people, of course. Rich people. Oh, the yeah. gay people at the end. <laughs> the yeah. mean yeah. people. Yeah. The evil people. That's why Ryan can relate to them. Yeah, now I'm going to watch that shit. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, they bully someone into sucking the dick. Gay and white, count me in. I'm the... My kind of show. Suck my dick or else. The sexual predator. (laughs) I I can can relate. Yeah. If you can can make me come in less in five minutes... Then oh god, he says it's something horrendous. Is it's that really what, what it is? It'll change your life. Yeah, yeah. This, yeah, this, 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 this life, white yeah. guy has this Korean guy on his knees, and he's like, "If you yep. can make me come in five minutes, I will give you like everything that you want." Ah, damn, better be working the shaft and the balls in that one. <laughs> 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 yeah, like, I hope that guy had low self-esteem growing up. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Hopefully he was a bad girl in college. That's Daddy the kind issue. of woman I like. Yeah. 69 for 69. Up, 69. Yep. That's low self-esteem. Did you? Oh, that's mm. wonderful to hear. I mean, that's terrible. I put Jack Murphy's beard on the black dwarf in my oh, recent no. film. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> it's a terrible fucking Photoshop. Hey, that's, that's why it works. It's closer oh, to the works, horror dude. than the original photo, Ryan. Yeah. So. It is. <laughs> All right, let's listen to this bit. Let's listen to this bit. Incredibly expensive show. Uh, let's see if it looks expensive. And I'm also looking to see... If it draws us in, is it too late for a Lord of the Rings show? A lot of us are not at all familiar with this mythology. Oh, and, um, uh, that's uh, fucking uh, obvious. Pause, pause, <laughs> wait, what? In fucking fans. 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 That doesn't even make out. sense. Like, is it too late? We're not familiar oh. with it. Are we the fucking book <laughs> then? Who the fuck is oh. we, Grace? Well, it's been, it's been 2,000 years. Too late for me to read the Bible. <laughs> and, oh, and, 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 Grace, God. I know Grace, it's, it's a book. 60 years old. It's Just go back to talking about John Cena's cock for yeah, fuck's sake. Right? It's all you're good for. It's <laughs> right? really all you're good Dumb for. Ass. Oh my god, it's got a it's a book with words. I'm not gonna read that. <laughs> 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 Can I relate to that? It's <laughs> been a while. Uh, uh, you guys, Grace's impressions are spot on. Yeah. Oh, fucking hell. <laughs> so this, this bitch. This bitch. Yeah, you gotta mix in a little <laughs> Elmer Fudd. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 Suffering, suck that man was fighting against the Russian regime. Hail that man. That's right. Go listen to the backstory. R.I.P. R.I.P. Okay. We're not going to be like, oh, look R. at R. that. R. We're going to have to be drawn in on the story. All right. And, the, it's Lord and of the, the, Rings. the show itself. All right. Here we go. It's a minute spot. <laughs> That's late. Wait a minute. So the, the Lord of the Rings, which just had its 20th anniversary, Fellowship of the Rings, last year, was it? Uh, which is one of the most beloved and popular that this show mm-hmm. has had over a billion dollars pumped into it. And it's going for five seasons to make it uh, viable. That has to have a huge global audience right. to make it a success. Grace Randall says, do, "Do any of us really care anymore?" Highest sold yeah. book series next to the Bible. Do, do, next to the Bible. Is, it, is it too? Is it? Is it too late? Is it too late? Is it too late? Some of us don't know about the lore. Uh, the <laughs> some of us fans, some of us like fucking fans don't know about, don't know about. <laughs> they they know about the law, but, uh, but we know enough to, that we want to be represented. That's how much yeah. we know. <laughs> <laughs> I do know one thing. I want yeah. to be represented. <laughs> Whatever yeah. this is. I, you know, just, that tells it, they don't, I want to see a blacks. They don't care about it being Lord of the Rings. Right. Because no, they don't yeah. even know. It's like they literally that's just fun. want it to be fantasy and they want it to have black people in it. That, yeah, I, yeah. That's just like when we're breaking it down to the basics. That's mm-hmm. what they want from this series. She's like, I know enough to know. I need to do a video about this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. She's exactly. like, I'll open with saying, who even knows much about Lord of the Rings? That'll be, <laughs> yeah. no, that's so, going to be endearing. I mean, <laughs> do we even know what it is? It's been so long. What is a ring anyway? <laughs> what is a Lord? <laughs> what is a blow dryer? Why did he make the ring? I don't. Like it. <laughs> yeah. Why are we why fighting? They, why why are they, they fighting? 
I'm a Lord of the Rings super fan. I'm a super fan. Why are they why, fighting? Why like, they, we they don't know where the along. rings come from. <laughs> There's a lot of talk about my girl Galadriel. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a Lord of the Rings super fan. Clearly, I am because there's absolutely zero Lord videos of on my Rings. YouTube channel talking yep. about it. <laughs> You're welcome. It's like, yeah, that was a great like video, by the way. Simpsons. Thank you. A little boy in The Simpsons just goes, I am a Lord of the Rings. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in danger. I'm in danger. It's Ralph. Ralph. Yeah. That's it. Ralph. I'm a Lord of the Rings. <laughs> <laughs> That's what those super fans were. That's Grinch smells like cat food. I'm a Galadriel. My good Galadriel. I'm obsessed with that dagger. What? Yeah. <laughs> what? What? Oh, I want to know about that dagger. I'm obsessed with that dagger. Oh my god, the dagger. Oh my god. I don't want to know why he's obsessed with that dagger. What's say dagger? What's up? He said he loves oh, stabbing sorry. things. In the back. <laughs> I, I don't oh, know. Like a, like only a if you're someone who represents the UK Lord of the Rings fans are you allowed to use the hard R. That's that's, <laughs> that's, that's their word. <laughs> Mrs. Obama, get down. <laughs> Mrs. Obama, I've saved you from racism. <laughs> Ooh. Not expensive. Ex Ooh. Expensive. <laughs> expensive. It's CJ, you dumb cow. <laughs> expensive. They built the statues, Grace. They built them all. Everything. Even that, they this built is it. It's gorgeous. Is oh, it? Yeah, look at that. CGI. It's CGI. No, it looks yeah. like a game. <laughs> It's just like it's, the projector. My friend really thought they should be able to climb and play chemistry. mail. That's funny. Shadow and bone. Shadow and bone. What is this shadow and bone? Shadow thing? and bone. Is that Did she just call that black guy his shadow? What? Shadow. Oh, shit. Is it shadow and bone? bone? Wasn't that? It's uh, another Netflix series. Yeah. Is, is, oh. that, is there like an actor from that in there or something? Maybe. I think it, I she said that it was reminding her of it or maybe. Yeah. Yeah. It was reminding her. You know why shadow and bone exists? If it's fantasy. Lord of the fucking Rings. Yeah. That's why. <laughs> Nobody knows about Lord of the Rings. Are you sure it's not Dungeons and Dragons 6, The Search for a Paycheck? <laughs> D Disparu, Disparu brought up a great point in his video on that, that arrow catch. It's like, if, if that actually had happened, it was that slow, like... It, it, you could do insane things. Like elves could literally be doing, but they could fucking run super fucking fast through all this shit if he was actually moving that. Quickly. Yeah, yeah, yep. mm. And then it kind of takes everything that speedster. we've ever seen any elf done, and be like, why would any elf ever get shot? How could any elf ever be surprised by anything? You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. yeah that's what they're doing. Shadow and Bone is another great fantasy show. That guy. <laughs> well, I think fucking watch that show. then. Everyone knows this about is, Shadow This is Bone, different. Hey, 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 Grace, I'm going to let you into a little secret. This is different. <laughs> yes. yeah. It's not the same thing. So it's expensive. a different thing by a different person oh. with different rules. Expensive. But She's like very concentrated. It's so mm. expensive. She's I hoping like to your... see John Cena's penis. Oh, that's pretty too. Yeah. <laughs> that's pretty too. I'm still looking. I don't see it yet. I don't see his penis. Okay, there that's, was. Just, that's just a representation of modern like a child. That's a different I, mythical creature. <laughs> I wish just someone go, would hold my hand. Adult she just said child. that's an adult and a child. That's a okay. No, I just wish that baby's creature. arm was the baby's I, arm of John Cena's penis. <laughs> I, 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 I think she said Holding that's an not. Apple. I think she said that's not an adult and a child. That's like a human and another mythical creature. What is her yeah. audience? I, think that's what I mean, I assume I assume this is correct, but is her audience retarded? Yes. Are they completely stupid? <laughs> you like, answered your own question. She's explaining it like they are stupid and they've never heard of Lord of the Rings in their life. It's like this Shadow and Bone, an except child. not at all. She doesn't. She doesn't. I think know uh, she thinks her it. audience is yeah. retarded as she is. is what you know, it is. she is. says yeah. it's pretty, it's expensive, and oh, Shadow and Bone. That's another great fantasy, that's fantasy. series. <laughs> that's something I've Those heard. Those are of. the three things she says. She doesn't. She clearly doesn't feel the need to like. Truly, like, yeah, she obviously doesn't know anything about it, but she also doesn't feel the need to study up at all, at all. before doing this no. review, which is well, like, yikes. Well, why, to her, well, to her defense, she's reacting <laughs> to a trailer, right? Yeah. Like, yeah. Th so I, I wouldn't necessarily anticipate her to read the entire Lord of the Rings series before you react to a trailer. You, if you need to read so the before. series, maybe right? Wikipedia. Well, a little. But she's a super fan. Why, why? She's reacting to a trailer. Well, maybe before claiming, like, oh, you know, nobody really knows anything about Lord of the Rings. Yeah, like, maybe right. look in to see, like, what kind of hype is there. Yeah. But. <laughs> yeah. 
you know, I, I, I think if the Amazon spent that much money, it would be right oh, to assume that it's worth that much. Uh, just Yeah. Look at that face. <laughs> She's like, I have no clue, no clue what these are. I do not she know. seen his penis in she, any of these images. She did say <laughs> about that the black a guy. That is face, man. It is. She said about the black guy, I like his look the best so far. Yeah. That's what yeah. she said. Yeah. I agree. I think he looks awesome. He looks awesome. He's like a like he's <laughs> very, you know, dark skin <laughs> and he's great an haircut. In Middle Earth, all I know is I understand the origin of the Joker now. I do. I fucking understand <laughs> it. Such an ally. Such an ally. Uh, oh, hip she's boy. like, man, that that's uh, that strapping young black man with a fade. Uh, I really, uh, I really like. I liked him. I'd like yeah. to know where he went to get what that fade. What of his jib? Why did he have his hat cut? I think. Grace if he doesn't wear a do rag, if he does not fucking wear a do rag, this is all a sham. This is all a sham. How does he get that hair like that? I, really, I hope he has the. Uh, I hope he has the exaggerated swagger of a black teen. Me too. Yeah. <laughs> just, uh, just like Miles Morales. I, I, in I really the PS5 hope five game. <laughs> they need to lean into the representation. I want the uh, the black dwarf. I want her to have kids from like five different dwarf baby daddies. <laughs> uh, I want her to be on uh, Gondorian assistance. Yeah, uh, oh, I, think, I think they should really doom assistance. Yep. Get it right, Ryan. Jesus, yes. Moria. Well, they, well, well, no, they're not going to pay for that. That's not their problem. That's the that's the humans' problem. They're they're the ones that need to pay the reparations. In that's my the, opinion, yeah. gives out her PayPal address in the first five minutes. <laughs> that's what she's yelling yeah. out in the, in the trailer <laughs> she's actually w- just w- her, she's just linking me. her cash app yeah. Yeah. you can pay pal me ah! <laughs> <laughs> I found this backward swastika written on my stone here <laughs> it's in a, every it's a rune but everyone needs, lady gave it to me <laughs> everyone needs to be represented right so yeah, yeah, yeah why not hit play <laughs> or, or not it's okay. You know, I gotta say, they work so hard to make this show pretty. I don't know if they made it particularly pretty. interesting. Whoa, what is that? It seems a little bland. <laughs> Why should uh, I with an accent like this? Well, uh, I, I think uh, the only, totally only throws actor it under the that bus. I think is charismatic yeah, that really leaves off the screen. Didn't she, didn't she just call it beautiful for half the trailer? And now it's like <laughs> black. <laughs> I also want to know now. why she, she saw a trailer with two black people and now she's like, yeah, rewind that. Rewind, that. rewind that. Rewind that, Garrett. I want to hear that again. I want to hear that again. She also said something about two or three inches. Pretty. Ooh. Pretty. John Cena is not two or three inches. He's way bigger. Inches. That's really interesting. <laughs> it seems a little bland. Oh, uh, a little more, a little more, a little more. Uh, you know, I got to say, they work so hard to make this show pretty. I don't know Pretty. if they're particularly <laughs> interesting. Say, what? Don't judge like a man Madonna. by the content of his character. <laughs> it's hey, look, the color of his skin, sorry. When you hang out with black people, every once in a while, some Ebonics pops out. It's like your pod to make it look pretty. She watches Hillary Clinton down in the South, you know, campaigning. She watches a, she watches a one-minute fucking trailer with a little diversity. All of a sudden, she's talking like she's taking my order at Popeye's. <laughs> she's got, she's got the, she found the exaggerated swagger of a young she <laughs> Okay. She's embodying oh, it. I know. Oh, Grace, God. she's putting a PayPal link on the front page. Stop it, Grace. Stop it. Stop. Oh. <laughs> Not for you. Not she for put you. hers there at Grace Randolph. See? Yeah. Seems a little bland. Uh, yeah. I, I think the a bit only, more guy, only actor that I think is charismatic that really leaps off the screen is this... Uh, Charismatic. Charismatic. I don't, I don't, I don't, what is he? I don't know, but uh, I think he has the best look. The only one with the charisma what is, what is this Everybody elf? else is this elf thing? She just she's trying not to say black elf. She's trying. You know that so person who's not just a single guy, solitary yeah. bit of emoting whatsoever, <laughs> exuding <laughs> charisma. That face. one. Yeah. Hey, the one guy that really popped <laughs> off the screen to me was the one with a different skin color. Uh, yeah. Who Here, might I, be I, elf. I'm not just, sure. Uh, she let me show this. I mean, she spent like half her video oh. talking about diversity and inclusion. So let, has, let me show this clip real quick so everybody understands the context. I'm sharing my screen just for a second. Oh, is it Lord of the Rings? This is the this is the exaggerated swagger this is a game spot review Fucking it got game memed spot. to hell and back here we go yes the way he leaps up the tops and flips backwards to face the camera before falling into a head first dive is just full of the exaggerated swagger of a black teen 
no. 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 Spoken oh, like a real no. white boy. Oh, so so no. I could like like you could tell Grace is kind of wanting to say something like yep. that, but she can't. Like that's what that's all I'm thinking about when I'm hearing wow. that. So. And the guy who said it is white, I'm assuming. Too. Oh. Yes. I don't know. White is, up, the is, he, is he white? <laughs> White and oh, is the exaggerated yes. swagger that only a white fucking games journalist could <laughs> yes, fucking <I> say. <laughs> and he wrote that. He wrote that. Oh. Wrote it and recited it, it and recorded recited it, it and edited it. Yep. And he said, wrote it, he recited it and he, yeah, he, exactly, Gary. He went, yes, nailed it. <laughs> hit, hit render, posted it. There's so many stops here where he could have <laughs> wow. cut it out. Not but he an exaggerated swagger. Oh. Grace, Grace is like, the one with the best look was the one that was hardest to see. I love that sneaker girl. Well. Squeeze that poop out just like the exaggerated swagger of a young black teen, you know. <laughs> Fucking hell. I, mean, I bet he got a big elf dick. <laughs> It looks more oh, like an actor in a commercial. Like this is like a a commercial <laughs> to go visit Middle Earth than it what? is. Uh, that's what, what, what right? are you talking yeah. about? Um, I'm, just, no I'm idea thinking of Thor and the Nine Realms no too. Uh, so that's fantasy. Well, it's turned into sci-fi, but you know, this you know that, this was what they tried to do with Thor first. Um, and no. it didn't work out. What are you uh, talking about? That's interesting. It's always been uh, that's sci-fi. Interesting. You know, one of the things that really helped <laughs> no, Game of Thrones No, what is interesting, Grace? Please, pray tell. Oh, what please, is interesting? What is she talking she, about? I, she, I, I really want to know what she Thrones. just said. She said, she said words. She, she so, said no, that. No, she just said Nudity right there. Game of Thrones? Is that hang what on, she said? Hang on, hang on. What, what, Ryan? I was just going to say what comic said is that she said what really helped Game of Thrones was nudity and she's going to say nudity and brutal violence, I think. So she, that's what she wants out of this show. Is that she what stop. she's about to fucking say? Oh, let's find out. It's interesting. You know, one of the things that really helped Game of Thrones was the nudity and the dragons. Oh, dragons. <laughs> uh, close. Uh, and I don't I think this show might be oh, trying to God. be more dignified. Uh, and I don't the know if there's season. money in dignity. The best season know. of Game of Thrones. One of the best seasons. <laughs> Holy oh, shit. Oh, that is the no line of the century. Season. Oh, my God. Going back, going back. Let's, let's go back to that's going the in the fucking trilogy. soundboard. <laughs> that is going in the money fucking and soundboard. Yeah, uh, exactly. Oh, oh geez. How no many Oscars? Diggity. Grace. Or a it up. No and diggity. I don't know if there's money in Dignity. <laughs> I know, Grace, you make enough, and you got no fucking Dignity. it's a gorgeous Shit. Someone needs to clip that, seriously. Yes. I don't know. I don't know. That's there's money clip. in dignity. Let me say if there's no money in dignity, then do the share the load clip. Share oh, the load. load. And then show John Cena and his tidy whities <laughs> The love of the quote that should, Every time she does anything stupid, someone should play the... Uh, I don't know if there's yeah. any money in dignity. No. <laughs> Check out my OnlyFans. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> her yeah, only exactly. fans admittedly would probably be her reading something like Jane Eyre in all fairness and I, I heard that if you pay her 10 bucks a month she'll she'll show you her so face that's what oh, I no. <laughs> that's funny. Oh. Oh. I don't know if you guys are interested in nipple slips but I have some on my only fans oh no <laughs> wait does she Ryan, run. Ryan will go for anything. It's not a. <laughs> I'm not going to pay 10 bucks, though. I mean, yeah. Five? Aww. I'm going to torrent that. Well, no, I'll She's fucking try. try to find it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. No, Ryan, no. No. Now wait a minute, Ryan. Now no, wait a minute. Now wait a minute. I, now, wait a minute. I, 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 no, I kind of agree with Ryan. I agree with Ryan. You're gonna judge me if I heard that Grace Randolph had a nip slip and I Google Grace Randall nip Grace Randolph nip slip. Randall. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Grace, yes. Randall. Grace Randall. Randall. <laughs> Randall from Monsters Inc. <laughs> if you go look at Grace Randall, yes, I am gonna be judgmental with you. I don't know, but I got some 85 year old dude's nipple, and I don't know. Quite I, don't know. <laughs> I think he's on a farm or something, right? Who would who would pay for this? <laughs> There's no money in dignity, Ryan. There is no. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, oh. I think your casting director might have, you know, not that, that with the actors specifically that they chose. 
might not have chosen, you know, let's see what they're like when we actually get to, to meet Whoa. them. But oh, there's no insane. personality on that 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 right now. Finish your that's why they use all your hands and posters. They were like, it doesn't matter what part of them you're looking at. Uh, but I want this what to do is well. This I'm excited. I, I want, I'm rooting for it because I'm really I, I'm upset about the hate that I feel has been unfairly. Oh, go fuck yourself. Uh, you don't even know uh, what so the fuck you're I'm talking about. I'm rooting for it. You know so nothing about it for it. Sense of diversity. That's you don't why. Know I know shit nothing about, about this franchise. I've just made that perfectly clear, but I'm rooting for it because people that do know about this franchise <laughs> and are not happy at some of the changes that they're making are mad. So yeah, go fuck off, guys. What the stupid fuck? cow, this woman. <laughs> I the f how the fuck she's lasted this long? I have no, no idea. Clue. No clue. No fucking idea. It's just no. always gobbledygook that comes out of the <laughs> fucking mouth. Have you guys? Have you guys you never been on the internet? Or? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. It. It. Yeah. When, when when you start getting too full of yourself, just remember things Jeez. like this. That's all you got to remember. Just go. Yeah. True. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Oh yeah. Just watch Grace Randolph and be like, okay, yeah, I get it. Uh huh. <laughs> Yeah, but uh, I don't know. I, to... I don't know. That's don't that's know. right now. I, I'm rooting for it, not because of what I've seen of the show. Uh, so what do you think? <laughs> what? 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 Yeah. Wow. Well, Holy shit! Yep. That's a perfect line. There you go. Right from I'm the mouths of shills. I think it's good. I'm rooting for it because people hate it. From the mouths that of shills. The, the mouths of retards. Jesus. Point. The very definition. Of From the mouths of access the media. You're right, Holy Odin. Shit. What the uh, fuck? It, she said everything. I don't know what this is. It has diversity. I'm rooting for it explicitly for the diversity. Not because of what I've seen. Yep. <laughs> oh, my God. I can't, hey, well, hey, I can't even. I can't even. With, with, with I will sell like myself that for access it, is what that yeah, screams. Yeah, yeah. I'm so happy they made Tolkien uh <laughs> Black. So yeah, black. they made him black. That's so good. Bad. Finally, it's time. It's time. At least it was Eric July. Okay. It's time. Oh, that's beautiful. Now, if he had been the elf, <laughs> that hand is just perfect. <laughs> <laughs> but stop talking, fans. Shh, go away. Oh. 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 Can I be, can I be part of this? No. I did. Uh, no. I, I I forgot to I forgot to let you guys hear the best part of the of the black teen comment. I didn't listen to the end. Listen to the end. Oh, this no. is this oh. is this is listen to the end. When he leaps off of rooftops and flips <laughs> the camera before falling into a headfirst dive is just full of the exaggerated swagger of a black teen. It gives me goosebumps every time he does it. Goosebumps. <laughs> 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 Wow, that's so gay. Why are you gay? the gayest thing I think of ever. Why are you gay? Why are you? Uh, why, you are are you gay? why are you gay? You are gay. You are gay. Why are you gay? You are gay. Why are you gay? That's the greatest gay. clip on YouTube. You are I listen to them. I listen to my audience, and I, and I started to feel how they feel. I felt worthless. I felt daft. I felt gay. <laughs> Wow, that's actually that's actually a soundbite for a stream. People ask you if you're okay, and you're not okay. I felt gay. I felt gay. <laughs> Oh. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get. Uh, I'm gonna get the person. Shout out to Meerkat. Uh, I'm gonna get him to get, send me that audio clip. It's the funniest thing ever. Really, dude. I Lord of the Rings is is a tough one for the normie access media because they, there's mm -hmm. they just cannot defend what like this is actual yeah. fan. This is like a fandom that's been around for years and years and years, and it's and it's big and it's an entrenched fandom. Um, yeah, they can't watch a, that's what she a couple said. of movies that pretend to be experts on it. Yeah, like they, they they can't. They're struggling. So it's so good. Oh my god, that was the worst one yet. Like literally saying, like, is it even still relevant? Basically, Lord of the Rings still relevant? Yes, mm -hmm. it's yes, like, it is. It's like all these motherfuckers who like were Eternals experts when that shit came out. <laughs> oh, I didn't even read that shit. I owned a comic store. I didn't fucking read that crap. I didn't want. I didn't did care. you own a comic store, Gary? I did. Wait, what? No. Hold on. And I Hold didn't on. give what? a shit about the Eternals. I didn't care. It was old. I thumbed through it when I was a kid. Uh, read the Neil Gaiman one, and it sucked. And uh, that was it. That's all I cared about it. Uh, How long do you like, own this? I'm a lifelong Eternals fan. Fuck off. 
<laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> Fuck you. Lifelong Eternals fan for about five minutes now. Yeah. Finally getting to see Icarus represented on the big screen. Right. <laughs> I've, been, I've been dreaming of this all my life. Oh, my ass. A- <laughs> no, not Wolverine hey, look, or Professor a little bit X more, or Magneto. Uh, behind the scenes footage Eternals. whenever the, the guys were over in Dallas with me. Glad you guys were here to hang out. You know, we we saw the, the Forrest Gump, Forrest Gump bench. They have that at the. Oh my the god! Yeah, that's that is that's the that. real that's the real Forrest Gump bench. So yeah, that's the real the real yeah. one. Uh huh. So, yeah. so I was glad I could to, I could show you guys. Is that you trying to look like Forrest Gump? Like, yeah, I was just sitting there being stupid. Yeah, and then you almost look too seen... retarded. <laughs> you went full retard. <laughs> Yeah, it's a little bit too good, Jeremy. In all fairness, <laughs> I am from I am from Alabama. Alabama. I am from Alabama. So I mean, like, I, I, it would be tough. Like if you sit down and someone's like, "All right, be Forrest Gump. Like look like Forrest Gump. Like what do you do?" He had a picture of him right there. He could have done that, but he didn't. Show that. additional replies, including those that may contain offensive content. Uh-oh. Uh oh. Game on. Uh, you ain't got yeah. no bullets. <laughs> <laughs> I thought, oh my god, I, I thought no it was leg. Leg. Oh, my god. Oh, my <laughs> You ain't got no legs. You ain't got no legs, Sergeant. Oh, he's got magic legs. I was oh, expecting the N word, okay. but I was no. I was surprised. So. Yeah, I, I thought I thought it was gonna be the F slur. Actually, yeah, yeah, you never know. Oh man, that was oh, good. Holy memes! It was cool. It was cool being at, at Blaze Studios. So it's really cool being yeah, there. Nice. I bet. So um, it was awesome. Mm-hmm. It's right. been a hell of a week for me and Ryan and even Jay. We got yeah. to shoot guns. Y'all look, y'all look great. Yeah, the, it was nice. Blaze. So. We saw Glenn Beck walk by. Yeah. We did. Oh, he's oh, he's did taller go, than didn't. you expect, right? He's um, pretty tall. Yeah, he's pretty yeah. tall. Yeah. We didn't go up. He was talking to other people. I didn't want to run it to him. Hey, hey, Glenn. Hey, Glenn. Hey, Glenn my grandma <laughs> loves your... Ch- yeah, yeah. Yeah, hey, <laughs> Glenn. I've got a gaming channel. Yeah. 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 He's really Nintendo. nice, though. Like, if you did, so, he probably sure would be... I'm sure he would have. Yeah. 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 So, tell us. Where'd you... Yeah, he is. I actually got yeah, to be in pretty college. Because sure nice. his, uh, his daughter went to the same university I did, so... Ooh. You fucker. <laughs> be honest. Oh my god. Come on. <laughs> no lie, That'd be quite a trophy. I, I met her. She's I'm just so disappointed. That'd be a big trophy. <laughs> oh, no. Tell Glenn. No. You killed Jeremy. You killed Jeremy. Jeremy's, Jeremy's, Jeremy. Jeremy's dead. He's slain. Uh, we got man down. Man down. Man down. <laughs> Dude, the oh funny thing God. is, Quarter Black said it, and all of us kind of won. <laughs> yeah, you brought that. <laughs> we were all thinking it. He no, no, no. said it. it. It's not. It's it's not because it's, it's Odin. It. It's because yeah. he said it to Odin. Exactly. Because <laughs> you know Odin was just slaying it in high school, right? So. <laughs> And I'm, no, I'm assuming like, it was uh, some sort of uh, religious university every, as well. Everything yeah. was, yeah. it was like a Catholic if, university. If Ryan yeah. would have said that to Odin, it wouldn't have been as funny. Yeah. Because right? it's Ryan. But Quarter Black just not even didn't <laughs> think about it. Deadpan. Ooh. Just deadpan. It was the timing. It was the timing, dude. It's it was a leg- <laughs> legit question. And, it, and, and it, I went was, to school with her. Did you fuck her? He didn't say, did you bang her? He didn't say, did you bang her? Did you hook up with her? Did you fuck no. her? And it was <laughs> so like, it wasn't like, hey, Odin, you fuck her? It was like, fuck <laughs> <laughs> It was like, <laughs> I gotta know. <laughs> It's like a live I, I just want to shout out, shout out to the beautiful toxic masculinity. It's, it's pretty, displayed tonight for it's you. It's pretty high. Oh, it's pretty. I just, oh, not- I just I noticed X Ray Girl's gone. How long has she been gone? Speaking no, of she time. had to go oh, back there to make room for Odin. Yeah. Oh, we got yeah. 10. So, oh, we got 10. She people. responded OMG to. Uh, oh. <laughs> well, she's obviously here to do my math for me, too. So I'm a little helpless. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I don't think X Ray Girl understands how much she gets memed. Like when we're playing like uh, online, like Splatoon or Mario Kart, and like a, a like an Asian person or a Japanese person join, we just call, we just cuss them out. It's fucking X Ray Girl when they yeah. kill us. Like a whole time, we're just referencing X Ray Girl all the time. She has no idea. She's automatically any Aww. person 
that is from like that what? area. It's yeah, so I don't even play in those games. I don't know if that came out how good you thought it was going to be. Yeah, sure. <laughs> we need to revise that one. Next doesn't time. matter. She now matter. says, "I am, I am very Asian, <laughs> Oriental, beautiful Oriental." Beautiful um, Oriental. We got a super chat. Look, the, the, the luxury of being on with Ryan is no matter what I say, it will never be as offensive as the 12 things that Ryan says in true. your dreams. So this is I'm true. always you're good well, to get the buffer. On the 12th day of Ryan must my true love said to me. Fuck women. They should be in the kitchen at the 50s. <laughs> I'll be, hey, I will, I, I, I will be, I'll, I'll tell you guys this. So before you are here, Ryan was very much excited because he was like, I know I'm going to get a super chat asking me about women in the 50s, and I can't wait. Like, he was I know. So excited. I'm so disappointed. <laughs> he was so excited. I know. I, yeah. <laughs> I was ready. Ryan, how do you think women in the 50s should behave? <laughs> well, that's from as from Hill versus Babyface. <laughs> yes. well, how do I think they should behave? Is, I mean, that's a different question. The question, <laughs> what you should be super chatting as is... Mm -hmm. What was good about the 50s for or how well did women have in the 50s and 60s? What did women have to do in well, the 50s, Sydney. Ryan? Well, Sydney, they had it pretty well. All this feminism has absolutely ruined their lives because all you had to do back then, well, the women in the 50s and 60s, you had to cook and get fucked. That's, <laughs> that sounds like the perfect life to me. I was ready to say this. I wanted to see Sydney's This is what you oh, could have no, had, felt. Elijah. Heart and felt. This is what I'm you could have I'm had. getting more pizza now. Heart, Heart felt. felt. <laughs> well, we Ryan, met, we that, Ryan, that was... That was Heartfelt. Heartfelt. Yeah, right. No, we, we met we met the uh, CEO of Blaze, Tyler. Uh, we yeah. met Tyler. He's nice guy. He's a great guy. We were hanging out awesome talking dude. to him. He's like, you guys are being you are here. Uh, you know, my you know, and he was like, that's a pretty tough, uh, tough crowd sometimes. That's a, and we were he like, said, dude, he ain't, said dude, that's dude. the he said that's like the the dregs of the internet. Yeah, or something. Yeah, yeah, and I was cool. like, you have no idea where the bottom is. Bro. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We are the dregs. We are. Yeah. Yeah. I am the dreg. Yeah. I live in the dregs. I was born Your in the dregs. Uh, that's like the like you are here the is like the stuff. The stuff that floats on top, we're the, what's sitting on the bottom. <laughs> yeah. I had left 4chan before you were even a child. <laughs> I was born in it. Uh, Woos Wo 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 Bane for uh, $25 to $25. What a coincidence. $50. I know, coincidence. I was talking about the Batman. The Batman, because the hype is real, he says. The hype is real. It's an excellent, fresh, and original film. Despite the era of reboots, Pattinson and Reeves did their homework. Comic book accurate in uh, is an underestim is an underest is underestimate underestimation underest and underestimate. Uh, this had <laughs> Jeff Loeb vibes all over it. That's a good thing as long as it's not TV Jeff Loeb and it's comic book yeah. Jeff Loeb. Hmm. I'm fine with that. Uh, part, I'm yeah. I'm with you. Part, I'm down for the hype. Two. I'm hyped. I'm, I have a little hang bit on, of hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Gary said, "Hang on." Uh, Gotham City is its own character. That's good. It does not feel like New York, Chicago, or fake sets. Reeves found a real life Gotham and shot on location. It's nasty. It's brutal. All actors did an excellent job. This film may be the next Logan or Joker. For awards, wow, wow. maybe, wow. maybe. Who I, said that? Hey, I am. Uh, I'm looking forward to to the Batman. I think I think it looks great. Um, yep. I've 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 liked everything I've seen from it up to this point. Um, I've heard good things from just from Matt Reeves and from uh, Robert Pattinson. I, I think it looks good. The trailers have looked good. We'll see. And if my biggest complaint about Nolan's trilogy, and everybody knows how much I love Nolan's trilogy, is Gotham. Because if you look at Batman 89, Gotham is a character in Batman 89. And I think that was one of the, the things that Nolan's trilogy missed is kind of capturing the essence it. of Goss hey, even, Gotham. Even Schumacher got that right. Yeah, yeah, 100%. Well, you know, Batman, I like Batman Begins had character. That Gotham has did. the character. And then it, it lost did. it in it, the Dark It Knight. lost it in Dark Knight and then moved to Philadelphia for Dark Knight Rises. It's just changing yeah. that that scene every time. But if, that's a, if, if they've captured Gotham, I think that's a crucial element to this you know being really good so we'll see i'm excited yeah dude I'm, I'm excited i'm a little apprehensive about robert pattinson's presence as batman but i know he's a great actor and what i've seen so far in all the trailers looks dope so i'm fucking excited mm, the more i've seen the more i'm kind of getting more and more interested in this now and i think the latest trailer that they just put out was really good the final trailer was really good and uh yeah, I'm sort of like, 
ah, I don't want to get too excited. But you don't want to get hurt I, again. You know? yeah, yeah, I don't want to get hurt. Yeah. <laughs> well, there's think, a lot of reasons to be skeptical. I think we could finger yes, each other. Yes, there is. Yeah. It, it, not not just the fact that, you know, Warner Brothers and DC has been so fucking shit lately. But, yeah. you know, yeah. Matt Reeves being so close to J.J. Abrams. I do like a lot of stuff mm. Matt Reeves has done before. <laughs> um, but, like, you obviously have race swaps. You have Commissioner Gordon, race swap. You have Zoe Kravitz. Now, I will say what I saw from Zoe Kravitz in the trailers, I actually really like the way she looks and moves and mm-hmm. everything. As Jeffrey Catwoman. Wright is also a really great <laughs> actor. So Zoe, I mean, Kravitz like Jeffrey, is, is, Zoe Kravitz is dating Channing Tatum. Okay. What? Okay. That's good. <laughs> that, so, but I thought she, I thought she made good, love good to Robin Chris Tatum Chris Tatum on the hood of an auto. Hey. Chrissy Meyer not knowing how to read the room. Uh, like, like, we that, don't that give was a, a fuck. That was a fucking Grace. Uh, that was part of Grace character. Just took over for a second. Channy Tatum had his shirt off a lot. Uh, <laughs> He's got a big dick. Some people yeah. like care. Chrissy, Chrissy thought she was on Simpcast for a minute. Totally forgot wow. to read the room. So. Wow. It's, it's, yeah. I love you. Hey, hey. It's, <laughs> but, but Zoe, like, I, I actually really did like what I saw from her in the trailers. We'll see. I actually got, I signed up for this, like, free early screening on March 1st, I think. Oh, yeah, that's so. right. Yeah, the fan. When she, when she just, like, the... referred to him as, like, she yeah. refers to him as Vengeance because he first says, I am Vengeance. So she refers to him as Vengeance. Uh, and then she refers to him as the bat. And I just, I kind of got these little bit of hush vibes as well from that, the way that Catwoman was speaking to Batman. Um, uh, little- as long as we don't get Bat Cat, fucking Bat- Tom, I- fucking. That's what I'm afraid of. That's yeah. Fucking yeah. dickhead shit. Yeah. Yeah. So, no, there's, there's, there's. So I think Andy, there's concerned. a story with Andy Circus there as well with Alfred. There's a story mm. going on there. Yeah. 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 Cause I know that. Cast is the- amazing. It looks great. I just, yeah. I just got it. I just got this little uh, that there might be some sort of court of owls reference or hint for the future and i, I think that's gonna i'd be down yeah <laughs> I'm down i love the court of owls that was the one yeah, thing that was the new thing that day, yeah i like i like court of owls. to be honest it actually so the way it seems to me i think what they're going to try to do like what riddler's trying to do is like show that his like oh his parents aren't who you thought they were they aren't the good people you thought they were kind of thing which we saw in the court of owls run a little bit yeah you know what mm. I, so I, I it's all they are actually kind of i think maybe blending elements of that already yes. and even Halloween. that ended up not being thomas he wasn't the it, bad exactly guy. it was like connect no, was thomas's that. father his right. grandfather yeah yeah yeah, yeah. So, yeah. yeah I, i'm stoked stoked it's it's yeah it's come comes out in a few days uh so uh, yeah i'm 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 warming up to it i'm warming up to it i'm i'm open to it being very good that would be great to see a great movie and have some fun and uh but as long as catwoman isn't leading dumb rageful toxic uh masculinity batman around well i hope, kind of hope he is toxic but um I, I like the way she was scared shitless though when he went postal on that guy guy she was like fuck <laughs> He's just pounding the fucking face off him. She's like, she's like, oh. See, I wish I was getting pounded like that. <laughs> <laughs> Grace Randolph right was thinking, I wish, I wish John well, Cena would pound me the way is, Batman how, pounds. How, how, how do you got? How do you get? I personally like this comment, but I, I'm curious how you guys feel about what Matt Reeves has said uh, right here, sharing the screen. Um, Matt Reeves has no, no plans to introduce Superman or other superpower characters to the Batverse. It's not my Fine. interest. So Fine. I'm, I'm 100% okay that. with that. I'm, yeah, I'm very much okay with that. Yeah. Um, I don't if want. If you're gonna make him yeah. a detective, great. Perfect. So, yeah, I, I'm okay with that. Yeah, it needs to make sense. Yeah. And so, it's just gonna be another closed off trilogy. Then I like it when they interact. I like it when Superman and Batman interact. That's part of what DC is. But since there's really no interest to have a real Superman on screen, yeah, I guess I'm I'm fine with it because it'd be better. You than could the you could have a Matt Reeves trilogy and let it breathe. Yeah, and, and then that's probably you know, what it'll you be. Introduce, and if it's like ultra successful or just successful in general, then you've got sounds the like chance it's going to be sign Patterson and and do stuff with him. Yeah, it sounds like it's going to be pretty fracking successful. They're they're tracking some big money for a three hour movie. Mm. So what is it looking like? Gonna be like? What the fuck? It's looking big. Uh, so yeah, the box office, <laughs> uh, the projections did go down about I think it was like nine or ten percent. Um, mm-hmm. But it's still expected to make over 100 million uh, domestically in no. its opening weekend. And yeah, they're probably accounting worldwide. for you know no theaters in Ukraine. 
Maybe. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> Well, I'm, I'm thought, not even. I'm. I'm only kind if of. If I was in the Ukraine, I'd no, make. Wait, I thought I'm only kind of fucking game. around. Like they're at. Like between what's going on in Russia and Ukraine, it actually will affect stuff. <laughs> well, yeah. The, and twi I mean, Twitter isn't was it like saying meant to be about hold. 250 worldwide. Twitter 250 worldwide. I saw. So, 80, I saw. Yeah, 80 it's, it's hard to sell. It's hard to sell worldwide at this point. Um, International because yeah, the range on the three the, the three day opening weekend is ranging to be 130 to 170 million. Uh, all time uh, the total domestic. Just the domestic is expected to be around three thirty to four seventy five million. Um, so I still think there's definitely a chance for this film to to pull out to be the next billion dollar film. But yeah. it's not as it's not, I'm not as confident in that as I was before with the ten percent drop. But yeah, we'll have to wait and see. It, yeah, it, yeah we'll it's see. gonna the, after how much it's gonna be watched. I don't know. Is anybody else? Uh, uh, Adam, are you excited for the Batman? Yeah, I want to see it. I'm definitely gonna go as soon as it comes out. Looks great. Yeah, I th I'm 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 warming up. Like I said, that last trailer was pretty good. I agree with Daz. Uh, I saw it uh, before a really shitty Uncharted movie, which was absolute <laughs> god awful fucking garbage. Man, um, I hate to hear that because I love Uncharted. That looked like trash, was it, regardless. Was it like? Well, I guess Gary, you probably have no no idea what Uncharted is. So if you, I know he has trash, fucking then. guns. I know he has guns, and he di and he didn't get the guns till the end. And I know he's not like a fourteen year old boy who like runs from everything. He does like fight once in a while and shoot something, doesn't he? Uh, well, yes. Yeah. He, he runs does, a lot. He does, he does, does a lot does, of fighting. He, he, yeah. yeah. he does a lot of running. Yeah. yeah. I imagine he does running. Shitty situation. Yeah, but in the, like the action set pieces were fine, but uh, I'll just ruin. There's one some big national part treasure of the stuff, yeah. like national treasure vibes to it as well. I national like treasure is fucking like awesome. Treasure. It's a great movie, yeah. and it does, yeah. this movie doesn't even oh, can't hold its whatever. Oh no, I was saying like there's vibes of that in there, and I like little girly panties that go right up your ass. That's what it can't hold. Uh, Do you know the stylistically it looks treasure? amazing. Stylistically, mm -hmm. it looks amazing. It's all dependent on the story for me. Like if the Wait, story falls apart, about? it's like super depressing because it's like this movie looks amazing, and then the story's complete shit. You're just you're so disappointed at what could have been. Yeah. So yeah, mm -hmm. I mean, I I think stylistically it looks great. I'm I'm into the. I mean, I kind of like the goth Batman <laughs> eyeliner look. Maybe I'm. Uh, maybe I'm hey. out. Maybe you guys disagree, but <laughs> I'm not a fan I, of it. But. I, I don't. I don't. I don't like that specific look. But it's it's because he's wearing like the grease. He's like wearing yeah, the yeah, grease. Yeah, yeah I, I, I like it because it's it. Well, that's how it would look when he takes yes, off the mask. Yeah, exactly. it was yes. so it's so I, weird. I, I'm the it was same so with weird the, the first yeah. time they did it's, that with the mask. But then when he the takes it off, you're like, oh well, okay. He's like a goth kid. I just yeah, remember well, being a kid hair, too. watching Batman Begins and at the end of Batman Begins where he's talking to Catwoman and, and, and Christopher Morgan. Uh, do, do you guys Wayne, not like the, the, when he, you guys when he not shows like the him, he's, Are you no, not he's got the, the black Catwoman? around his eyes at the end of the film and then it, yeah. it goes to Catwoman then it goes off. back because he's ripping the mask off and you can see that all the grease is gone. Oh yeah, so yeah, yeah all yeah, that yeah, grease yeah. is gone and, and, and I was even as a kid you recognize that immediately you say, ah! You're like ridiculous. So yeah, I I I, I actually I'm here. okay with these. But I've always yeah. got. The, I've got the <laughs> I, I'm fine yeah, with I them not look, having the grease on because it's basically movie magic, right? Hey, I mean, uh, Batman for, and for Robin it. actually kind of got that right because when they're there you go. Look, around the Patterson. Alfred. Oh, you got it. Oh, look at that. that. Is, yeah, that's the Patterson yeah. without uh, oh, without oh, mask. So and he's got the he's got the. Under eyes. If anybody's it's, gonna be a goth kid, it's gonna be Bruce Wayne. Doesn't okay. Look good. Well, they no. pick, they pick the right actor. He's gonna be goth. No. They pick the right actor to no. do that. You know, yeah. I don't know. I'm sure it'll be fine. Yes. Yeah. Are, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me, Batman? You kidding me, Batman? Is not goth. Not the best looking action figure. Batman is not goth. Yeah. Not Batman is not goth. Not what's the, so what's the what is your take on the the cat woman character? Because I I mean from the trailer I thought her acting. I mean we've had such pathetic cat women. It's like what. I liked her movement. Her movement well, the looked good. The last few have been too yeah. hot. The, like the way she we haven't had did that move. many. Like, what are the big clues, Michelle Pfeiffer? I will not hear disparagement. Half of them. Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah. Okay, Mahler. I'm sorry. I didn't yeah. Michelle Pfeiffer was fucking uh, awesome. As Catwoman. Michelle Pfeiffer was awesome. Michelle Pfeiffer, um, dude, and she and Hathaway actually, and Holly Berry were the like other trash. Two that had the, yeah, 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 yeah. Trash. We know those are trash. That's fine. The trash. most recent Berry. ones have been bad. Yeah, the Halle um, Berry. The Halle Berry looked ridiculous. Yeah, yeah, she did. Yeah, I, I never, I never even saw the Halle Berry one. Um, I mean, racist. Michelle, 
Yeah, <laughs> I, you know, I, I hang out with Ryan. What do you wow. expect? Uh, so, um, but yeah, black female. It, She's going to be in Ryan. the Flash movie. Dude. I couldn't like it if I wanted to. Couldn't like <laughs> it if I wanted Halle to. Halle Berry's Catwoman uh, in the Flash enjoy. movie. I'm just telling you now. <laughs> I mean, costuming yes. wise, she does look like Catwoman. That's yeah. that's a bonus. Yeah, yeah. Well, it, Which, it, the, uh, the way that she walks, Catwoman, it's yeah. Catwoman yeah, yeah. one-ish. Her her the attitude she definitely and comes off as Catwoman. With him, like just the way she walked, kind of embodied what yeah. I would expect, like almost yeah. a feline type of movement. So I thought it was mm. good. Um, she's like, yeah, she's cat, she's cat. you got a no. lot of cats. I can like, touch her and she like scratches. Hey, Maul, are you serious about that uh, Michelle Pfeiffer Catwoman? I, I can never oh, tell. Yeah, we, we, give you a hot take. Go ahead. I'll kill you. <laughs> no, I'm just, I'm curious. <laughs> I'm curious. Dude, she Dude, actually I, uses I'm, that I'm, whip, I'm, man. I'm, I'm, Dude, I'm she's quite awesome. into um, Batman Returns. That, sh- that shit's good shit. I love okay, it. Cool. A lot of it. Uh, it's my- I don't know that I remember it, so I don't know that I have a super hot oh, take look, on look Michelle Pfeiffer. Look up the video. There's a great Batman. behind the scenes yeah. video. That resurfaced uh, like mm. last couple of months, where it's Michelle Pfeiffer actually doing the whip, and you're oh, like, yes, "Oh yes, I remember that." Yeah. And she yeah, hits it every it. time. In boom, one take, boom, she does boom. it. One yeah. take, yeah. yeah. And the uh, she's a great Catwoman. The crew breaks out into applause because they're just so yeah. amazed by it. yeah, Ooh. yeah. No, I it was do stunning that. and brave. Yes, I don't know that I remember wow. those words. I mean, take that, Brie Larson. <laughs> the percentage on the poll. Hey, Are she... you excited for Batman? Yes, thirty-nine percent. Oh, so it's so people aren't excited. Oh, yeah. For no, That's yeah. what I've been so hearing you... a lot in my comment section well, on any video I've done. All right, well, a lot of people are not excited. I yeah. think anyone that was excited for it left after Gary did that trailer reaction. Uh, <laughs> it's so. Oh, yeah. I think. <laughs> Look, I understand why people are apprehensive. Like we've gotten shit for. Three, four, five years now, and it's so story I dependent. It. I don't, I, I don't know anything about the story from the either. trailer. So <laughs> it's, yeah, it's going to be yeah. based on well, it, a little bit of Corda Owls, maybe uh, a lot of uh, the Long Halloween, uh, which are two mm. great storylines, two <laughs> yeah, fantastic. Story I mean, the guy <laughs> is an executive producer on the Cloverfield Paradox, which you know <laughs> <laughs> that movie. Yeah, yeah, but like the whole thing about like. Um, Look, we're, we'll see. We'll see if Gary's right or wrong based on his first reaction. But guess what? That's what fans do. That's what yes. we do. We yep. speculate on shit. Mm-hmm. Do you remember when Hugh totally. Jackman was named Wolverine? Do you remember all the bullshit that was yep. said? From Heath Ledger, Ledger Broke yeah. Back Joker. Joker. Yeah. I, I, I mean, yep. I, I, wasn't, I wasn't a fan of either one of those castings. Guess what? Two of the greatest castings in, in the yeah. history so we'll of, of comic book movies. So, oh, so we'll hell see. Yeah. You know, uh, so, I mean, there's like, remember Ben Affleck when he was announced as Batman? You remember the internet? Oh, like yeah. yes. melted down. Yes. You know, if Ben Affleck would have had the luxury of being a black guy, then he would have had a lot of you know articles written about how the hate he's facing because it's all about toxicity. But he was a white guy, so nobody acts like he got hate. He got uh, more hate. He than got any a lot of hate in modern times in terms of like since you know the comic book explosion. So like speculating about shit. That's what we do. And I, I'm never going to shy away from it. Just like the Halo series. If the Halo series turns out to be good, I'll say, hey, I was wrong. But guess what? Based on the trailers, based on the things that the people from the show were saying, <laughs> it looks like shit to me. Yep. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. It looks like shit. If it smells like shit and it fucking tastes like shit, it's fucking it's bullshit. Shit, <laughs> <ass>. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Can't help it. You're so familiar with it. <laughs> we have become quite familiar with it haven't we over the last uh few sadly years. Uh, <laughs> yeah. dr mal practices uh for 39 34 says hello all been enjoying you guys since the start of my suspension from the canadian pacific rail starting in december for not Oof. following justin trudeau's jab mandate hell Ouch. hell bro. damn hoping for that sucks. You, hoping for this to end soon keep up the good fight uh and hey you know, good for you for having principles, man. Yeah, uh, and yeah I'm for kidding. Supporting. Good luck, dude. Yeah. yeah. 100%. It takes bravery to do that, man. Yeah. Actual stunning and actual brave. Yeah. yeah. Actual yeah. Man, uh, Putin sure took the, the wind out of the Canada story, huh? Yeah. Oh, yeah, hell convenient. yeah. Pretty convenient. Well, I heard Trudeau so. was pissed off because some dictator had fucking stolen all his thunder. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that, that, oh, uh, yeah. my God, was fantastic. He looks like a pussy in comparison what, now. What, you know, what happens? Just like the rest of his life. What happens if this Ukraine thing just ends early and doesn't become this big thing? What, I mean, it could. Uh, administration uh, do that? Uh, you got the trucker convoy that's about I'm, to start I, up, so. Well, I'm sure they can find something else to divert attention from really what's going uh, on. Sure. So, mm-hmm. hey, COVID's over. But, 
COVID's over. Well, I don't know if that's necessarily true because, uh, you know, rumor is, is that Putin's just trying to make sure Ukraine's fully vaccinated. That's that's the kind yeah, of yeah. Yeah. He's moving in, go. trying to make sure everybody's for the greater. <laughs> it's for for the greater it's the Russian vaccine mandates. It's, it's, you oh, see man. that the Russian person, health department. Yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah. Somebody tweeted out. Ukraine is only 36% vaccinated. Yes, and that's exactly together. why I was saying it. Because it was of like, this. Jesus yes. Christ. Can you imagine <laughs> if Putin nuts, said that dude. in his speech? Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> We're just going in there to get the vaccination numbers <laughs> up. Did you hear what he <laughs> did say? Uh, like, he, did, yeah, he, he, he brought up like WMD and stuff. It's, I was like, well, where have I heard this before? What, yeah, what he, he, also, say, he, he also what brought up uh, hate groups that are there. Yes. Yeah, so, yes. Neo -Nazis. The way, yeah. The way is true, framing it is that the way he's framing it is that um russian the russian people in ukraine are being attacked uh because of their national nationality and that there are neo nazis there that are that are yeah. perpetrating this and that's why that's the excuse for going in um i have actually I, heard that that is true though like there are it, oh, there are groups the, there, but uh, again, this that, is a fucking different don't, area. Um, I have no idea. Yeah. For people that yeah. don't understand, Ukraine is not necessarily some bastion of democracy and freedom. It's, it's Russia not. light. No, it's, it's not. So the you know they're, they're pretty corrupt, as we've heard in the recent presidential <laughs> election. Um, and you know they have political leaders that have their political opponents arrested and things like this. That happens in Ukraine. So I would I would say take everything that you hear from both sides of this thing with a huge grain of salt and. Uh, True. Understand that a lot of people have a lot of motivations for whatever they're talking about. It's all. I mean, prior yeah. to the invasion, I mean, just from brief conversations uh, with uh, a friend of mine's husband, who's Ukrainian, and his parents live there, completely safe. Like this, like you could walk down the streets at night. Like prior to the invasion, of course, this was like a, a pretty yeah. safe country. Uh, it's not like you know even Chicago uh, or bad parts of San Francisco. So yeah, we yeah we don't know what to believe. There's going to be a Twitter narrative, and then uh, you know the the truth, which well, good luck finding it. Yeah, good, luck good luck finding it. I have no idea. Um, I just uh, I I just know that his, my friend uh, my friend's husband's parents refused to leave. They were given every chance. He was like begging them to. He's like, get, get my sister. We'll get you out here. We'll take care of everything. And they're like, nope, we're not going. Yeah. Stubborn. Mm -hmm. I if, if you fucking if you hate Russia and you want to do something to hurt them uh, instead of sanctions, all this bullshit, you know what you should encourage? You should encourage the government to open up the Keystone pipeline and start producing as much possible fucking oil and natural gas and any type of resources here in America yeah. instead of continuing to buy them from Russia and actually become energy independent. Yeah, that, that's things that's that what Joe the Biden priority should down. be. And that's things that can actually hurt them. So that's what I'll put out there. Yeah. As uh, who's still in California? Here. You're you're in California, right, Adam? You're in California. Yes, I am. Yeah. I'm one of the last anti woke people left in California, Gary. Now <laughs> that you've left, oh, man. <laughs> you've Sorry, buddy. Uh, Get out. You're welcome Adam. here. Get out, man. Uh, They're as, coming. That's what everybody says. Nah, They're coming for come you. Come on. Has gas uh, hit six bucks? I haven't. I saw it on the news, but I haven't seen it. But it's definitely been like five five bucks a gallon. It was. So. I'm in Southern California. Left, yeah. I think you were up north, right? I, I was down south for the last uh, few months. Oh yes, San yeah. Diego, I think you yeah. said. Yeah, but I, I'm, I'm yeah, sure we'll it's six see. bucks in San Francisco. I'm sure it is. Obviously, hopefully the pandemic's over. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> it'll be over until it needs yeah, to be it'll back. Never be for, yeah. They yeah. took the mask mandate away in all of the state of California. Only Los Angeles has it left, and they're doing it off of hospital numbers. But it's so since they, you know, basically sent out COVID tests to everyone. Everyone is taking the COVID test. They're not sick at all. And they're reporting the fact that they have COVID. It's like, <laughs> stop already. Well, yeah. I know. Well, hang on. It's, it's, I, don't know if this is, I don't know if this is weird timing or not, but a CDC uh, just uh, unofficially tweeted out, they expect COVID to return 2024 around October. That's what I heard. Interesting. Okay, that's mm. it. Yeah. So, huh. you know, uh, mm. Mm, pretty interesting. Mm. Yeah. Obviously, yeah. that was a joke, so no one can say that I actually said it. Yeah. No, it was a joke. But, We're yeah, I think that what we've learned is that, that – um, you know what? I'm not going to say anything. Let's move on. <laughs> Let's move on. I like Gary. What's channel. up, Jeremy? What you I, want, to, I, I do want too. To Thanks, Jeremy. I, 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 I'll, I'll go to D-Day Cobra to do that one. <laughs> so, right. so, uh, <laughs> I was more wondering what the hell Chrissy was doing down there because huh? I saw her go down and I was like, what are you doing? What? Chrissy? I was like, <laughs> now, <laughs> now, I'm, now I'm paying attention. Yeah. <laughs> I let you walk. I'm eating a, a quarter pounder with no bun. <laughs> That's the uh, way to go. And I'm getting is it Italian? 
tiny burger bits to the dogs. Oh, oh. dogs get to eat too. Is that, is I'm that doing a... keto, so I'm not doing bread. So... Why don't you just fucking oh. order the whole thing and give the damn buns to the dog? <laughs> well, you don't have to give waste your a burger. Little, a little piece of bun. Mm. Could have gotten that Royale uh, with cheese. Dan Vask. <laughs> Royale. Uh, some guy Royale named, with some cheese. Some guy named uh, a Royale with cheese. Some guy named Dan Vask. Little singer guy. He's got a little channel. He's doing okay. Never heard of him. Little I guy. Yet, never he's he's, he's going he's gonna to make it someday, that guy, I think. Uh, uh, for 100 uh, Argentinian pesos. Thank you. Argentinian. S- says it's uh, funny. <laughs> To see people, did I say Argentinian Brazilian? You meant Brazilian. 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 Oh my God. Dan's gonna kill me now. Why did I say Argentinian? <laughs> <laughs> oh, fucking Argentinian! How dare you? How dare you? How dare you? Uh, How dare it's you? funny to see people. I mean, you're all the same down there in South America, anyway, right? Yeah. So uh, it's funny don't speak the same to language see people <laughs> who were <laughs> just the other day. Uh, cheering people. for curfews, <laughs> jab mandates, and legalized theft. Now virtue <clears throat> signaling their outrage for dictators. I know, like warmongering motherfuckers. Either you're for freedom or you're not. Just venting. Hail to you, fellows. And hail to you, you Argentinian bastard. We love you. Hail. <laughs> you have to Why is it the chat? Is like, what? <laughs> uh, what? Yeah, and I, I brought Love that up. I brought that up around the blaze to see the media's reaction to begging, begging for Biden to like send the troops in for freedom of yeah. Ukraine. While in in Canada, we have them cheering on, you know, taking away people's freedoms. Obviously, we're talking about an actual invasion, you know, versus people's people's like health and their their freedoms that way, their personal freedoms. Yeah. But it still doesn't matter. You're still talking about different levels of you know authoritarianism. Mm-hmm. And the media is cheering on one while, uh, you know, condemning the other. Well, the fact that Trudeau yeah. said the word authoritarianism in his fucking speech was hilarious. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. Me off the charts. Like, yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, it's the thing that leftists do. They do the thing that they. Yes. Are you telling projection. them projection. It's projection? They're doing yeah. that thing in front of you, almost like going, eh, eh I got you. Isn't you that can't do yep. in rules about for it. radicals? Like accuse your enemy of what you're doing. Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. 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 It's the same reason why they're all fine sending border patrol agents over to Poland. I could not believe when yeah. I heard we that. We got to protect the border. You know? oh, Poland. Border, Dude, borders Poland. are <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Mr. America, I know a border. <laughs> Just saying. Uh, by the way, uh, this this news has just come in. Uh, someone has discovered that Horizon Forbidden West's protagonist, Aloy, has fully modeled nipples. Yes! What? That's what I'm talking about. They, Bro, have, broken the, they have managed to break the character down and discover and uh there is a they there is actually a piece in the game where they have managed to remove the armor. And the, there is indeed a uh, fully fledged link, Nipoli. It goes with link the tweet, facial hair. Please. <laughs> I will link the tweet. Link you can go retweet. into the <laughs> into the thread. I'll retweet it. I'll retweet it now. Boom. And I'll post it here in the DMs. Everybody go silent for. And then uh, if you go into the thread, somebody it. has uncensored the censoring. But I can show you this, Gary. I can show you this. <laughs> I can show you the censored. The censored one, with a couple of simu loops. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So this is the hold on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't look down here. Don't look down to your right. No, uh, but this is this is the uh, the break in the armor that they've done. And if you scroll down to this chappy on the row, row, it's pussies. That wow. didn't meant to, that wasn't meant to happen. <laughs> that wasn't meant to happen. Hey, it's painted art. That's what it is. Then it's, it's uh, you, you, then yes, there is. They're, they're going to come under so much fucking attack. I know. Them. It's going to be like, imagine a sick game developer sitting there oh. modeling nipples for nipples. her. <laughs> That's what they're going to Woke do. on woke yep. crime. It's going to be yep. so Mary beautiful. Sue and it's going to turn out that that tomorrow. developer is like a lesbian woman. We and, made her yeah, look more <laughs> masculine <laughs> because we don't believe in toxic masculinity. <laughs> Here, have some nipples. Mm-hmm. Uh, Uber yeah. Geek for $50 says if Hollywood 
hasn't got at least three war dramas about the Ukraine filming by December 2022, I will be disappointed. Get Patrick Stewart out of his coffin to play Putin. Also, clearly Putin <laughs> invading Ukraine isn't as bad as uh, mean tweets because he's still on Twitter. Oh, is he? I oh wow! Wow! Hmm. Wow! What's that? Wow. Oh, oh Putin, Putin is still on Twitter. <laughs> yeah, I know a president who is. I mean, it's not yeah, like I was thinking the, the same thing. Uh, <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> Did Putin have mean tweets? Because that's the only way you get taken off. If you have mean tweets. So when Putin said, "I, I thought they speak I louder than was... words," so uh, yeah. I mean, you know, I think Putin should be on Twitter. I thought yeah. insurrection. I think 100 kicked off Twitter. <laughs> For, that was only if you pro- only if you promote it like, that was the right. thing was like, he's encouraging his people if you uh, actually go through with the insurrection no that's fine by the tos of twitter he's yeah you can stay on it's nope. like he's invaded countries like yeah but is he encouraging others too no <laughs> exactly yeah <laughs> Oh no, I'm not like Twitter's fine. TOS. No big well, deal. No. Yeah, this was uh that, that reminds me of this right here. Uh what Starting Star war in Europe said. for the first time since 30. Have you guys ever thought about how Twitter banned Trump for causing violence, but Russia just completely invaded a sovereign nation and all their accounts are still active? Look at that. <laughs> like, no doubt. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. Team up. Star for the win. Wow. Keem. Wow. You, Ukraine's been tweeting a lot lately. <laughs> yeah. How, Watch them gotta... get banned. Watch them Dang. get flagged for misinformation. <laughs> well, independent journalists reporting in Ukraine have been getting banned. Yeah. Go figure. Look, it's not yeah. as if media matters. I mean, it's not as if China reporting that America are building uh, biological weapons on the border of Poland or anything like that at all. I'm a Keemstar fan. I like trying to kick shit up. No, 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 no. It's fine. It'd be re. He's a great he understand, he, he, he understands the internet yeah, better than he does. most. He truly understands the internet. Yeah, uh, is this bad? bad. Is yeah. Should we get back on? to Aloy's now? Aloy's tits. <laughs> yeah. uh-huh. Go tits. Is, is what's going on in Ukraine? More important question: Is what's going on in Ukraine worse than January six? Mm. No. Uh, no, hell yeah. Probably the answer is no. According oh, no. to every January six, the worst uh, thing that's ever happened. Okay. <laughs> this is their January 6 moment. That's what it is. Yeah. This is my moment. Me. Ukraine, my you know, Ukraine, moment. the Ukraine invasion is uh With Putin's you? January 6 moment. That's what that's yep. what the headline will be. Yep. Mm-hmm. Hey, Alex Jones predicted it. So. He did. Yep. Yeah. He did. Is Jeremy frozen for anybody else? Just me. Oh, I know, he, yeah, no, he's he's right. <laughs> <laughs> my, 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 January sixth uh, is. I just worse thought he saw Ukraine something day. very important. My camera died. Hey, my camera Garrett, died. Can you pull up? Uh, can you pull up uh, Alex Jones' prediction? A hundred percent. Oh Hang God, on. that was I great. I got it right here. We'll get there first. We'll get there first. Yeah, right. first. There's going to be a war in February. Uh, did he really predict this? Uh, he did. Yeah, he, he, yeah, he did. There's going to be war in he, February. Yeah, yeah him and there was someone else also who. He said, "Yeah, predictions are leading to a war." They're not with uh, the New World Order. But we're looking at a giant war in February right now. Currently, that's the projections with the top people on the earth who claim they're not with uh, the New World Order combine. Is war in February? October 21st, 2021. This is the type of time, like right before World War I, right before World War II, when everything kicks off. Damn. Powder Mm. keg, baby. That's him? Yep. Yep. Right again, Alex Jones was right. Put it in the jar again, <laughs> again, again. again. That's the <laughs> thing. It's <laughs> again and again yeah. and again. Mm-hmm. And well, you're kind of like wanting him to be. You wanting him to be like the crazy no. little man that just says weird he stuff. And he, he wants and he's to not, be the crazy right. man. That's it's wrong. like he's right, <laughs> and he's right. Yeah, and he's right, and he's right, and he's right. It's like, Eric. oh no, fuck. You, you you're meant to be him. like entertain. You know, just like fun and said, oh that. That guy is right again. Yep. But what he does is he pays attention to what they say because they will tell you what they're doing. Mm-hmm. They don't hide it. Like you go look at the, the World Economic Forum. They're telling you what <gasps> oh, yeah. they're doing to you. The the Great Reset, you know, at comics, you know. Just get him banned. Yes, get him banned. Build, yeah. build back better. Get that Friday There's... Night Tights banned for having him on. Get them back. Right. Get him banned. YouTube, look correct. who they had on Friday Night Tights. By the way, I'm going to go into this show in a couple of weeks' time when I get my fucking clout. Yep. They said, uh-huh. they said, <clears throat> we are looking at every possible idea. No idea. And I want to be clear. This is what they said. I want to be clear. No idea is off the table. 
They said that. Wow. They're telling you exactly what they are trying to do. They're not hiding it. And Alex is just keyed into it. Yep. Damn straight. Somebody yeah. thought. Yeah. And no, I'm going to know the. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> You know it's rare when you have to say someone talk on Friday Night Tights because usually you're trying your best to say something on this show. <laughs> hey, again, like, right, where can I work myself in? When can I work myself in? Oh shit! This is uh, this is CNN going going uh, for an Oscar. This is CNN going oh, yeah. for an Oscar. I saw yeah. this. I saw it. I saw what I just heard a big bang right here behind me. I thought we shouldn't have done the live shot here. There are big explosions taking place in Kiev right now. Oh, there's another one. I've got a flat jacket right here. Let me just get it, get it off. Ah, no so, way. Sure, you're perfectly safe at your hotel. Yeah. Uh, Wait, hold the, up, hold up. Did I miss it? No, there was that, no. Yeah, there was yeah a green was, screen. There was, it looked like a green. I thought it looked like was a green, green screen. Was that a green screen when it panned down? Hold on. Okay, go, yeah, go, go, go back. I'll bring, I'll bring go it back. back up. I'll bring it go back. Go back. Up. Yeah. Not another. I green. Thought, at the end, I thought it was a. Uh, I thought it was a green screen as well. I didn't see that. Yeah. Hang on. Mm. Side, like, side of my pause eye. it towards the end, yeah. When he leans here. down. Right here. Let me just get it, get it off. <gasps> Wait. No, that's, no, that's no, like that's the, just railing. the railing. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You can see, okay. you can see I was the say, thing. Man, yeah. I wouldn't be surprised, though. The media does shit like that. <laughs> yeah. Well, they, they pretend that they're yeah. in locations that they really aren't, so it, that would yeah, just be and, hilarious. And everybody well, right now. There's actually everybody. a wider shot of that where you're actually able to see the um, the railing behind them. Yeah, yeah everybody well, I mean, is dramatizing like that because it, it gives clicks. You know, right. The, right now, Fox News scene, everybody is getting more people watching them right now than they've had their in, job. In, in yeah, a this long is absolutely ass not saying this. that nothing's going on in Kiev, folks, right. at all. This is saying that CNN are fucking trying to milk and make yeah. up shit. For oh, yeah. Well, it's, not yeah. Just yeah. CNN. it's like, oh, let's start a live shot. Be like, I, I, this I'm is what really they sorry. Need. I need to start. I need to grab my helmet for this, you know, uh, yeah. stuff like that. Sure, sure, yeah, sure. Did you just hear that that shot? Somebody shot at me from outside. Well, Mrs. Mm -hmm. Oh, and again, get down. Somebody, somebody get shot down. at me from. So, Papa, get down. From, uh, uh, yeah, I'm just I, gonna have to. So, uh, yeah, look at this right here. I'm sure you guys remember this right here. Okay. Um, yep. <laughs> yeah. Here, yeah. In Wilmington, North Carolina, right at the Intracoastal, and we're in one of these bands. In sports. In sports. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, so great. That's so. Uh, uh, that was fucking worse. Uh, <laughs> got him. Oh, got him. Uh, Breaking news, though. I, I did. I found a photo of the person that was shooting those fire, the, the shots in the background. This is him. Mm -hmm. If you guys see who this is, please report it to the military or the police or anybody you can. <laughs> this he's on the run <laughs> right now, so please report. Please report. No one's, gonna, it's like no one's gonna get it. It's like when who Elijah tweeted that out the other day, and people like thought he was <laughs> fucking serious. They're like, who what? is it? Seriously? What a bad man? Know. That's the man we're looking for. He's an evil man named Sam Hyde. No. <laughs> oh, <okay. laughs> <laughs> he did it. What what's going on well, with the poll for Robert Patterson? Oh no. What oh good? yeah. What does it say? <laughs> <laughs> I like that actually. <laughs> but I could I could just imagine that you're You're whispering so it, fat. Ryan. You're so fucking fat. <laughs> I, I told Why Porter Black purge? that the other day. He did. Yeah, he did. Oh, yeah. I appreciate it. <laughs> Porter Black asked, like, he's like, fat shame me so I won't eat or something like that. Oh. And and everyone was like, oh, you're not that fat, Porter Black, but you can do this. You got it. I just said, what did I, I just said, you're really fucking fat. Yeah, you're Stop fucking eating. disgusting. Oh. <laughs> Stop eating. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're quarter fat. <laughs> no, I'm more I, half I fat than I, quarter, really. He asked for it. So I appreciate it. I was just trying to motivate him. Got me to the gym. I went to the gym. There's a, yeah, there's this awesome picture of it, like a dude who fucking lost a shit ton of weight where it's like this oh, guy yeah. got fake. tired it's of his fake. best it's friend. Fake. It's fake. It's fake. It's fake. Really? Uh, why? Just because he's skinny now? Uh, uh, 
men posting their W's posted afterwards. Uh, sorry, it was a fake, guys. No, oh, that mm -hmm. sucks. Let's make it real. Yeah. I'll, I'll do it. Real. I'll be that man. Hey, I've I'll been, be, I'll I've be been the texting you. you want. I've been texting you, bro, trying to get you to go to the gym. It's not about the gym. It's about the diet. We oh, can do the... He's right. Yeah. It's about the food. What do you eat, comics? Food. Food. Dick. Pussy. <laughs> <laughs> I suspect Ryan eats a lot of dick. <laughs> wow! Ooh, with a fork and a knife. He took down to a compliment from? for you to uh, burn on Ryan. Uh, comics, <laughs> comics, comics is just like sat there going, I'm going to build in a right fucking uh, massive insult. I feel tonight. like for a dick, you'd need like a lot of salt and pepper. It would be no, probably comics. Bland. I don't know who's going to fucking get it, but one of them is going to fucking get some. <laughs> comics, comics, comics division. He's got a notebook there. He's writing it down. Comics division eats second breakfast and 11sies. That's what he eats. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was going to go there and I was like, nah, it's too mean. I'm the going there. Care of it. <laughs> I'm going there. Uh, Afternoon tea. Michael Plowman. That's a la That's a good Ooh, last name. Michael Plowman. Plowman. <laughs> Mr. Plow, that name again. Yeah, this is as. Yeah. On, on uh, that bat whammon note, instead of calling him Black Joker, would you... Could you not have called him dark humor? Oh, that's a stretch. <laughs> that's, a stretch. <laughs> that's pretty good. Uh, Funny thing is, even, even the, even the woke you. people are just referring to it as black joke. <laughs> right? Yeah. Like, they, they called her black Batwoman. <laughs> like, that, 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 that's just how she was talking about, and everyone was referencing her. So well, It's because it's a brand new made-up character for the CW to virtue signal. She stole my name. Stole my pussy. Stole my name. Stole my name. Hey, I want to share something stole Mahler. My name, stole my name. Uh, Say, actually, baby. here, I'm going to give you the link. Come. Quarter, oh. quarter black, and then you can share it because it'll, it'll be easier. It's Mahler's tweet Fuck about you. Hassan. Oh. And him DMCing, oh, no. like, all the bad takes. I, I think that's funny. That shit's funny. It is. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> is that on his Holocaust take? Is that what he wants to take down? He realized, <laughs> oh man. No, Ooh. see, when when you find out he wants to take down a take, it's like, oh, which of the thousands of takes are you actually referring <laughs> which to? Which one could it possibly be? <laughs> but the Holocaust take, he's completely playing with fire. I mean, messages. Get him down. I don't know. Get him down. Get him down. Get Get him down. Like, he's the one that shares him every time he shares his screen. I know. That's why I look for him. He knows the pain. He knows. The pain. Good thing I don't say anything. Or I ignore him completely. No. It's just uh, the topless pics. We bro, Hassan, Hassan had 130,000 people watching him on Twitch yesterday. Really? Ooh. Wow. Yeah. A lot of dumb people when out he was there, talking about Ukraine people. and shit. Yeah. 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 How, how much of that is hate watching, though? I don't. It's uh, tough to tell. He, he, pull, he, he pulls a big audience he, regardless. He, he typically has thirty to 40,000 on his yeah. normal stream yeah. where he's uh, uh, sitting there eating chicken nuggets that his mother made him while watching the food. Network. <laughs> yeah. watching so somebody his else's mom video. comes in. His mom literally comes in and like gives it to him. Wow. <laughs> Have you seen that? Yeah. No. Seriously, yeah. buddy. He's she a fucking scary hero. Yeah. Well, Maul, I know Mahler, Mahler and, and Jay have been like, no, been just ha he's. Been, I guess you guys have had some. He's has he called you guys up directly, Mahler? The reason this happened, if I'm right, Mahler, is because he was reacting to one of Jay's videos, and by reacting, I mean he just sit there and let it play for like half an hour. He left right? the fucking Go room. Get some nuggies. <laughs> nah. Nuggies. It's the yeah. it's something that he does. He just he just steals other people's stuff and entertains his audience with it. And he's literally said like the main reason is he couldn't possibly leave chat unentertained. That would be horrible. Yeah. Jeez. It's like yeah, I guess you could just steal other people's stuff. Oh, work. And yeah, now um he's getting annoyed because apparently people are who Flipping used to clip bad him. <laughs> yeah, who used to clip him like positively, like oh check out this fun thing Hassan did or this fun reaction now they're like oh my god check out how bad this take is now he's getting upset because <laughs> that's not how it's supposed to work you're supposed to be sick of fans what are you doing mm. that's funny people have unironically clipped Hassan this I'm learning this for the very no, first time. maybe it'll eventually <laughs> I've been noticing he has fans <laughs> apparently 
maybe it'll change to the point where it's like DSP and all the all the detractors get more interaction <laughs> than he does. Maybe yeah. that'll eventually happen in two years. The tides are gonna turn. He's been hella toxic. Even clip channels are being annoying and commenting in the description on how you're wrong. Why are they Aww. clipping me then? <laughs> like if my own fucking clip channels are clipping all of my videos <laughs> to make money, <laughs> why are you fucking clipping wrong information then? If that's the you case, said it. Oh, you because you <laughs> said it, you <laughs> dipshit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will destroy this the hot zombie is... clips industrial complex. I have. I will make what Russia is doing to Ukraine look like wow. little kisses to the hot zombie. That's another one. Oh, that is another one. one. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hey, Hassan, there's another <laughs> horrible there's take there's from you right there. My YouTube videos uh, from my fucking Twitch, stealing this shit because I allow them to, so they can make money <laughs> off of it. Just to make me look fucking bad or shit on me? What the fuck is Dude, you're a socialist. Isn't, <laughs> isn't, isn't this what you, you make do yourself look bad? I, even you know, I haven't been on YouTube for a long like time. That. I've been noticing it's been hella... Guys, it's so fucking funny that, like, when they <laughs> clip him positively, he's like, this is all working great. And when they clip him and he's sort of stupid, he's like, wait a minute, I didn't hey. sign up for this. I will ruin your life. <laughs> I, I love... I really like the, the logo he had. Putin is very bad. <laughs> 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 So yeah, it, that just shows you that, that sometimes you know somebody, you get lucky in the algorithm, and all of a sudden, forty thousand people are watching you, and you're literally fucking retarded. Yeah. Like, yes. you happen to be a nephew of a guy that likes to fuck horses and is in the charge of a yeah. massive well, leftist organization that works with YouTube exclusively to get on the trending pages. <clears throat> you know, just things. Uh, well, I mean, I, I Rippa Rippa talks about this all the time, but like. And I agree with him. I like I can see why people have followings generally. You know what I mean? Like this person's entertaining, yeah. or they got to. Mm -hmm. I, I don't understand it with him. Like I don't mm -hmm. understand yeah. how he has. Like, do I know why Tim Pool has forty, fifty thousand people watching? Absolutely. I don't necessarily think he's the most entertaining guy, but he is good at what he does. He's consistent, and he brings amazing discussions to the table, and he does a good job of it. The consistency is the key there. I don't know what it is about Hassan and how he pulls such a big audience. I just don't. It's strange. It's Hassan really does this like attached to the Young Turks, I would imagine. That's Hassan how they got, does this gallows humor thing where he, where he gets people from the the chat and he responds to them and then he like bans them. They'll be like subs for six months or two years or something yeah. like that, and they'll ask him some Whoa. some ridiculously. Like innocuous question. question, yeah, exactly. And he'll lose his fucking shit. That's why I like I can't tell if people because I mean, from my perspective, it is kind of entertaining. I mean, you know, in a weird kind of way, seeing this guy just completely shit on these people that love him to death, you wonder <laughs> like what is up with these fucking sycophant crazy people. But I, that's why I always wonder how many how many are hate watching him. And how many are sincere, like, I'm a subscriber? Because I guess somebody was saying that you have to be a subscriber to chat. Like, his chat is subs only or whatever. So uh -huh. to actually respond to him, you have to be a sub. Smart. And I, th I want, also, I wonder, like, how many people are, are just playing this game where, like, what can I say that will get me banned? Because I, I've considered... Like mm -hmm. going into Hassan's chat and playing this game because it's a little entertaining, right? You're like, what can I say to drive Hassan insane? Yeah. Well, you can and use your Amazon Prime. Oh, can it's you? free. You, you you use your Amazon Prime to sub to him. That hasn't cost you anything because you're already You know, it's free as part of but your Amazon. So people still have sends Hassan money. People, so really yeah, no, it still sends him money, game. but it allows you to get into the conversation and say something fucking stupid. And if you get banned, do you give a shit? Don't give a shit. No. I feel like a lot of kids too. They have like twenty accounts, so they're they're not intimidated by getting banned on one account. So, but it is yeah. it is a little fascinating, and it is very much like authoritarian dictator type stuff. So, um, it's, but it's, well, a, it's a commie. So yeah. it's a yeah, simple just situation. Don't ask about the Albanian it genocide. Yeah, it, it's yeah. half it's half people <laughs> that that hate him and like to laugh at him, and then the other half are just simp's that are just like, "Please ban me, daddy." That's what it is. It's just like, oh, he gave uh, me, you know, attention. He he canceled yeah. me. There, therefore, now I'm like one of the greats. 
He looks Isn't at that me. weird though? Yeah, it's a like, crazy can't phenomenon. Cut my head off in front of everyone. But there's, yeah. <laughs> but there's Twitter accounts. There's Twitter accounts that people that say I will ban you, like celebrity ones, and they'll go, just come to you know, you want to get banned, just come to me and I'll ban you. So they go oh, yeah. like, ban me, and they'll just ban them, and they'll be like, yeah, I got banned like, by such and exactly. Such. It's, 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 it's a very thing. light it's a thing. It's like very, very light internet S and M. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it is. There it's, you go. It's exactly. Digital S and M. That's exactly what it yeah. is. There are people like if someone that you feel is notable blocks you and you don't like them, it's like a scalp that you took for some people. You know what I mean? They so, do that, yeah, yeah. Where they they do like the block thing. So I got into letting people or blocking people just to to get the screenshot out of them, and then I would unblock them immediately. Because it completely deflates them. Yeah, uh, <laughs> it's a good oh, tactic. It like is that. a good tactic. Good. Yeah, I got a, I got a wonderful tweet here for uh, for Ryan. Mm -hmm. uh, this is this has come from a fast food chain. I think it's some uh -oh. sort of quality. I don't know. Welcome to McDonald's. How can I fuck up your order today? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Bubba, Bubba would not get your order wrong. <laughs> that's, that's, that's the smile of a guy who's gonna get your order no, no. <laughs> that, that, no, that guy will act, that guy actually does look like he gives a fuck and then he'll get my order right but you know, that's not what any mcdonald's employee fucking looks like <laughs> <laughs> i don't know what mcdonald's not, not saying look like, like you just the, the smile part the just the smile part isn't what any mcdonald's <laughs> he, employee this, like. this, this guy's just saying did i get your order right and you're just like yeah yeah. yeah, you did. He's yeah, like, sure. you have a good day. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this Dude. guy looks like he's giving it a try. And you, you know? drive out and you got a tear coming down your eye because it's such an emotional It was experience. a beautiful moment. Yeah. I, I think the last time I, I went to McDonald's, you. I think the last time I went to McDonald's before I went with Jeremy, I was with Jay when we were driving back from Gainesville. I wasn't even hungry, but Jay wanted to fucking stop so because he was hungry. So we stopped and I get food because we're there and they fucked my shit up. <laughs> like they, they, they're like, hey, uh, did they get Jay's right? Did they get Jay's right? Yes. Like, they're like, oh. <laughs> they're like order, new it's order weird... come with extra spit. It's like <laughs> order forty one. They're like order forty one or whatever it was. Are you so telling them to go there. fuck themselves when you're ordering or something? Like, what's going on? He's ordering special my, I think stuff. it's just my it's fucking... Like, he just, just... No, I'm not ordering crazy shit. No, 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 no. He does, he does onions, order crazy stuff. Can I but get he does... an extra tomato? And Ryan, I don't want sesame yeah. seed on my butt. <laughs> I want you to take... I want the sesame seed bun, but not the sesame Ryan, seed. Yeah, Ryan exactly. brings a lot of negative energy everywhere he goes. He's loud. He's obnoxious. He's act, like I I'm Don't face palming most of the time I'm in public with him because he's one of these guys that's just he thinks everybody needs to hear the conversation he's having within a hundred mile radius and I'm going shut the fuck maybe up. Ryan I'm is right black. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of self hatred in there, Ryan. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I, I do feel like if I'm gonna waste the time speaking, everyone might as well hear it. Uh, but. <laughs> I, 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 maybe it is just the fact that I usually look and sound like I hate the person I'm interacting with. Like maybe that's part well, of the reason why. Because you do. Why, it but... could be the bad vibe you're putting yeah. off. Yeah. No, no, fuck you guys. Jeremy, pull up the Fazoli's clip. Where, hold on. Jeremy, can you find the Fazoli's? Hold on. Yes, uh, give me the Fazoli's. Because yeah, I, I was so yeah, excited yeah. because Fazoli's isn't great, but it, I, it's something I really like. It's not, a, it's not fast food. It's Italian food. Fast. And uh, it's so fast I, Italian food. Exactly. It's so and I saw one driving and I was like, you know what? I'm going to stop here. I love Fazoli's. And I was excited. I was positive. I was happy. Look, he really was. It, 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 it's, it's pretty so great. Good. It's so good. Shout out to Steph for putting this together. I want Fazoli's. Let's see if they get the wrong order for Ryan. Oh, my God. Hope not. I'm gonna get a side pepperoni pizza, and I'm gonna get a dozen breadsticks. Dozen what? Breadsticks. That's a lot. That's what we're gonna do. Yeah. Yeah. I had a Savannah pie. I get a pet slice and a dozen Asian braces. That's what I get for you. Oh man, you! Were, I wasn't even talking. I didn't even know. I was you were talking listening. to the Can chat. I also do uh, a side of marinara sauce. All right, thank you. Look how excited he is. Look at him. Mm. He's like, he, he, he. we're getting the Savannah pie. <laughs> awesome thank you so much uh, and there's utensils in there perfect thanks <laughs> 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 
and it's and it falls apart this right here. Breadsticks. Oh, these. No, 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 no. Dozen. <laughs> I ordered a fucking oh, dozen man. breadsticks, bro. You guys I heard me, right? He clapped. Dozen right. breadsticks. Chrissy. These motherfuckers don't even put it on there. You guys fucking heard it. We have it fucking live. Why does this happen to me? <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're not going to have a Taco Bell milk. Uh, we're not have a Taco Bell milk now. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> like a little. Uh, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> you got like strong order, nice. man. Hi there. Like, there it's, go. it's to go. I had done a, a drive through order, and I yeah. guess they didn't put the dozen extra breadsticks in the marinara sauce. They got repeated back to me on the receipt. So oh, I need a dozen breadsticks yeah. in the marinara sauce Oof. to go. It's always fun to like wait at the drive thru and then wait here. Oh! Yeah, like, oh. oh. Wow! Was fire. That's coming with that shit. Yeah, yeah. I was telling you yeah, how much I'm fire. Wow. Hold on, yes. for being positive about one thing in my fucking life. Can I get those <laughs> fucking oh, breadsticks and the sauce? That's all I need. Damn. I gotta get back to the car. Oh, the car. <laughs> You're the only one here that gives a fuck, clearly, so thank you. <laughs> 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 Listen, 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 Pricks. Fuck! <laughs> the fucked up part is I know I'm gonna like it. I know it's gonna taste good. They fucked me in the drive through. They fucked me in the drive through. They fucking did. They fucked me in the drive through from the very fucking beginning. Joe Pesci knew oh, fucking bread. Watch, sticks. watch. He likes it. Look, look. That's fucking good. God. <laughs> 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 Oh, wow! Oh my god, dude! Someone wow. needs to clip that. I him screaming "fuck." You can put that on the soundboard. If oh, that was an actor, right? that would be the funniest fucking sketch you've seen in your life. Uh, yeah. <laughs> it was just on a live stream. I had 500 people watching me on like my 10,000 sub <laughs> channel, watching me bitch about my fucking fazolis. Uh, now, uh, Ryan, would you would you have done that if you were not on a live stream? I would have said a lot of different words that I can't Some say. Gamer on words. I feel like he'd be weird. Oh, with okay, to, to, to confirm. To confirm. To confirm. To confirm. Went to see Venom with him in wow. where were we at? Where were we at? Boston. Yeah. He made people move from the seats. <sighs> they walked. We were all the way up top. Ryan was just like, Wait, so he talks look at this bad. movie. Oh, yes, he talks during movies. Oh, 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 I can't, I can't Ryan. watch it. Oh, he's Ryan. that guy. He's, he's the that worst guy. Guy person, Ryan. He's that guy. Hey, Ryan. All right, so he made these people move. Oh. These fucking yeah. people. Now, they weren't pussies. They were fucking they, wearing they were, masks. I, no, I get that, but you were still obnoxious. So he, <laughs> they, they get up. I can't deal with then, people that talk during movies. And, and, yeah, and then they go all the way to the front of the fucking theater to get away from him. But then Jay lays down in their seats and goes to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Here's, the thing. Here's the thing. If it was Typical a good Jay. movie, I wouldn't have fucking said a goddamn word. I would have enjoyed it. But it was dumb as fuck. So Is I made Jay remarks about every dumb thing that I Ah, oh, dude, I would have. What was the movie? Me this. Ryan, do you like hot It was hot? Venom. It was Venom. Oh, I, Venom I like, was, I yeah. Do, Venom was I'm terrible. Okay you can hot. talk you during like Venom. Thoughts? How are you yeah. at swimming? Um, I'm actually a really good swimmer, but I do have a massive dick. So, I don't know, I don't know where that <laughs> you get sauce in your purse. You get some, you get, you know. <laughs> at least, yeah, at least Mrs. Nerdotic and I know to sit Not away good. from people because she, she she and I talk throughout entire fucking movies. But we, we are, at least we are civil enough to stay as far away from people as possible so we don't get killed. Shame. And I bet y'all are quiet, too. Well, you can talk if you're at home, Gary. Jeez, just don't go to the movie theater. Yeah. <laughs> I you know, it's, like, it's like, uh, part of it's my like job. that Seinfeld yeah, episode not where they're going to go to the movie. That Seinfeld episode where they're going to go to the movies and everybody ends up canceling on Jerry's like, what am I supposed to do? Make sarcastic remarks to myself? That's me. <laughs> yes. That's me. Yes. <laughs> yes. So. Oh, my God. Bad, you me dirty I do it quietly to my wife, just like this. You know, you guys, you guys can quiet. go back and watch. Yo, um, dude, say it again. Hmm? What? Say it, it again. Who, who, say what? Hmm? 
In all, in all respect to Ryan, it is the worst thing in the world when they get your order wrong. I think we can all agree with that. So. It's not the worst thing in the world. It's, it's pretty terrible. I fucking hate it. It's, 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 it's almost as bad as people that get on their phones in movies. It depends how far away you are. If you've driven all the way home and they've gotten your order wrong, you're that's like what happened. Devas and, like, devastated. Yeah. That happened to me. But I, I, Ryan, I honest, when I watched that video, it kind of felt like you ordered into the live stream. Yeah, I did. not really into the thing. I, like, agree. I feel like maybe you. It was his you thought you ordered, but now, Adam. But here's the thing, though. I, <laughs> I totally hear you. But I was talking to the live stream, and the bitch repeated it back to me. Oh, you she did. Hear it in that, you can hear okay. she repeated what I wanted back to me, including it was on the dozen receipt, breadsticks. Right? And no, it wasn't on the receipt. That was the what if there was okay. a person that inside right? that she was repeating it back to, and then she went to you. <laughs> When what she if gave there was you, a person? Ryan, does that make it right though you... to treat that person the way that you treated them? Oh, no. Oh, I, me? Don't, oh, I, don't open oh, that. We all know the book. answer to that. <laughs> I, I, I kind of wonder if she Anna heard Anna. you talking about fucking the order up and she fucked it up intentionally. We no. all know the order to that. I treated all the people in there with much more respect than they fucking deserve. I'll tell you that, Michael. <laughs> and the, I was calm as shit. And I complimented. That's calm? The, Yes, That's you yes. calm? in the store. In the store, he was calm. He was, I was calm, calm in the okay, store. Okay. Yeah. And the the guy that you I saw to, to, to be fair, to, to, to be clear, to be clear, he, in in that moment in the live stream in the store when he was in the store, he was more respectful on the live stream than he is when he's not live. Absolutely, because <laughs> hey, I didn't, scary. I didn't want, I didn't want to, you know, <laughs> say some of the things I normally would have said. I didn't want that necessarily captured on video. Uh, well, you man, there's part, there, 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 look, somebody look, would have captured it. There, there, there's Ryan's part credit, to Ryan's credit, I've I've eaten out a, a few times with you at restaurants. You're super nice all the way through, and it's until it's wrong is whenever you you turn yeah. into a. I, 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 look, I, I have demon having Ryan. PTSD, like remind, reminding myself of the New Orleans situation with me and Jeremy. I would rather go through what I went through with Jeremy in New Orleans <laughs> a thousand times over than ever go to a restaurant with with Ryan based off of that. <laughs> uh, uh, so for context, uh, we were we were doing car video live streams in New Orleans. I was looking for hookers uh, and because uh, <laughs> I wanted to go through that. I wanted to see I wanted to see hooker and I wanted Odin. <laughs> experience seeing a real hooker in new orleans so then we ended up in front of like rolling down the window and he's like hey (laughs) (laughs) so then did we end up near like you're under arrest did we end up near one of the churches you go to yeah i drove by my church because i was was like i don't drive down here very often so i was like (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> very often so you do do sometimes then okay <laughs> then, then i had to go to church can. to go to church so only on for, those lonely for, lonely nights for further context like o- <laughs> odin is very socially awkward in terms of he does not like yeah. people around he freaks uh, social out anxiety, yeah yeah social anxiety like he freaks out like when we went to star wars mm. celebration Aww. i left him in the car because oh, it, dude, it, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Did so you i had to go window? in I had to go in because uh, I, I had to. You I had some to, water. To, yeah, uh, I can't. What's the name of that place? Uh, it's a massive uh, convention. The arena uh, of Anaheim. Yeah. Anyway, it, it's yeah. yeah. No, in Chicago. So anyway, uh, it was uh, Anna and Jesse were inside, so I had to go find them. So I was like, Odin, stay here with the car because we pulled up. So I leave it, and he looks at me like he's gonna die, and I'm like, Are you okay? He goes, Please hurry. I'm like, okay. <laughs> Hey, fucking pussy. You know, so like I'm just like, like go back out. There. I come back out there, and there were response. cars in front. But he was like, he looked like a a dog that had been <laughs> beaten, and he was only there for like Aww. ten minutes by himself. He was terrified because there was a car behind him. There was a car in front of him, and he's freaking the fuck out. Damn. But anyway, because what ten minutes? It. Like when you have when you have social anxiety for ten ten minutes feels like an eternity. So it was yes. just. Especially yeah, in like Chicago, where you could literally get yeah. killed at any time. Oh, there's, there's, pocket, there's, there's, a, windows. Yeah, there's another oh. layer here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and so the, the yeah. Chicago layer. That's right. I'm not racist. Chicago. I have social anxiety. <laughs> 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 Only when I drive in the wrong neighborhood. I, it's I, very I, I definitely I'm wanna, anxious about uh, getting robbed. <laughs> I, I definitely, I definitely want to hang out with Odin again, and we can go look for hookers. Yeah, I, I do fun, not so. think Odin would feel comfortable in a restaurant with me. No, uh, I, I don't. I think. I I fucking hate fun. hanging out with you, <laughs> Ryan. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring a fucking comfy cushion, and I want to sit down. And I want to order everything on the menu, and once you go, 
<laughs> yeah, I, I, I am I'm fucking respectable or respectful to people in there. And even in that live stream, the guy that had nothing to do with it, uh, I I was mm-hmm. obviously fucking pissed. But I said it's it's not your fault. Somebody messed up mm-hmm. the order, so can I get yeah. this? And I'm sitting here waiting, the DSP, and waiting, and waiting, the DSP and waiting, and waiting, and waiting for fucking a dozen breadsticks. I'm waiting. That's all fault. it is. I could see him there. So as soon as they got him up, I said, "Can, can I just fucking get those and go?" Because that's all I'm waiting for. Of course, by the time I get over the back to the car, car, my other shit's cold. If you guys notice, the sun was fucking up when I went in that goddamn Pinzolis. And it was, it was not. It was dark it was when you got out. <laughs> when I went dark, back yeah. to the car. Damn. So, uh, so sometimes you just gotta take a loss on that breadsticks, man. I mean, yeah, take yeah. yeah. <laughs> fuck them. Take them. Yeah. Ryan Kennel causing shit everywhere. I, he goes. I just like to make I just like to make the point that I have always been respectful of the person that is holding my food and handling yes, my food, and I'll here. continue that's to a, do that. That's a solid so rule if for you want to spit yeah, in is. someone's food, do it with Ryan's. I respect you. I think that you're great, and I don't want you fucking with my food. You can yeah. spit. You can fucking do. You can come in my food. If I don't notice it, I don't give a fuck. I just want my room to get right. I'm not That's associated with want. Ryan okay? Kittle from no. RK Outpost. Just oh, give no. it to. Oh, just fucking oh, give me the right shit no. that I ordered. No, Ryan, that is not the quote you want. I, I'd rather have my like, <laughs> food order exactly. be come free and be wrong than anything else. Yeah. Yeah. No. yeah, I would rather get. Like, I'd rather not have the bread. I don't want. Right. What, what did he say? Number one, we gave right. him the secret sauce. <laughs> so you they ordered an apple, they give you an orange. Right, right. 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 The apple, but Ryan would go it's one it. thing to get a BLT without some tomato or something, and it's another one to get like splooge I'll, all over it. So I, I would like yeah. to announce if that I didn't uh, notice. I am not. I am not <laughs> affiliated with with Ryan Kennel. I am not either. I am not affiliated with. Ryan. Make us clear. <laughs> Especially when we're. Ordering I mean, you food. guys. He I'm just so in glad the Navy. there's not a in the UK or whatever the fuck it's going. Yeah, if they if they slip the splooge under the bacon, the it's fine. It's fine. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if it's a fucking lasagna, you mix it in, and I don't fucking. Uh, know. No, just give me the right. It, it does order. matter, Ryan. It matters. Oh, it's weird. Fuck. No. X-ray girl, you're not helping. She's uh, like a different, a different type of mayo sauce. Is what you're <laughs> <doing>. <laughs> oh, <X-ray. laughs> you got to admit this is like Just no fear. This is no fear right here. Unbreaded. Uh, Unbreaded. 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 Uh, yeah. Just get my fucking order right. And they cut out. <laughs> Luckily, they if cut out the If it's got part. a loogie in it, it ain't right. It ain't right. <laughs> <laughs> right there with you, Jeremy. Touchdown. They cut out the part in my live stream. I'm breaded. Luckily, where I literally just ho- wished that yes. they would all die. Like every yes. single person at Fazoli, except the guy that Good job, me. Steph, on right. that. Cutting that yes, one same. out before yep. you put it on the Smart Game Gamer channel. So. <laughs> I can only take solace in knowing that in three or four years, all those motherfuckers are going to be replaced by machines and be out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Unbreaded. <laughs> unbreaded. I was literally unbreaded that night. You were. And he gave me my fucking breadsticks. I was unbreaded. We have a two-part super chat from uh, wow. Mr. Steve Hodge. Uh, $20 each for $40. The Hodge so, twins. And they're both named Steve. And he's that. the third Hodge twin. He's the third. <laughs> the one without a career. Yeah. I'm the third twin. Wait a minute. Uh, he's like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, they're, um, they're actually triplets, but one of them's like a huge lefty. So they just. Yeah. Like, oh, man. He's got like a little that's hand great. that's like doesn't. He's like fully no form. career. <laughs> Says, uh, Take my other hand, child. My strong <laughs> hand. My strong hand. My other hand isn't strong. Let me mix child. up those potatoes. <laughs> hey, y'all. I found this podcast about three weeks ago, and I have been listening through old episodes since then. Been going through a rough Aww. patch recently. And this podcast Aww. has helped tremendously as a lot of our values align. Couldn't be talking about this one. Uh, and the laughs are nonstop. I've been uploading old episodes and clips, uh, my pod to YouTube called Country Hodge Podge. And you guys have inspired me to get my ass in gear and revive it. Not Bam. the yeah. same content, but the same message. Hail to you, Steve. And uh, thanks for this. Oh, yeah. Make more shit. I like it. Yeah. Keep making stuff. Make more shit. Actually, uh, I forgot to say that next Friday I'm going to be on Friday Night Steve. Uh, Friday Sorry. Night. Oh, okay. my Friday God. Night Steve. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, but that's good. We love hearing that type yeah, of stuff. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You know, there's great opportunity out there for, you know, everybody that wants to turn the camera on, let, let the world know what you think. 
Ryan made he's made a made a career of just being angry at every fucking thing. So. Don't take it too far though, guys. <laughs> If you die of Sam Oh my Manila, god, Ryan's you... gonna be drinking fucking cum pie for the next six months. <laughs> oh god. I'm just gonna drop you off at Odin, order and wrong? I'm going to another Odin, one. What's I wrong? would not order with him yeah. in the facility. Yeah, I, I'm just gonna drop <laughs> you off. What's not wrong? Yeah. Everybody get, else, not... that's the thing. Everyone else on the gets their order right. Like Jeremy's order, fucking fine. Nothing wrong with it. Well, Jay's Jeremy orders off the kids. Back to that that thing we talked about karma. Nah, nah. Dude, you're like 90s Chris Jericho. It's a whole conspiracy. Jeremy orders <laughs> off the kid <laughs> menu, so it's not hard. You know, they're not gonna fuck up Jeremy's like little, you know, fucking hot dogs and chicken nuggets order. <laughs> Gary, when you were at IHOP, you stupid, yeah, it's true. You stupid you motherfucker at IHOP. Didn't yeah. even put my order in. <laughs> like, no, no, listen, listen, listen. So I listen. He's like, listen. hey, Jeremy, I like what you do over there. Ryan, fuck you. Yeah. So <laughs> we, we sit down. We're, 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 it's the middle. Of, it's like, what, 11 or 12 at night, probably. You know, we were driving out of Dallas and then we finally got out of the bat, uh, out of the cold. And so I was like, oh, there's an IHOP. Let's stop there. That's probably the last decent place that we can probably stop at. So. Sat down. I ordered my, you know, I ordered the appetizer sampler, you know, with the O rings. Uh, I switched the O rings out for fries. He go, oh yeah, yeah, totally O rings. Got you. Ryan's like O rings. O rings. Are you Jack Ruby order? No, they're gonna be O rings <laughs> when Ryan orders ring, next, all right? Oh, this is an auto oh, zone. There you go. I thought you fucking onion rings. Is that, is that is that weird? Like O rings? That's what people call onion rings. That's what they call an Dude, asshole in prison. Like, <laughs> that's what they, yeah, what they call. I mean, what, I guess working in restaurants, like when you need like a drop a drop a you know bag of O rings. You know, whatever. Yeah. The, all, all I can think of is, is the Austin Powers film. <laughs> you get a blow anyway, an O-ring, man. Is, Drop yeah. a lot. <laughs> point is, point is, so I Here ordered that. Ryan tonight. takes time to no, order no. his. It's, it's, well, hold on. You're all not right. quite framing it right. <laughs> you sat down and you immediately said, I want the appetizer platter yes, and uh, yeah. a, a Coke or whatever. Like before yeah. we even looked at a menu because you knew what you wanted. Because like Gary said, you eat like a fucking five-year-old. Yeah. <laughs> it's the sampler. It's the most tenders. ordered thing. Which, in the menu. which is good. Which is good. But then I was like, well, I need to. I'm gonna actually see what I want. He comes back and I tell him, hey, I want this. Uh, fucking. It was like it was called like the quick egg breakfast. It was just scrambled eggs, bacon, toast, and a hash brown. That was it. Mm -hmm. And I put my order in before the people that sat down after us put their orders in. Oh, they bring out uh -oh. Jeremy's shit, and then they bring out the other people's shit. Uh -oh. so that uh -oh. moment is uh -oh. when I said, I, I look at Jeremy, I said, what the fuck is going on? And I was like, dude, I was like, dude, it's not a fucking big deal. Like, you're going to get your food. Shut the fuck up. And he's like, oh, I'm, he was mad. And, and I, mean, I, was I was speaking loud enough to make sure that the waiter fucking heard me. I was like, that's bullshit. Oh, they came God. here after us. They ordered after me. You remind me, me of my father. My Gosh. Well, you and did order something with <laughs> quick in the name. So, I mean, come on. Exactly. Yeah. And There's so an then, expectation again. because I bitched about it and he heard me, he comes to me. He's like, dude, I, I'm, I'm really sorry, man. It's totally my fault. I forgot to put your order in. Oh, my God. Why would he say that? <laughs> oh, no. He was Blame honest, it on though. the kitchen. He took responsibility. <laughs> he was a man Blame about it. Blame it on the boogie. He was a man. He was about did he offer you yeah. some free food? Right. I cannot tell a lie. I, I forgot he, to put your order in. Because typically they do. <laughs> he chopped down the cherry tree. Oh, uh, yeah. Wooden teeth and shit. And, and he did. He's like, I'll, I'll take something. He's like, I'll take your drink off the receipt or whatever. I said, just give me my fucking food, man. And so then, of course, they rush it. And I ordered extra crispy bacon. It comes Where? floppy as fuck. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, I most hate lip that. dick I bacon you've ever I seen in your it. fucking Lip dick bacon. Was there bacon. a cum in it? So, like, <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> I don't know. Not, not as long as he didn't taste it, it's fine. Not yes. person in the chat called you RK Outburst. <laughs> that That's could actually be your, a pretty good one. That could be your new channel that where you review <laughs> restaurants. But, but, channel, that, yeah. but that's what I'm saying. Like, it's not like things are fine and I freak out. No, things go wrong. Car like things Ma. go wrong. They get my order wrong. They don't get the shit I ordered time and time again. I don't know why. Karma. Karma, yeah. Karma yeah. baby. That shit ain't fucking real. Clearly <laughs> it is in your case. All right, keep going how you're going. <laughs> Disgusting. Yeah, bad, oh. bad vibes. Oh, bad vibes, bro. Comics Division's platform shoes for $50. <laughs> 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 uh, one of my favorite things about this channel is, is giving my co-host shit in account names. <laughs> I, I love it. 
uh, the last time Ryan had a spicy pepperoni, he he was at a furry convention in Italy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, ho. Uh, Profu. Oh, go on. I'm sharing my screen. Uh, This is a pretty apt one right here. Oh, yeah. I think that's great, (laughs) man. Yeah. That's brilliant. Mm -hmm. When we start slaying them tabletop, they're ordered. Mage Rod. I'm going to have to play a gnome because we should know. Oh, that is. Of course you are. Awesome. That is awesome. Gnomes have a lot of power, you know? That's yeah, that's cool. from Shannon Ward right there, Delcar's Dungeon. So, Damn, pretty awesome. That's pretty that's cool. That's fucking cool. Badass. Yeah, you can mm. actually go there and uh, you can customize figures. So he obviously customized it based off yeah. of us. That's awesome. Oh, sh- that is nice. yeah, that's great. I need to get some of those. I do. Go get some. Got right. a big stick there. You damn oh, straight. Crowfu <laughs> oh. uh, for fifty dollars. <laughs> Am I the only one who, who sees that Horizon Forbidden West suffers the same fate as Spider-Man Miles Morales? No, it's just Miles Morales. Uh, it feels like a huge DLC of the first game. Uh, that what's the H U D? The what's H U D? The HUD. The HUD. Yeah, the HUD. Uh, world map, character designs, environment, etc. Is nearly identical. Five years for seventy. For a seventy dollar DLC, is that what it feels like? That would be kind of a piss. I mean, Ryan, Ryan could probably talk about this one. I know you're big into that first game, so I, I really like the first game, and I don't know. I guess I don't know why anyone would think that the next one, mechanically or or, or gameplay style, would do something different. Um, but I, I've only played like three or four hours of it, and I would say it's not as polished as I felt like it should have been. Um, that that's my biggest thing. Ryan. It's not the fact that the gameplay is the same because what's what's that, Gary? Does it have the exaggerated swagger of a black team? Of a black team? <laughs> <laughs> no, it, it does. It does not have the exaggerated swagger. Did it give you goose? The water effects on it. I've been watching my wife play it. The water effects on it look there, pretty amazing, though. There, there's some effects. That, there's some graphic. There, there's some scenes and some graphics that look fucking amazing. But then there's also like her hair specifically. It's almost like they over animated it. It's like mm. always it's like always moving in a weird in a way that doesn't quite physics wise make sense. Yeah, she's underwater um, or something. <clears throat> it's like she's got uh, just like tentacles. <laughs> just oh, like yeah. wiggling yeah, yeah. all over oh, the like, fucking place. Like Marvel couldn't yeah. do with Medusa. <clears throat> in mm-hmm. uh, remember when remember the Inhumans TV series where the superhero no. Medusa, who's got super powered hair, shaves her head in the second episode because they couldn't afford to do the effect. <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, that was Good pretty time. funny. I think with the Miles Morales game, it's like, yeah, it's a different character, but it does play exactly the same as the Spider-Man game, which you would expect the mechanics to play the same. The problem with that uh, is that, a, is that a, was developed as DLC and then like, they turned it into a full game. Exactly. And that's why it's only like 10 to 15 hours. Whereas Forbidden West, from my understanding, is like 70 to 80 hours of gameplay, maybe more. So I, I wouldn't consider that a DLC. I think I it's consider, funny that people are calling the game off for cultural appropriation. Yeah. Yeah, but there's a bunch of fucking retards in the world, dude. I know. It's fucking funny, though. Yeah. I uh, yeah, but it, I mean, the guy, I hear thing. what the guy's saying. I, I, it, this is a game built completely from the ground up as a sequel. But I, I've been watching people play because I thought everything I've seen of it with the, the Aloy changes and, and what I'd seen on it, that's like, you know, well, this is going to be a single player. I might as well just leave it for a bit. It'll plumb it down mm-hmm. in price. And then, so I watched, I watched like Drinker play. I've watched a couple of other people uh, on Twitch play. And it's just, yeah, it just felt like exactly the same game. And so I didn't, I don't have that excitement to jump in because I kind of played 50, 60 hours of that already with the, the DLC that came with the first game. And I did enjoy it. But I kind of wanted to see something different in the game. And every, like, Aloy's just a miserable fucking cunt in this, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Everyone she talks to, she just walks up and is like, what the fuck do you want? Okay. You know, oh, Aloy, master of the west, of the east, you're coming. Oh, yeah, whatever. Just who do you want me to hit? Where do you want me to yeah, it's just, just like, what's my What's my fucking side quest? Yeah, it's just, yeah. just like pissed <laughs> off with fucking everyone. It's just like, all right, attitude, darling. It's the burden uh, yeah, of being a savior, I guess. 
I'd love to play a game that was self-aware of that, though. Like, you play as a character who's just fucking done with RPG and fantasy, and you're just like, yeah, yeah, there's a sword. I don't care. <laughs> like, okay, well, all right. be pretty funny. magical, but... <laughs> yeah, it just didn't feel as if they evolve. You know, it didn't evolve, and I was kind of like, do I want to do exactly the same for six? Like you said, sixty, seventy hours. Do I want to do that? And I'm like, yeah. Right now, I'd rather jump into an Elden Ring or something. You know, completely different. Well, to be honest, for yeah. sure. And I, I think that uh, I, I, I like the sco- the story of the first game, mm. but it's not something that's like super fucking riveting. The, the reason I really enjoyed the first game was because of the gameplay. Because of like the exploration, this world that you're getting into, and the different creatures and beasts, <clears throat> but we have seen that. I don't know what you would necessarily do with a sequel that felt like a sequel. You know, but who's it? is it? Cyrus that. is that the the bag? Cyrus is it? Who's Cyrus the bad is guy? the black yeah. guy. Yeah. So Cyrus is at the at the end of the first game, and he like betrays you, and you're like, oh fuck you, yeah. Cyrus, and he's like, ha 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 ha, I got what I fucking wanted now. Yeah. And then I was watching Drinker, and this isn't much of a spoiler because this happens like very early doors. Mm-hmm. She she climbs uh, up this tower in Meridian, gets to the top of it, activates it, and then a, a hologram of uh, Cyrus appears. Right. And then he's just like, ha ha, uh, I <clears throat> actually could do with your help if you want to pop over to the West, Aloy, and come see what I've got to tell you. And, it's, and the, here's a map. And I'm just like, yeah, it's, that's it's the way you reintroduce Cyrus in the second game. It's like, what the fuck? It's basically like I know something you don't know. <laughs> yeah, like it's I'm trying to fucking <sighs> save the world. You can't even understand, type of thing. Yeah. Why have a Cyrus? <laughs> then why Tell be him. such a why be such a bellend at the end of the first game when you know that you've got the 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 uh, the hand of Aloy to help you? Just <laughs> just turn around and then go. Well, because this is set like what seven months after the first game or something, six to twelve, something like that. Yeah, actually, it's over a year, maybe. I think it might be over a year, but yeah, it's not. It's not a long. It's not a huge period of time. It's not the distance five years between the first and the second game. Uh, and so to to sort of like if that was his attitude, you know, Aloy was helping him. He was helping her. They had this good kind of symbiotic relationship <laughs> that was going on. There was, and then it just. It seems useless that you threw it all away at the end of the first game based off what you just showed us in the second game for the first meet between them. It's just like, it just felt so contrived. I'm like, ah. Well, the real answer is probably they didn't plan for a sequel. No, that's, come on. That's I probably mean, the real answer, yeah. I don't know. Um, You guys are a big fan of TikTokers, right? You oh, regularly absolutely. celebrate and promote them. <laughs> yes. My favorite. Uh, I've just been made aware of this one. I, I give you the link there, guys. Yeah. It's um, really interesting Grab TikTok who shares her history. And Thanks, this history goes back longer than you might imagine. Oh, God. Oh. No <laughs> shit. Cringe Topia. Mm. Oh, God. Here we go. Oh, God. <laughs> no, no volume. Here on Earth. And I wanted to share with you about you, but I've lived many lives here on Earth. And I wanted to share with you oh, that I've discovered thus far. One of my earliest lives was as a man in ancient Mesopotamia. I worked Ooh. as a poet, philosopher, and I taught writing. What the hell happened? <laughs> why is it never why is it never I cleaned shit out of streets? Why is it always I was a poet? I was a I was literally a fucking whip. <laughs> when, <laughs> when, yeah. when did you turn into a mentally ill fucking white woman? When did you I turn was, into that? I was a table. Like, I, I was a salamander that got eaten after three days by a bird. Yeah. Right? I was a I was a gerbil stuck in a man's ass. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Return Return the next time you. of my life. <laughs> Lemony Wings says Johnny. <laughs> I've always been very drawn to ancient Egypt. So this life where I work as a death priestess for Nephthys made so much. She did a past life regression and saw us as sisters in a Native American tribe, which oh, makes sense because Jesus. one of my spirit guides is Native American. I was a lady of the house in the Victorian era. I was also definitely a witch because I saw myself. This is an only child. This is an only child. <laughs> I was also a child during the world war too, but I didn't live past the age of six. <laughs> well, there you go. They had the right idea. The background are basically the players in World War Two, and of oh. course, I have to include my life as a fairy. Though uh. this one is technically have. What? 
<laughs> yeah, it cuts off there. We don't we get do to know more what? about fairy life. I want to hear about all right the now? other fairy yeah. lives. Yeah. Yes. Well, it, I did see that it's technically not in this dimension, so she's not sure if it counts mm. as a life. Oh, that's, yeah, that's fair. We don't usually include the non earthly dimension mm. ones. Imagine Parents, parent your children. Yourself. Parent your fucking children, for Christ's sake. Otherwise, the I, grunts be I really kind of like therapy early, please. Thank I really like Brendan Fraser's The Mummy, so I think it makes a lot of sense that I'm a pharaoh in my past life. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know? Just like the, as you I was just video scared. telling people what to do in these situations, your kid comes up to you and is like, oh, I, I was an ancient pharaoh. You go, no. <laughs> yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. go to your room. Didn't she no. say she was sisters with her mom, too? I would ask. Yeah. Her. <laughs> I, I mean, how does her mom feel about in a past she, life? She, she said her, her dad was. Her, yeah. Her dad was her husband. In a bad, past <laughs> life, we both fucked dad. <laughs> no. she, she, she also it's, not, it's, it's that stepmother porn again, isn't it? It's not the yeah. it's not the news that her mother probably thought of at the time. She's like, oh, we used to be sit. Wait a minute. What? Wait Wait a minute. Minute. Wait a minute. Where's dad fit in here? Yeah, but it would only exactly. be it would only be uncomfortable if the dad was that dad in the past life, though. Right. Yes. So yeah. I mean. Yeah. Right. What are the right. chances of that? Oh, the chance imagine of that, just... dating that, and then you you see that on TikTok. What's her uh, pussy uh, like? I guess. I mean, that's... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what pussy from what life? <laughs> yeah, Ryan's like, Which one are you one gonna get? Thing. Yeah. Yeah. You fucked a fairy. Imagine what happens when she sees my YouTube channel. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Totally in the past life, in, in the 50s, all they did was cook and get fucked. She's like, Ryan, you're a Nazi in your current life. Not even uh, <laughs> Well, yeah, but your parents were the players in World War II. That's what you said, right? <laughs> we have, the argument, so. we have so much to relate. Wait, <laughs> Stalin and Hitler had a kid? Maybe. Oh, yeah, Maybe. definitely. And she was a fairy. She was a yeah, fairy. Called her. <laughs> she is a fairy in the current. There's a different dimension. She's different dimension. I don't think that counts as present. Come on. Yeah. You know, Are you denying her reality? Are you denying am, her? Uh, no, I've just, we've talked yes. about different dimensions. She's a lot. denying her reality, yeah. dude. Uh, yeah. This is Earth Prime. Who here mm -hmm. has seen? <laughs> who here has seen the King's Man? I still have him. Have I'm gonna get on that. Yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Is that made for British people? Uh oh. That's why I liked it. <laughs> Don't look at me. I'm Good. New Zealander. <laughs> we, we allow Americans to watch our stuff. <laughs> hey, it's about. Well, no, I don't want to spoil anything just in case anybody well, doesn't know history. But America <laughs> had to come in the First World War to tip the balances, tip the scales, and it's kind of about that. So, kind of, in a weird way. It's interesting that that came out right now. Very, uh, yeah, it is. Mm, yeah. Very uh, it's, like I can uh, recommend it. Isn't it ironic? It's <clears> one throat> of the few throat> things throat> I, I can. Always comes down to Alanis Morissette. It does. Ironic. Even though she was wrong about But none of it was shit. ironic. None of it was ironic. <laughs> That's ironic. <laughs> is that in itself <laughs> ironic? I don't know. Uh, okay. That's the true irony. Hmm. Horror <laughs> Armorada. For fifty dollars, he said it the right way. I did. Good job. I've been thinking about it for the last five minutes. Uh, while you guys that's were like talking Ryan about some going video to game. a restaurant being nice and getting his food right. Nobody wants to see that shit. Oh. Nobody wants to see that. I was working on my pronunciation while you guys were talking about fucking video games because I wasn't listening. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> hell all when it comes it's okay you can talk as long as you want it gives me a little break uh hell all when it comes to uh uniting mm -hmm. no fellowship does it better even my mother 60 enjoys watching in oh hi mom uh in hi, mom. more serious I'm sorry, news mom. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry i'm sorry yeah uh a member needs help if you can look up at not as real 78 and see if you can help uh, in this crazy world, I'm glad for the fellowship. Is that on Twitter? I'm going to assume it's on Twitter. I'll take a look. Uh, but yes, of course, we'll take a look. It's a damn good uh, fellowship. You know, if uh, you ever need somebody to just talk to, there's a there's somebody in the chat who will probably more yep. than happy to do it. Pretty cool See fucking you people. Chat. You in the chat. Mm -hmm. uh, systems curmudgeon. For $50. I can relate to being a curmudgeon. 50% uh, of the people in Florida are from other states because Florida is the U.S. penal colony for bad drivers. 
Is that mm. true, Floridians? Well, there is a lot of old people. That basically, yeah. the same thing. Yeah. So. Everywhere has bad drivers. <laughs> yeah. Trust me, I drive yeah. enough to know. Everywhere Isn't has bad Tampa drivers. Like the uh, retirement capital of America. Jeremy, if oh, everywhere you go yes. has bad drivers, I'm starting to think there's a uh, common one there. I'm every- definitely not a bad driver. I'm, <laughs> I'm a fucking phenomenal driver. Um, I'm very, very... Uh, I was okay. talking to Ryan about that. I pay attention to every fucking detail. Uh, Ryan, you can confirm this. You've seen, I, I, I look in my mirror. I pay every fucking car that is in my vicinity. I know exactly where they're at. I'm a bat out of hell the way I drive. The busier it gets, the faster I drive. I'm I'm, I'm crazy on the road, but in a good way. But yeah, uh, Jeremy's uh, a, Jeremy's a good aggressive driver. So yeah, but a like I, I but, but aggressive driver. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Odin, you know, you, you were sitting there praying for your fucking life because I was looking for hookers, but I was still focused <laughs> on the traffic as well. Okay. Um, I'm thinking back but, to the live street. I'm one eye on the, the hooker. One eye on the While road. driving with people freaking out over the, you almost get into a wreck. Mm. D- defensive uh, drivers are fucking pussies like if you're a you defensive know, driver it just means you're going to react to everything instead of anticipate yep. like a man i'm an offensive <laughs> driver i think that's the way but, to go but yeah but, but uh, i just everywhere you go people's like oh people from here can't drive and i'm just here to tell you people nobody can fucking drive usually because these people again i, I think people should Ooh, get tickets for driving people. in the left lane i do like, if you are in the left lane and you're oh, not yeah. passing, you need to have a fucking ticket or have your Amen. goddamn license taken away. It is ab- it is Preach. absolutely <laughs> insane. <laughs> I'm talking about American rules. So uh, <laughs> I don't know what you do over there. You <laughs> uh, yeah, the, the left lane stuff, there's nothing that pisses me off more than that. It really isn't. It drives me crazy. Oh, that drives me so. crazy, too. Uh, X-ray girl is asking if there's a lot of Asians in Florida. Uh they're not, so a ton, racist. Not, not a ton, but they're all bad drivers. So. She's so racist. She <laughs> really is. Wow. Prius drivers are the worst, right? I mean, they're worse than Asian yes. drivers. Yes. No. <laughs> you see a Prius and you're like, watch out, they're going to wreck into me. Or just be it, fucking slow. That's all they are is <laughs> slow. Yeah, um, that, or that, be douchebags. I do have I, to show this. Yeah, I, I, I do not like I do not like when people slow me down on the road. It pisses me the fuck off. What? what? Yeah, that's the that's the infection of California. No offense. That's Gary. not true. <laughs> I'm taking it. This I'm looks like, taking it all. Here we go. This is fake news. Oh my God. This is this is California Exodus visualized by state. Whoa. Not as many in Florida. Where are they going? Florida. Where are they all going? Run, bitch, run! They're probably Look at all going the, to uh, New York. You see Look, all the ones all- jumping into the sea. <laughs> what? <laughs> they're all going to Tennessee, Seattle, man. Uh oh, where are they going? Austin, Canada. Going to Austin. Uh, if the, yeah, they're going to Austin. Is they fucking they're all coming to Texas? Not as many coming to Florida. Just, I'm okay with that. I think it's just, Texas is going to be blue. That's more in Nashville than I thought. No, uh, I think. I think a lot. I don't think it's going to be blue. A lot of the Californians are are like me. Yeah. They're just like fed up with this shit. Um, yeah, I have a theory. It's it's it, it used to be that it used to be a lot of blue Cali's coming over here and fucking our shit up. Yeah. But now I think it's people that know how bad California are and uh, it is, and they're California they're are. Yeah. Look how many? California are. Hey Garrett, your quarter is showing. That's right, son. Young poor black son. Sorry, Arizona. You will watch out and say my. Yeah. yeah, I'm surprised as many have gone to Washington and Oregon. To be honest, which is well, the sorry, I'm not, I, I'm not, I'm not really I'm well not versed on my American states. Texas, which is, is the, the uh, which is the state that's directly to the right of California? Nevada, uh, Nevada. Is the one that's Nevada. Right. Okay, and yeah. then Arizona's that's the one. Arizona Arizona the, though I yeah. I find it hard to believe they're all going to northern Nevada. There's absolutely the whole, well, entire state, state population it's is around Vegas. State. Yeah, so. it's just the state yeah. that that the dot is going to. So I'm I don't know if it's counting like the last twenty years when a lot of people did go to Washington and Oregon. Mm-hmm. That was happening in the nineties. And completely <laughs> fucked up those those two cities. Uh, Where's the exodus out of Portland? I mean, who's moving to Portland? Fuck, yeah. I don't think anybody is anymore. I think anybody that lives in Portland is 
an, is crazy enough to continue living in San Portland. Francisco. Yeah. San Francisco. Everyone that lives in Portland isn't. They don't have enough money to move. Oh, I'm so. sure there's some <laughs> yeah, fucking yeah, socialist too. San Franciscans moving up to Portland. Going San Francisco's oh, no, just there, gotten too there conservative. Is. My brother knows all about it. San Francisco's just gotten too conservative for me. I'm out of here. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. The reason why they're leaving is because of how expensive California is. And it's a lot cheaper in Portland. At least it used to be. It's it's expensive there now. I mean, not not San Francisco. Yo, it, it is now, yeah. Uh, yeah, we're we're kind of fucking up Texas too. Let's be real. Sorry. Yeah, come on. Hmm. Yeah. Sorry. Well, I mean, te- um, look. A lot of people seem like a lot of people think like Texas and Florida because of how great it is to live there right now. Like it's not. They're not. It's not a sold. It's not a done deal that they're red. I keep reminding yeah. people, Florida. We we were if Trump didn't endorse DeSantis. We would have had Gillum. That's how close it was, and, yeah, and we Texas all know what happened with Gillum. In the 90s too. And, and, so. and Texas has had, uh, especially with all the the big old Gillum I mean, fuck children or something. <laughs> <laughs> what? what? No, no, I, I I'm sorry. It, well, no, he was found like with drugs, found- like crack or meth in a crack. hotel with a gay prostitute. Crack. Oh, that's yeah, he's yeah, the yeah, gay yeah, prostitute. Yeah, he was naked. Guy. Yeah, they, right, found, they found him naked so in a hotel. He's a politician is what think, you're saying. Yeah. I think it was actually okay, meth because I was surprised at the drug. It was if meth. Andrew Gillum was found the crack, I wouldn't be surprised. No, no, meth, meth, meth is, uh, is, is is the gay boys like meth. Yeah. They do. So, uh, But that's the guy. That guy That guy was literally like it was close. Florida's governor election was close. And that's it how won't be next time, though. With that, guys. And it's all about performing. Um, it, 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 it it probably won't, um, yeah. but it's it's still too close to for comfort. I mean, even if it's yeah. you know, even if but isn't, wins. I was going to say, isn't DeSantis going to run for presidency? Uh, I I hope not. That's I hope rumor. he stays in Florida because uh, we need him in Florida right now. So um, I I mean, I don't want to go too far down the political rabbit hole, but you know, I'm pretty sure Trump runs in 2024. I'm pretty sure. I like to hear that. Yeah, I got a bet on Trump running in 2024. $500 bet with PSA Sitch. Wow. So Trump has to run. What are the odds? Because I want my money. (laughs) Well, I, 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 I I think it's like take, take if whether however you feel about Trump. Oh. We all agree the man has probably the biggest ego on the planet. Do you think oh, he's yes, not going to totally. run? Of course he's going to run. It's Donald Trump. Of course he's going to run. What happens if the so, polls look bad for him? He's I mean, gonna, uh, that's like he, the they've always looked bad for him. All yeah, they, they've all, yeah, they've always looked bad for him. So, hmm. so he's going to say fuck that and do it anyway. Yeah. To go from president of the United States to losing the primary? Oh. Nah, he he won't lose the primary. No. Uh, the I devastation. Can't. Mitt, Mitt Romney. Uh, Trump, Trump, it's either it's for the Republicans. Oh. If, yeah, the who Republicans, else are they going to run? Romney? Is that yeah, real? For, for the Republicans, it's either Trump or, or they're not going to have a nominee. Cause yeah, who else are they going to run? They're not setting anybody else up right now. Everyone likes yeah. DeSantis, I think. But I mean, oh, that's DeSantis is amazing. DeSantis, DeSantis is no, the future. DeSantis. Too soon. DeSantis, but DeSantis, DeSantis might be the only one that could him, have but. him, uh, you know, have him go up against, uh, I don't know, Michelle. Oprah. Or, <laughs> or Michelle Oprah. Obama. It's gonna be, yeah. It'll be Trump Hillary. versus Hillary. It'll be Trump versus Hillary again. Uh, what? Oh, no one. No. Yeah. I think it's going to happen. It's going to happen. Rematch. Will happen. I'm going full yeah. Ryan in the drive thru if that happens. <laughs> it's the rematch of the century. Let's go. I'm not. I'm not I'm not it's, playing. It's Trump. It's Trump versus. Well, first of all, uh, uh, Biden can't. Hillary I'm not Trump, sure Biden fucked up my order. No, I'm not sure Biden makes it. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure Biden can make another four weeks, much less president. four years. No. So, and do you think Kamala Harris? Is, no. Fuck no. <laughs> so I thought, I thought the Hillary. election was now fortified. At least so, Kamala would be well, funny. I mean, laughably funny. Yeah. Oh, God. We Kam- would, uh, Kamala. I want to suck Putin, and he's not going to invade any country. Could you please anymore. stop talking? Okay. Thank <laughs> you. Uh-huh. I Do not said. come, I said to Putin. Uh-huh. Do not come. Do not come. He, he came. <laughs> just, just Kamala, Kamala sounds come. exactly like stoned girl at a party. Yeah. I can't yeah. unhear it. Yeah. She yeah. Everything she hands, says. Like... Stone Cali girl at a party. Mm-hmm. Wow. I know. Yeah. Oh, my God. I'm, like, totally fucking <laughs> Uh, that's it. Yeah. That's a perfect I, Kamala Harris I love impression Tupac I've ever heard. Snoop I love that and, song, even though she, 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 she laughs really time. randomly when she shouldn't be. Yep. <laughs> 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 
So wait, you guys think that Hillary's gonna run? Is there enough children's Fuck, blood in the world so. to power her? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't think they've been is. building up their stocks. You know, yeah, been how she's been starting the she's early it's like, um, of the campaign. So. It's like Vader in the back to tank, which is like yeah. children's blood vat. But oh, like, yeah, <laughs> look, look what's trending. No, for Mikey <laughs> Gussler. For Mikey Gussler, look at that. Zack Snyder's Justice League is trending. Ooh, All I see damn. is the California exit is visualized by state. <laughs> oh, wow. It's right here on the yeah. right. Look at that. It's in the bottom, oh, in the bottom okay. right there. No number, but who cares? It says in flash speed it, force, and everybody's just going, Snyder the, the cut! Only, the only reason I'm excited about that is for Marler's next Unbridled Rage video. That's the only reason <laughs> hey, I'm excited. one and done set, so. for good old Snyde, okay? Smooth. <laughs> uh, <laughs> The DJ on the Streamlab side, avoiding Mama Susan, which we always appreciate, for forty dollars and twenty-three cents. I don't see the wrong button. Gonna hit it this time. Can't find it. There it is. There it is. Uh, there. Hail Gary! It's Friday at last. Another week comes to an end. Uh, the Lord of the Rings is still getting canned by actual fans, and their agenda is falling, failing super hard. Shout out to the panel and have a great time. Honk honk. Wait. <laughs> yeah, it's so loud. Take, Hail to the fellowship. So I know. It takes so long. <laughs> it's supposed to be loud, Odin. It's supposed to be loud. I, I, need, I, a need, a board. Board. I need a bigger board. I need a bigger board. You need to put that thing closer to you. <laughs> I need to have a desk. I said that to a girl once and <laughs> she just hit me. <laughs> 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 hey, dude, I'm on a, like a little you, dinner girl. table right now. That's like, that's my desk. <laughs> you should have it like right in front of you, like almost like a keyboard. Man. <laughs> that's dude, I need exactly the keyboard. What I said to her as well. Here, should, should I take a picture of this shit and show you? Like, I can't. Because uh, then it can just be like, uh -huh. there's no space. There's no space. See? Trust me. Now, this shocks me. I'm shocked. <laughs> shocked. We, we were, see, we were talking about why people don't watch Hassan or whatever. Well, like DSP, I think I got Jeremy hooked on DSP videos. Oh my God. In our travels. <laughs> like, he just kept playing DSP shit, and I'm like, this guy can't be for real. He goes, no, he's for real. And I'm like, what yeah. the fuck? But I, I, got, I, got, I got it. I got, Hillary actually just released a... Uh, a uh, promo for 2024 as we were talking so i'm sharing my screen right now uh, i don't have i don't know here we go I, oh no I go. Oh, I go. Go. created pokemon go oh no no not this one please no but i'm trying to figure out how we get them to have pokemon go to the polls no <laughs> please clap that, that look. Go to the oh, book. Get it. No. See what I did. Oh, even that. No. They still no. weren't able to figure Hello, it out. Hello, kids. That face. Oh, so I hear a lot about though. the Elden Ring. I hope they Elden Ring around to the pole. Where's your trailer? 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 Where's <laughs> oh no! Oh, oh, no. Uh, they couldn't uh, figure out how to uh, do Pokemon Go to the poll, so he just came with a DLC. Pokemon <laughs> send five ballots to every house. Uh, <laughs> Pokemon let immigrants vote without being citizens of the country. <laughs> Pokemon, it doesn't matter that they're dead. <laughs> That's a really weird name for a Pokemon game, but it hey. is. I it was strange. Uh, well, you know, it, go, it goes back to Lavender Town from the original game. You know, this whole thing with Cubone and everything. Yeah, that's great. Dude, that, yeah. that really does sound like commentary on the way that they make them fight to the death in that game. It doesn't matter. Don't it doesn't worry matter about it. I know. Like that fucking. I, I, I'm I was like, it for it. I was playing that. Like that was. The, I was reading the shit out for the chat. And the guy's like, in order for us to better understand Pokemon and develop our relationship between humans and Pokemon, we need you to do this Pokedex. And in the Pokedex for the new game, it's like, catch 30 Pokemon, defeat 25 of like each species. So you want me to enslave 30 Pokemon <laughs> to fill out your little fucking paper and kill 25 of them. Right, it's God. weird. They, they call like, them yes. the computer. <laughs> most, most of them just sit on a storage file of the computer for the rest of their lives. This like, is great. Terrible. It's Pokemon Candyland, for fuck's sake. Jesus. <laughs> I, I see a few people in the chat did catch. I almost did say Killary when I said Hillary. I, I did thought you did say it. Yeah, oh, I, did. <laughs> I'm, I, I misspoke as well. I meant to say Michael. <laughs> mm. Yeah. 
Big Mike. Big Mike. Big Mike. I, I misspoke as Mike. well. I meant to say cunt. <laughs> I, was, I, was hey, I got an email. Think... I got an email saying that twice in big capital letters. <laughs> oh yeah. Well, I got an email, an abusive email today, so I'm going to guess that we're probably from the same person. Doctor 14 Blu-ray probably. reviews. Oh no no he, oh, no, yeah. I tell you, he, no I blocked oh, him ages yeah. ago he can fuck off. <laughs> Doctor 14 Blu- Blu-ray reviews has been like trolling my channel for years. It's it's a beautiful tradition. I'm surprised. I, I think I've got, I've got him filtered to auto delete if he sends me. He's been a member of my channel for like fucking two years. He hates my guts. I, I he always tells I me. Always super chat. He used to always send me super chat yeah. money all the time. <laughs> oh yeah, and I, I, and I. I I wish you would continue to send me super chats telling me how much you hate me. No, it's no how much his it. dad hates you. <laughs> okay, yeah. I, I couldn't keep up. It was like, my God. There was always these. At first, I was like, oh, thanks, $10. And then you start reading. You're like, this is you're like, okay. Wait, wait, yeah, you don't like me. <laughs> yeah. He, I just remember because of doing real BBC with you, he started coming to come into my stream and just like abusing. And I just went, dude. Fuck it, that's your thing with neurotic. Fuck off. It's <laughs> <laughs> your we weird can, we can come to my channel. Go back to your fucking boyfriend and do it with him more. <laughs> um I speaking of people calling you a cunt, Gary, I'm sharing my screen, Garrett. Oh gosh. Oh, so this is Vera Dark. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is so Dark Titan Enterprise, but this is Vera Dark. This is her other account. Hey everyone, it's Vera. Yesterday, in response to a neurotic tweet where someone randomly sent him an email calling him a quote the C word. And I responded in a joking, friendly manner. Twitter suspended my account. No! <laughs> no, no. What? Oh, my you God. You might be a oh. cunt, but you're our cunt. Oh, oh thanks. God. Uh, I appreciate that. I'm sorry you got suspended in my defense, too. Damn you, yeah. Twitter. Oh. well. So this is after that Dragon true. Ball voice actor called her a cunt. Like, the other day on Twitter and nothing happened. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Oh. That's just how it works. It's is almost... that the same one that wanted? Never mind. You know, actually, what's a, like a, um, well, a good you. workaround, like a like a hot tip, if you want to write cunt, um, use the U with the umlaut so it doesn't, like, register the cunt. same. I'm going to be calling everybody a cunt now. Yeah, <laughs> or you use, like, the N, like, if you hold on, like, if you're texting it, you hold on to the N, and then it... The it little, do an N little with, like, the Spanish an, thing. An accent mark. Anytime you can make any of your letters have accent marks. Um, just say, see you yeah. next Tuesday. It, it means the same thing. Yeah, pretty much. Is it a bot, or is it, did someone report it? Because I feel like if they reported it, it wouldn't matter if you use the fake thing. That's probably a bot. It's probably Well, there, there was yeah, a, a there's this, this, this psycho YouTuber, <laughs> and um, I, I said cunt in a tweet and they were going absolutely mental that i wasn't banned because i said cunt in the tweet and they were clearly reporting me for saying cunt yeah because they admitted yeah. it yeah they like to do with that it gives them something to do yeah yeah I, i've gotten to the I point think it's a good use of time yeah it's a terrible use of time <laughs> you can't say re, you can't say retard like retard it's a huge no-no and you can't yeah. say cunt i so. use it all the time but you can I, say I it know, on youtube but, which is weird like you, you yeah, can say yeah. retard here but you can on twitter oh, i use right. it on twitter all the time I don't care. Oh, really? I just what don't give a fuck. No. I Eventually, you, this Twitter account will be gone too. Yep. Uh, oh yeah. 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 So I, I just okay. I just call everyone it's bitch Twitter. and toxic. Poison, I just say so. tarded. Like just start with a yeah. T. Yeah. Tarded. It's I say re re. Tarded. Re re. Re re. Re tarded. You're a dumbass. You can bitch. use the musical yeah. expression retardando. Oh. Hey. Retardo. Yeah, you're, you're retarded. Retarded. It's uh, retard. Chris Foster, okay. who's not Ricardo for fifty dollars. <laughs> <laughs> um, Kylo's helmet is so oversized; he looks like Dark Helmet from Spaceballs. <laughs> <laughs> All rise for Dark Helmet. <laughs> Can't breathe in this thing. <laughs> That's right. Uh, that is true. When will then be now? <laughs> Holy <laughs> mackerel. Uh, Bradley Burnett uh, on the Streamlab side has yeah. given us four Streamlab donations circumventing Mama Ooh. Susan, which we appreciate, for $50 each. That's $200. Wow, 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 wow. wow, wow. I did my math. It's out X-ray girl. X-ray girl. X-ray girl. X-ray girl. X-ray girl. X-ray girl. That's um, I'm, I'm trying to do Anthony Cumia's uh, impression. It's like hard. I'm trying to do a double impression there, and I'm not doing a very good job of it. By the way, we love Anthony Cumia. We got to have him back. He loves you guys. He can't uh, wait to come back. Ah, that's awesome. That's awesome. Nice. Yeah, nice. 
Uh, the, I, I, I said a joke before we started that even made Anthony Kumi go. <laughs> <laughs> yes. yeah, that was great. Yeah, uh-huh. you should have said that on the stream. That was a beautiful moment. That was great. It's like yeah. you're, you're amongst friends. Mission accomplished. Yeah, yeah. and he's like, I got reservations. I got to go. I've yeah. never seen a man relax so much in so little time. Right. <laughs> he was like, oh, I'm among friends. Yeah. Right. Cas- casual N words will do that. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the Rings super fan video. It was video. just a hard arm. Oh, that was yeah. Easy. The well, that was X-ray girl. Ryan at least had the A on his. <laughs> yeah, you know. <laughs> Asians are all, the real racist. Hey, X today. <laughs> Uh, I feel like she was I'm just around. pissed of all the black people beating up the Asians and stuff. Oh. Yeah, still mad about 2020. <laughs> when she say in the private chat, she says, "I feel like I'm around uh, my people." When you say my name like that, she changed her name to that in the background. That's why she called her that. Ex-ur-e-gul. No, Girl. Uh, Bradley Burnett. Uh, the Rings super fans video made me realize how important it is to be able to. See yourself in TV shows, movies, and books. I know <laughs> now that I can no longer enjoy any content where I'm not properly represented. That includes Friday Night Tights. I'm not represented. <laughs> oh, no. Uh-oh. Uh, he says, I don't sure. know what you can be if you're not represented. If sure, there are a I couple mean, of uh, middle-aged sure. white guys here, but I don't see the, I don't see any lawyers. Uh, no one with my name. No one lives where I live. Do better, FNT. Until then, so long, FNT. I'm off to search the internet for content Wait, where I'm properly represented. Uh, is it for real? No. No, uh, no, no. We gotta, we gotta do better. <laughs> or maybe. Chrissy, as a comedian, I thought you'd understand what a joke is. Oh, I, <laughs> I don't know. We're just talking about super chats of, you know, Slash people, hate people that hate us. Yeah. This is a yeah. uh, sarcasm. Uh, oh, yeah. oh, yeah. Chrissy's too busy Sucka looking up right next to Ritter. Fucking what? Ritter. What? Ritter. what did you say? Uh, so yeah. Yeah. you looking up who Channing Tatum's fucking. You want your twelve breadsticks? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Is, is, I'll give them to you. Is, is that a fucking much your like, ass? Serious I shove question? those breadsticks <laughs> right up your ass. Is Tatum Channing? Uh, Channing Tatum? Tatum Channing? Whatever his fucking name is. Is he still <laughs> upset Tatum that he's Channing? not playing Rogue? Not, I hope I he mean, cries uh, every oh, no, that's, night. Oh, no, that's Fuck out. Him. That's done. That's out. Uh, Rogue Gambit? He's done. Not Rogue. Gambit? Gambit? Yeah, Gambit. Gambit. Not Gambit. happening. Yeah, him playing Rogue would have been something. <laughs> that would have been inside of Rogue. <laughs> 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 I'd, I'd, I'd actually, be, I'd actually <laughs> be all for that. That'd be yeah. good. That's what I want to see from Hollywood. Let's I, fucking my name do it. I have not had a single thing my to eat today. Uh, I'm, I'm watching all you motherfuckers Rogue. order lunch and shit on the show, and I'm like dying right now. It, so he would have done a better job as Rogue than he did as Duke in the G.I. Joe movie. Damn straight. Oh, God, Ooh, tell me about it. Best performance ever. Fuck you, Did you Rogue. not other see than, his performance other, you know in what? Uh, oh, Go ahead. His performance in This Is The End was the best when he was getting dumped by Danny McBride. Yeah. Yep. Uh, so the great internet search... Though. Did not go well. I didn't find anything <laughs> in the movies or shows that had me in it. Guess I'm going to have Aww. to go back to what I did for decades. Enjoy content for its unique characters and stories, regardless of identity politics. What? <laughs> yeah. Seriously, though. It's yeah. new concept. Uh, what a great idea. These identitarians are so myopic. Ooh, I love that word, myopic. Raider fans Ooh. are myopic. And narcissists that they will just continue to make hollow, joyless crap for their message, but on the positive side, they make so much content for you to roast. Hail Friday Night Tights. Hail chat. Hail the fellowship. Hail Bradley Burnett. This is true. Uh, we win either way with Lord of the Rings, big time. And yep. I, I am guessing, I know there was a script going around. I, You know what? I'm not going to say. I, I just can't say. I don't know if it's real or not. I just don't know if it's real. We could say it sounded terrible enough to be fake, <laughs> uh-huh. but it might not be because there's a Star Trek Discovery writer on staff. Uh-huh. And if anybody's watched, I know like maybe two of you out there have seen Star Trek Discovery. It's the worst written show, period, on television. Like as far as dialogue is concerned, it's got a box. Hey, never, never Gary, forget what? me and Muller. Me and Muller <laughs> did not believe the Game of Thrones leaks. And they uh, should have, but there we are. If I just link this, this is this is this is my latest delve with star trek discovery I, I tweeted this out yesterday peacemaker hot toy 
your manager going live to pre-order. Out. Sorry, my manager, of course. Yes, yeah, yes, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, tweeted this out earlier today, actually. Uh, Peacemaker Hot Toy going live to pre-order today. And then uh, this person here says, uh, I'm just wondering why we aren't getting any Star Trek Discovery reviews, bro. I'm a legit fan. Prayer hands. Vulcan salute. Okay, uh, that's 12 minutes. Okay. 12 minutes later. Feeling ignored on purpose and getting absolutely I'm a fucking prick vibes from you. So oh, never mind. Shit. Oh, shit. What the fuck? Yeah. Oh, my God. Wow. wow. That is so I just pretty put, pretty now, print, bro. Well, this escalated quickly. It certainly <laughs> yes. is. I'll be real. I'm on this guy's side. Why don't you fucking <laughs> fuck respond to me? It was How Ryan dare you put your phone down. Notice me, senpai. It was Ryan. It was Ryan all along. You didn't get me my breadsticks either. Uh, if only I was glued was to Twitter twenty four seven to answer every comment that came through. We talking about this discovery? This yeah, we're talking about the the discovery. <laughs> yes. The disco- uh, Jack Beer has just tweeted it. Now I haven't seen the episode yet, but apparently they said they're going outside the galaxy, and they said they've never done that before. The never Federation. been. Yeah, I've the seen the main joke, which is off. fucking good. Yeah. yeah, Major Grin did a great video about it. <laughs> another great video about it. And Major Grin's the shit. We've never been outside of the galaxy before. Except well, for the- apart from all the times that you were. have been <laughs> yeah. outside of the galaxy. Yeah. But I mean, but series. we haven't mm-hmm. gone outside. The galaxy. Mm. Uh, and and oh, uh, there's hmm. also the um, the fact that when they had the cloaking shields put onto the Discovery, they said we cannot jump while cloaked. And then they just cloaked and then jumped this week. <laughs> and they did? Well, is that with their detachable nacelles? With their detachable nacelles? Because why not have detachable fucking engines on your car? That's yeah. totally necessary in space. <laughs> yeah, makes a lot of sense. Particularly, Gary, for a ship which just jumps from point to point. point th- yeah, exactly. Doesn't really need them other than impulse. Other than impulse power. <laughs> yeah. <sorry. laughs> so you just use your impulse engines. Why would you have fucking warp nacelles? Oh, I have a fuck it. Stupid show. Stupid show. Stupid, stupid fucking ship. Stupid people. Stupid fucking writers. Yep. And one of them's gonna be writing Lord of the. <laughs> The writers that, that that did sonar in space. Sonar in space. Twice. Twice. <sighs> what? Yes. Yes. Yeah. They, they, yeah. they yes. did sonar in space. That's twice. ridiculous. And that's not even the dumbest thing they've done. I'm yes. <laughs> the dumbest thing they did was have a retarded fucking alien <laughs> scream and blow up every yes. ship in the fucking galaxy. <laughs> God, I what? So fucking up. Yeah, that's that's a thing. So Every ship that had a, a big mystery called the, engine. The, yeah, there was blew a big, up when there, a retarded fucking alien screamed. It, no, well, it was called the burn, and it was a big mystery for the season. Like what? <laughs> oh, made, it was oh, a burn, all right. The dilithium is what makes the Star Trek ships go in the most basic sense, uh-huh. and it all it's went up at once. Fuel, and it yeah. was based on a uh, a retarded Kelpian who missed his mom screamed. And it destroyed the Federation. That's exactly what happened. And because I he was he was on a planet that had dilithium on it, and him being born near the dilithium. on the planet bonded him on a DNA level to dilithium because that's how dilithium works. So if I lived, if I grew up next to San Onofre nuclear power plant, yes. and I, it would be like if I missed my mom. And I got upset. It would blow well, up every no, nuclear hold on. sub. You're jumping, a, you're jumping a step, Gary. When you were born, you would have bonded with nuclear fission on yes. the on the and DNA then when level, I level. My mama, level. I blew up every that nuclear seem possible though submarine. It's kind of ridiculous. Mm, that, yeah, it kind yeah, of sounds kind of fucking retarded. It is. Yes, but that's it's when because it is. It is. That's when CW writers write science yeah. fiction. So. Star Trek this used is, to have like is, tech people that would overlook the scripts and stuff. I guess they fired oh, all. Of they, those did. they did. No, they did. Now it's about feelings. Now it's not about sci-fi anymore. It's about feelings. Star Trek used to inspire people to to go into NASA and work in fucking jets that go into the space. I don't think anybody's being inspired by this. Nobody. Yeah. Um. Nope. Oh, Chris, I'm just happy he, everyone finally feels represented. Nice. Uh, the um. I think it's, I don't even think it's Major Grin. 
uh, apparently, uh, what's her name? Michael, Mikey Burnham, Space Jesus. Yeah, Space Jesus. Space Jesus, Mikey Burnham has cried in six of the last 11 episodes. Oh, God, they they went down a little bit. Captain Burnham, <laughs> that's, a, that's a black guy? <laughs> It's a girl. Yeah, no, it's a, it's a black woman. woman. It's a girl. Oh, okay. Name oh, Michael. Michael. <laughs> because it's a black woman called Michael. Matter. Oh, okay. I, Except on yeah. TikTok. Um, you need to check your privilege. It's very, <laughs> <know>. it's very <laughs> rare. Why would you assume? Okay. I don't like that you would assume. Why would they even do that? Why would you see what, what 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 somebody called Michael as a man? I don't know. Why dude. would you do that? I don't yeah. know. That's your privilege speaking. I do know. That is. I'm so glad that I never got super into Star Trek or else I'd fucking hate it so much <laughs> right now. Right, this is why I can't, I can't review it anymore. This is why I can't review yeah. it. I would do a Gary with my monitors every week. With <laughs> I have watched one and a half seasons of Discovery. I watched the first half of season one and then watched all of season three for my fucking viewers' uh, fucking shits and laughs. I can't do... I couldn't do season four. I would fucking rip shit up. I would throw things. The show is so fucking dog shit. And there's another season coming. And there's fucking strange new cunts coming. And there's this fucking <laughs> section 30 twat coming. And it's all fucking shit. And it's all bollocks. And it's all fucking fifis. And none of it's got shit all to do with Star Trek. And it's all about the message. <laughs> Fuckity by fuck right off. Did you see that clip? I sent you. Uh, yeah, I do. I just PJ from I think I just put Yeah, Jesus I watched it. That yeah. was dumb. Uh, so like they're still using the Jar Jar Abrams aesthetic. Like they're they're panning through a hallway. Oh and my the god! Just, the fucking the camera's yeah. spinning. The like, what the fuck? Yeah. Stop. And, and you know where that comes from? I I hope I can find the interview. I watched the interview years ago, but JJ said that Star Trek was too static. So that's why he does. Right. He wants to put everything in motion, but basically saying the shit he's taking on was boring as fuck. Uh, but that's the guy taking it on. Go fuck yourself. Oh, uh, thank goodness he fixed it, eh? Yeah, yeah just like Amazon's yeah, not fix Star of the anymore. Rings. Just like Disney fixed Star Wars. Yeah. And Marvel Comics. Yeah. Just like they fixed Bond. Yeah. yeah. Oh. They, they did. keep fixing they, stuff. They, they you know? like blowing him up. They fixed yeah, them because all it right. was never about these big set piece action sequences. That's not what it was. No. Yeah. It, not the story. So, exactly. And that's, yeah. that's something that made it so interesting for people for so many decades. And <sighs> so the, the fact that you would approach it in that way is is so yeah. fucking JJ Abrams. Brian just doesn't understand kids. Well, kids today, they want explosions. They want pew pew. They want excitement. They want, they want ADHD. Cameras, okay? I mean, I don't understand the force, the bro, okay? The Everyone in Hollywood, they think they understand kids, but no, they just fuck them. Uh, <laughs> they, want a, they want an 80 year old man walking around going, I am so sorry for being white. I really, really am. <laughs> terribly sorry yeah. for being right, white and, and right. No, I was I, never I, right. I'm British as that well. That was my privilege. We are I'm a colonial, you see. Mm -hmm. yep. uh, it's all my fault. I, I, I'm responsible for the slave trade as He's well, if you wanted to. I'm <laughs> sorry, me anything. <laughs> Give me your list of things. I'll apologize episode. to all of it. I don't fucking care. Please don't forget me. <laughs> I'm dead, by the way, and I'm a robot now, but I think that righteous have forgotten. <laughs> yeah, let's see if they uh, bring that up. That'll be funny. <laughs> I uh, bet they ignore it. Uh, oh yeah. man! All right. On that note, I'm gonna head out, y'all. Y'all have a wonderful, <laughs> beautiful night. Did, did you, you fuck her? Fuck her. <laughs> yeah, no, did you? I, I, no I actually did yet. answer it. Roll back the Come tape. On. I said, "Of course not." Uh, but you didn't listen. I think you actually glitched out. The knot dropped uh, out on the I don't show. believe yeah. you. Did yeah. it sounded to me like you just said, "Of course." Right. Yeah. Yeah. Not. Yeah. 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 I'm gonna tell Glenn. <laughs> Let's get Next time we see him, Oh, I just got a text. Him. I'm never invited onto the show again. So. <laughs> that was a that was a fast, you know. I, I mean, we have going. a tendency to do that. Me and Ryan get invited on a Daily Wire, and then we're roasting Ben Shapiro about his Home Depot picture a few weeks later. <laughs> now, now we're now we got Glenn, the whole Glenn Beck. Yeah, thing. yeah we're not. No wonder Zack Snyder denounced this. Fuck. Well, we don't get it. <laughs> <laughs> he was just doing it before we got to him. Yeah. <laughs> Preemptive. Preemptive. Preemptive strike. <laughs> he didn't. He rushed it, y'all. Oh, God. Like Jeremy, you said Zack Snyder is going to be nine live streams now about <laughs> oh, this. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, man. They throw him uh, under the bus.
This is what happens. I need oh, more God. attention. I'm going to talk about it for another year. Oh, Go for it. <laughs> Good Y'all God. have a wonderful night. Some people right. do. Later, Later, Bye, Odin. Bye, Odin. Bye. 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 <laughs> he did. He totally did. Uh, me too. <clears throat> me too. On the Streamlab side, circumventing Mama Susan for $50. Because one year ago today, I turned 35, which means you're 36. I can do math without X-Ray Girl. I'm feeling more confident. <laughs> also, I have one Good year. Job, Gary. Thanks. Uh, I said goodbye to my wife for the last time. Oh, cherish the ones Aww. you love because you never Aww. know Aww. when you, they are gone. You're right. I'm sorry right. to hear I'm that. sorry it's to hear that, time, dude. Ouch. Yeah. yeah. Big uh, huggles, man. Yeah. Yep, yep. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, live every day like it's your last uh live live life to the fullest well, order yeah. every meal like it's your last the ryan oh, yeah right. yes exactly <laughs> demand excellence it and make sure through. they bring you 12 breadsticks <laughs> <laughs> Mm-hmm. His, my favorite part of the video is where he's like I know I'm going to like it and then he eats it he goes fuck it's good, <laughs> good. <laughs> <laughs> and then it ends like the Detroit Rock part. City my favorite part is when he's walking through the park lot screaming fuck thank, thank you, you. <laughs> <laughs> God. Uh, fucking still mad about that <laughs> <laughs> we wasted know. so much of my fucking time um Probably one of the most aptly named accounts for uh, our show is Low Watermark on the stream <laughs> yes. side for $250. Whoa. Wow, 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 wow. Thank you, guys. We love you. Uh, no need to read this. What, why? Hang on. <laughs> oh, I left it in there because it's... <laughs> I'm going to read it. I'm going to read it anyway. It says no need to read this. I just want to support you guys. But Road Trip Ryan is amazing. Joe Pesci references are amazing. And you're amazing. (laughs) Low watermark. Thank you, you, Low watermark. And we appreciate that. We appreciate that a lot. I get a a lot of messages like that. And I'm sure you guys do too. And and we, yeah, it's, uh, we can never express our gratitude. It would never be good enough. That's. That's why we do the meetups. Mm. That's why the meetups will be free. Uh, that we weren't not going to charge you for anything. I don't know. Somebody might sell a T-shirt here and there, but uh, we, we won't charge tickets or any crap like that. And we're gonna. I'm gonna shove merch down your fucking face. There you go. I'm gonna sell panties. Yeah, yeah there, there'll be there might be options. Use to buy. <laughs> there might be options to buy stuff, but there, there's never going to be a requirement for you to have to pay an amount of money to come see us. No. Uh, we are not John Campia level. We're sucks. not. We're not that big time of YouTubers. Um, yeah. You know, we uh, we're just regular peeps just like all of you and yeah can't wait to have yeah i just want to hang out yeah it'd be, it'd be, I'm, yeah. I'm ah, i can't <laughs> wait i can't uh, wait. i'll be doing a meet and greet next door it's 25 dollars a head <laughs> <laughs> 40 40 dollars for a for photograph with an autograph hey, okay as <clears throat> and that's one with the plexiglass in between as mall yeah. oh, uh, uk I might be going to the UK. That's dude. where we are. Oh, God. <gasps> really? What? Wow. What? That's cool. Well, now that you dropped some fucking mandates, about time. So, oh. I'll get over. Holy it. cow. Yeah. Nice. Now that Britain. Is that a dating man thing? It, will it be cheaper because there's a war going on right now? Can I be like Joe Jayhart oh. from The View? She's on my yeah. vacation in Italy. It's going to be now. messed up. I'm like, will the flights be cheaper? <clears throat> I hope you're going during the summer. Uh, yeah, I mean, it'd be, it, it, during their, uh, can I say it? I'll say it anyway. I don't care. Indian summer. I like the, it's September gets a, oh, yeah, September. September. Okay, yeah. September. Yeah. okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, like feather or dot. What does that mean? That's good. Yeah. Indian, Indian summer. Yeah. It's like late summer. It's a, it, it's, well, in, Indian summer means it's, it's kind of like unseasonally hot, but yeah. it's not meant yeah. to be that hot yeah. in that sort of time. So uh, like so, September's autumn, but it's still but like, if you know what time of year it, isn't doesn't that mean it's going it's actually going to be seasonally hot it's, it's, yeah it generally is sometimes it isn't though same August, thing for san, san francisco september. and yeah. london are identical in that that they'll like in september sometimes they'll have some really hot months and then sometimes it'll rain like I, fucking crazy i, well, I just i can't say like, anything i live in texas so. yeah i just thought yeah. it meant like a summer that was like very hot i didn't know it was like a specific time every year yeah in a summer in the city in the summer. Dun, dun, but i didn't dun, know if it was dun, named dun, after dun, dun, like 
are Indians or India Indians. Yeah. So. Couldn't tell if it was like a summer I don't know. where you worked in I have, I've been using the saying There are Indians over here <laughs> in the UK. But they're called Asians now. It's Native American summer yeah. now, okay? <laughs> it's Native yeah. American? Yeah. It's Indigenous <laughs> summer. That's, that's, indigenous. What that's what he's <laughs> asking. Two-spirited yeah. summer. Is it Indigenous people's summer or yeah. not Sorry. summer? Some no, person. we're in the UK, not America. <laughs> They're not native fucking native Oh, so you, mean you don't have any no, 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 no. I was I was talking about why Gary was referencing that. I didn't think there were going to be Native Americans. It's just one of those things I heard my, in the UK. my parents say, and I just use you it. You can't say Indian now. That's the way he's, he's stressing. It's okay. I'm Indian. I just Indian, Indian summer is still okay. Right? Indians are really I mean, mad about that. For though. all I know. Okay. Do we Maybe. call it Native American giving now? <laughs> Maybe too? it's not. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Indigenous person. Indigenous giving. people's giving. Yeah. <laughs> Indigenous <laughs> non-binary <laughs> persons giving. Yeah. Two spirited. Wow. Hey, it's been uh, over four hours. Of my countries are just rolling into another one right now, laughing at fucking the worst. I think it's as is bedtime. Oh, what did I say? No, <laughs> not that. It's, it's been, it's been over four hours, so. Oh, shit, it's like half past two. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, got, I got half an hour, mate. Let's go All for right. half an hour. Okay. Okay. Does anybody else need to bail out? You can I just bail had out. a coffee. Here's your, uh, here's your opportunity. I'll hang. I'll hang until as leaves. Okay. I can't, I can't, I yeah, can't not be, yeah, I can't stand, I can't stand to be on the show without him. So Aww. that's a <laughs> fucking <laughs> lie. They're that's like, a fucking lie. With it. So. A streaming codependent. I like it. Uh, Robert <laughs> McDonald to be with him. for $50. <laughs> Thank you, Robert. Appreciate you. Oh, I said Ronald McDonald. <laughs> no, Robert McDonald. It's show, Ronald's what? brother. <laughs> Here's fifty dollars for some hamburgers. <laughs> is that Ronald McDonald's voice? <laughs> I don't know. He's no, a fucking clown. Fuck no, no. They used to be commercials. <laughs> yeah, there are commercials, but he doesn't sound like this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's all I'm white Mickey Mouse. Uh, like Mickey Mouse, fuck the clown. <laughs> it's not even like some hamburger. Buy your fucking <laughs> tickets, kids. <laughs> uh -huh. Uh -huh. You, <laughs> you pay for that six thousand dollar room, you fucking twat. Uh -huh. It's probably still <laughs> fucking. Yeah, you you'll appreciate <laughs> Ray. Uh -huh. She's the best <laughs> Ray money. Oh god, I hope Shut South up and Park. Play some space bingo, you quant. I hope South Park uh -huh. tears that you hotel quant. apart. God, I hope they do. <laughs> oh, they cool. A quant. Oh, that. Token, that want... token episode was epic. It was so fucking good. It's it's the oh, best South, South Park. Park yeah, the South Park episode yeah. from uh, two or three weeks ago. Tom brought it to my attention. Oh, did you hear what the leftists it. were saying about that? Uh, it was about time that uh, South Park actually corrected a mistake that they made a long time ago. And maybe that's what they were doing, but they did it in a fucking funny way. It's so, a funny way. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, first, we had Pestilence. Uh, now we have war. Next should be famine, and last should be frost. <laughs> <laughs> we all get frost bitten in the end. Yeah, we do. Oh shit! Nobody gave a toss about looking at G four tonight. Hold on. A I'm toss. On it. A toss. Not give a toss. Yeah. Not give a toss. What's the give ice and no fire? Gave it to us. Oh no, it's it's over. <laughs> <laughs> oh well. I think we had more people watching our pre-show. Than they did on <laughs> Probably <laughs> before we got started. Well, uh, oh, what happened? How did the Frost saga end? I mean, she nuked her Twitter and then it Jeremy petered out. Did a, she did yeah. it, it ended away. with G four being with a even whimper, less relevant not now a bang. than were. Yeah. yeah, yeah, definitely not a bang, or else she wouldn't have been yeah. so upset in the first place. <laughs> <laughs> That's how it all started. <laughs> yeah. She was upset that no one wanted to bang her. Nobody wants no. to bang me. Someone should have just taken one for the fucking team, honestly. Oh, That's God, what should have no. happened. Oh, uh, no. Uh, I mean, she got laid, she'd probably be a lot nicer. Uh, Ryan, that's uh, sexist. How dare you say that? <laughs> How, how, I, I thought that was fucking pretty reasonable. I don't know. Yeah, just, not, just that was literally her complaint. She says, "All these people in the chat, you're just mad that I'm not as these bangable people? as Olivia." 
Like that's what right. she was upset about. Just wait till the draft starts popping up. She's gonna be like, "Oh, I, I'll make you sandwiches. I'll get in the kitchen." Oh, have piece. you seen I, the memes? Somebody fuck me, please. I, I want to know all these memes know. of women doing dishes on fucking Twitter, and it and it's just like when a feminist yeah. hears that <laughs> they're the, the doing the draft. I'll wash this. <laughs> oh, oh, my girl. Oh. I want to. I want to hear I'm the, the woke <laughs> I, I want to hear the woke Twitterati. Twitterati, call it Ukraine, and say why. Are you only forcing the fighting age men to stay? Mm, Why are you preventing every man age 18 to 60 from leaving your country? Why not the women too? Where's the equality? Oh, and and they're being armed as well. This is why Putin's invading. He's got a... The equity, it's not good enough over there. Yeah, exactly. he <laughs> he's gotta he's gotta deplat from all the Nazis and bring back diversity and, and representation. That's what he's saying. Exactly. Uh, but he's yeah, diversify the military. The Occupy Democrats, which I can't even I can't believe that the Occupy account is like still going. That was so long mm. ago. They've they haven't been relevant in so fucking long. But uh they tweeted out the Ukrainian government is handing out ten thousand automatic weapons to their citizens. Wow. Retweet this if you want Ukraine to keep fighting Russia. I know. If you support them. And like how, they brought how, back a couple insane. of course. And of course, Defiant L's from a couple years ago, it's like wow. no American needs an AR 15. Wow. Beautiful. Yeah. It was, uh, I just love stuff like that. Yeah. It's almost like the Second Amendment isn't for fucking hunting. Yeah. Right. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Unless you count government officials, then maybe. But. Yeah. Well. Ho <laughs> or hey judges. That was That's a what joke. Anyone yeah. no, that was in a video game. It's, it's not, not a joke, season, right? It's not a joke. No. That's what it's for. It's, it's well, protecting no. yourself. It's no, protecting it's yourself. No, it was the it was the no. government. Of it, it. It's to protect yeah. yourself from a tyrannical government. Exactly. Yes. Which yeah. is exactly what he said. Oh, That's what okay. it's not a joke. Tyrannosaurus. A Tyrannosaurus government. Yeah, Tyrannosaurus government. A Tyrannosaurus government. As, as a representative of a country who was your greatest ever landlord, and then you kicked him out. <laughs> and then we kicked your ass. Yep. I. Uh, no, we let you go. We wanted you to. <laughs> what? Fly. Yeah. I thought we, we kicked want... you out. I thought no, we wanted you out. to grow. No, we, 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 went like... <laughs> we went home. We went home. home. Yeah. Oh, is that how it's going? Swallow right? that pride empty. and take. You went the home L. empty-handed. <laughs> <laughs> we had each other held each other's hands. <laughs> <laughs> and guess we what? Did, we we did never drink tea. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, exactly. We still don't drink tea. We yeah. left and we went. Look, we've done to the indigenous. We threw that tea. <laughs> we threw that tea in the harbor, man. We started drinking yeah. coffee. <laughs> we said coffee is where it's at. You can you can throw the tea if you want. I mean, it's a waste. Yeah. yeah, it's a waste. That's a reality right there. It was all Yorkshire tea. Uh, Ruben, oh, Ruben, to get you, man. Ruben Christopher Haynes for fifty dollars on the stream. Ruben! Line, so. What's up, Ruben? Ruben, how's it going, man? Ruben. Yeah, Ruben. Ruben. Ruben, such a good dude. Uh, hey, Wasn't friend he in I... the hospital for a minute? He was. Yeah, he was. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Hope and he's, he's better. Better now, and, and he got better. He got banned better. from Twitter. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Hail Friday Night Tights banned from Twitter for calling out the dumb cunt that wanted to be Putin's mom. Anyway, just relaunched my OG YouTube channel, My Weight Loss Quest, so I will post daily regarding my illness health journey. I will walk into the October meetup. I can't fucking wait. I will, oh, yeah. I will see you Dude, there. Dude, I'm so excited for the October meetup. Yes. Yeah. Hey. Same here. Yeah. I'll see you there. I am. Oh, you just got to go. Period. End of story. I'm not going to take no for an answer. It's been too long since the last one. The last one was yep, rad. It was rad. rad. It was amazing. Yep. We need to do another another one soon. Well, we uh, like Vegas dropped the mask mandate because Vegas with masks is fucking lame. It's unbelievably yeah. lame. Uh, you can <laughs> you can take your mask off at the casino if you're drinking or smoking. Yep. I know that's so crazy. So I drink and smoke twenty four seven. It's for your health. My sister's a high school for teacher. For your health. My mm. sister teaches high school in uh, in Vegas, like right in Clark County, and she said that uh, the day after the masks uh, were lifted in school, there were still some students wearing them. And then my sister asked, like, why are some students still like? She asked one of the kids that she knows, like, hey, why are some people still wearing it? And she's like, the the kids get bullied when they try to not wear their masks by the other kids that, that are pro mask, and they call them um, 
anti-vax Trump voters. These are oh high school God. kids. God. Yeah. Wow. Kicked their asses. I, 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 I thought it was going to be because they were getting called ugly. That's no. what I thought it was. <laughs> and... <laughs> Make the ugly take the that's mask. That's fucking there's terrible. There's other guy teacher who started taking his mask off. And by the way, there's students of hers that have like never seen her whole face like this whole time. Mm-hmm. And uh, so this guy, this guy teacher took his mask off and there was actually a student that moved his desk away to be further away from the Pussy. teacher. What, so yeah, no, so look what we did to the kids. Put it we back fucked or up. get out the fucking class. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, fuck the generation little of kids. Shit. It, look it, what we did. Yeah, th- yeah. Adults, yep. adults did that. Of air. So, sold out uh, uh, multiple generations of kids. Well done, fuckers. Two um, years is so long when you're in school. It is. Dude, like a lifetime. Life. Life. When yeah. you're little, yeah. like dog years. My kid, my kid missed his, his <laughs> freshman year. I mean, like, we just said, fuck it. I mean, that's what yeah. we did. We're like, it, it, you know, he's got three years of school left now. Fuck it. No, we're just going to homeschool him, get him, get him out of this stupid shit. We are looking for something here in Texas. We are. Hopefully it gets them back in the groove, but um, you know, special needs kids completely fucked uh, from this. Yeah. Uh, they they really needed that everyday repetition, and it does help in their development. Yeah, and help them have seen. like absolutely normal lives. Busted that all up, and then the regular kids busted that all up too. Traumatized them. Were shameful. It's fucking shameful what we did. To it the is kids. shameful. It, the the remote learning we t- we I actually talked about this on the blaze a little bit too Jeremy like the remote learning is fucked people yes. up because mm-hmm. the teachers are there's a lot of teachers that may may or may not be qualified to teach as it is yeah um, the remote learning nobody was ready for that and it's so completely inefficient imagine oh, yeah. like a, a seven year old being told to sit in front of a fucking computer and watch a Skype meeting for eight hours a day. Yeah. Yeah. Like uh, that, that is provides no fucking value at all. Boringest thing ever. Yep. I can't imagine that. It's like torture. Yeah. And and the teachers homeschool your kids. And the That's teachers like fucking prolong yeah, fuck the teachers. They they prolonged it. And I know there's some good teachers out there. I'm not talking about you, but if you're part of a union, they they fucked it up. If you're the teachers unions fucked up this country. They prolonged it. California teachers unions were still trying to keep the mask on. They're still doing it right now. Yeah. Right yeah, fucking now. California is Some a of long them, yeah, some of them it don't really even is. think they should be in school. So fuck the teachers unions, man. Uh, Gabe. California will rise again, I'm telling you. God. <laughs> we got a lot of heart, okay? From the ocean. <laughs> hey, hey, Atlantis is more right of a chance Cal- of rising yeah. than California. Hey, Adam, I'm, Adam, I'm banking on this global warming stuff. Okay? Adam, you're going to be like an old As sea level rises, I'm going to have like time. coast front property here. Adam, so. it sucks. I hated, leaving, <laughs> I hated leaving my homeland, dude, but like it ain't getting any better. And the only way, the only way California turns around if it splits up into three. It needs to split. It needs to split up. Ah, it needs yeah. to split up. Would it be Cal, LaFleur, and Cal- Nia? <laughs> yeah. Chris, oh are you in California? I love oh, the great I want to be Nia. No, there be yeah. Nia. No Cal, so Cal, yeah. low Cal. Dude, no Cal, so Cal, low Cal. No Cal, so Cal, low Cal. Look at this. He's barely low. He sounds like fucking organic farms threads. Yeah. I like low He's still got California dirt. Stuck in his socks, and he's already bad mouthing California, dude. I got Cal- <laughs> you're, you're not barely kidding. left the just state. like a Texan hey, would. I have I'm California around, around, damn straight. I have California <laughs> dust on these monitors that I haven't kept cleaned off yet, dude. <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly. But I've where's sh- the loyalty, Gary? Where's I've been the loyalty? Shitting on California for three years from California. Blow it away. Get out of here. Yeah. He's a Texan now. <laughs> he's a Texan now. He's ours. I've got dog shit on my shoes that I picked up in California. I think. Yep. Or maybe it's human. It's human shit. That's human. <laughs> it's been a it's a pandemic. Okay, California's having a rough spot. I'm not not gonna lie. Okay, <laughs> it's been a rough few decades. <laughs> oh, been a rough couple mean, decades. You mean, of of what, you mean in San Diego? Uh, yeah. He's on the street. De- de- decriminalizing petty crime not a good not, not a good a idea good, not, not a good idea right good idea, in right retrospect right you know 20 who, you know, I, I, who could have imagined it though who could have thought that would be stupid yeah, as fuck? Mm, Bro, yeah. i got i got fucking mugged and robbed in san diego within the first two or three weeks that i lived there and like, Ryan, it, it just, did not take long and i could tell you right now that like n- used to never happen in san diego yeah. 
for between it 1989. It was literally right by Petco Park. It was after a Padres yes. game. Yeah. And I mean, there's a, like awful. a little bad area yeah. there, like uh, Barrio Logan's not too far, I think. But um, Barrio Logan, Barrio Logan. But uh, you no, know, you used to be able to walk downtown San Diego 3 a.m. You would nothing would happen to you for a longest yeah. time. I, I, and I remember the cops. Like I'm like, yeah, I just got to town because it, it was it was like fucking six dudes that came up behind me, sucker punched me, and fucking yeah. took my shit. Oh. Yeah, I got gangbanged in San Diego. <laughs> and, is that all and, that and so happened? the cop and so the cop is like, uh, well, you know, sorry to hear that, but it can happen in any city. I was like, well, no. <laughs> was no. The <laughs> yeah, the cops are that and I can't it doesn't. <laughs> yeah. And I said, well, there's other places they might be scared because I'm carrying a gun. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I didn't really like that. I answer. can't believe a yeah, cop said oh, too didn't. bad about that crime. It happens everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. he, was a a he was trying to sell me on San Diego still. <laughs> that's, wow. that's fun what it was. So. Yeah, well, they don't mug you now. They just try to vax you. Uh, if it I, happened to me, it could happen to you. San Diego I, used to be fucking paradise, man. It used to be paradise. Now it's it's L.A. It's Orange County South. And not yeah. the good bits of Orange County. Not Hermosa Beach. Uh, like the oh, yeah. shitty parts of Anaheim. That's what Gary, it's like. Yeah. Luckily, yeah. all those all those fucking this, this, pieces of shit Batman were so Ninja stupid. Batman's amazing. Oh, dude. Mm. Yeah. Wait. Luckily, all those. Yeah, yeah. Oh, God, watch this. Hold on. Watch this. Hold on. Oh. 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 Wow. See, Batman would have protected me. Yeah. Yes. Bat Batman would have kicked some ass. Hey, I have Luckily, a doll, too. It's not a doll. <laughs> <laughs> it's, not a, it's not a doll. <laughs> I want an action figure. Myself. Does that have a baby Yoda head on it? Yes, that someone made it for me. <laughs> and it came with a boyfriend. Whoa. Oh, hey. oh. Hey. Oh. 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 oh, 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 my That's God. That's how you can tell that doll's not very realistic. Uh, wow. <laughs> All heroes go down. Wow, it's been a while since we had articulated sex. Yeah, Education. Yeah. <laughs> what the hell? At least you know, I like just hand jobs by looking away. <laughs> looking wow. Away. Why won't you look me in the eye? Why? Why won't you look me in the eye? I'm mad at you, but I'll still do it. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Wonderful. Uh, Gabe, uh, uh, how do I say this last name? It's it's almost like mine, but worse. Um, but look, look at that. Boy, too sure. Boy, balaclava. Boy, too sure. Boy, too sure. Boy, too sure. Team America. Boy, too sure. Team America. Durka. 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 Which classic movie do you guys and Chrissy not want Hollywood to wokeify with a remake or reimagination? Lord of the Rings. Lord of the Rings. Yeah. Personally, if they remade. Breakfast yeah, Club, it would be a disaster of identity to politics. Oh, God, Breakfast Club would be fucking terrible. You oh, see what they did to yeah. Heathers on the TV show? That would be oh, hilarious. Dude. Oh, my God. Uh, it would imagine be a disaster. An, Sorry, go on. An, imagine they did an all-female remake of Tropic Thunder. Oh, but the Breakfast Club, wouldn't they all be like, wouldn't it have them all conforming? <laughs> Leslie Jones yeah, in it would be the cool thing. Face. Yeah, yep. Amy Schumer. It would and be, they'd all be telling vagina jokes. Yeah, like, I think we need to jokes. follow the rules. That's what we need to do. We need to follow the rules and comply. Uh, it, it would, would be, be simple. Uh, so let me finish it up. It would be a disaster of identity politics. Bullshit. Would love to hear your guys discuss briefly. Thanks. Sorry. Go on, Ryan. I yeah. I want to know who in that cast is going to play simple the simple Jack character. <laughs> simple Jack. Simple Jack. <laughs> Amy Schumer. <laughs> Amy Schumer. Yeah. <laughs> So in the new Breakfast She's Club, fucking retarded. Uh, no, 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 they never got no, in trouble. They're all set up. It wasn't their fault. They don't take responsibility. Uh, yeah, the Le I need Leslie Jones in white face. Yeah, I fucking riot. Playing simple oh, Jack. Yeah. <laughs> that would be great. Uh, that would be pretty funny, actually. Yeah, I was gonna say that could be funny though. And they don't do yeah. that. Yeah. <laughs> It's, no, but I mean, at this point, you can't you can't have faith in Hollywood doing anything at this point. That doesn't mean that everything's going to be terrible. There's some there's always some, some good stuff out there that we've seen recently, but you don't have faith in Hollywood to do anything because yeah. everything that has any following or significance, <laughs> they're going to hijack it. That's it. I, like Disney. It's just like that's the reason Cobra Kai is good is because a, a bunch of Hollywood nut jobs weren't sitting around going, 
you know, Karate Kid's got a big following. We could totally mm. reboot that with some, you know, black people and some lesbians, and we could totally <laughs> diversify. Mm. They didn't see the need. No one really saw the need except <clears throat> for some passionate fans. So the reason that Cobra Kai is so well received and it's done so well is because actual fans do it. But anything that has any relevance, those Hollywood nut jobs are sitting around thinking of opportunities to change it and fix it. So. It's like the, what uh, as always cast- says. As always says, you know, it's it's for them to advertise to us and convince <laughs> us. So, yeah, there's so many situations now I can't trust anything because yep. they could come around and fuck me whenever I go into the movie theater. And I'm like, what the? I don't want to get fucked again because I keep getting fucked. I don't yeah, like him I mean, to drive. I like, I like, way. I like fucking, but not you like know, that. I don't, not I don't want to, I don't want to get fucked. Not like this. Yeah, but yeah, not fucked. like this. Not like this. No. <laughs> Uh, did you see the casting call for uh, Quantum Leap? It's all black. Was it all down? Well, essentially, essentially, it's no white, no whites allowed. Yeah, what are they gonna, really? And what are they going to go do? Go through time and all the major characters are, eth- are specific ethnics, and then there's some subsidiary characters which are open ethnicity, which means obviously you could have a white person go for that and and, and get the role. But all the Gross. major characters are very specific ethnicity. Well, there's white women. <clears throat> I should say there's no. It's it's a no white man mm-hmm. thing. Because uh, so there's, no there's, there's, the there's a specific white woman, and then there's like all the other main characters are ethnically sort of done. And then there's an open call for uh, a couple of random. You sure this is not a porn? They're women. <laughs> I think the randomos are women. I don't even think the randomos are men. So. <laughs> Who gives it's basically a shit? no white men allowed. I mean, uh, Quantum Leap was all right as a series. I loved it. I, I loved it too as a kid. I, I, I thought it was all right. It's very polarizing. Oh, it was <laughs> great. Apparently very polarizing. Yeah. I mean, you know, you lo- he you was helping like, people. Yeah. He, he was in a new situation every week. It was cool. Yeah. He was driving with Daisy. Yeah. He was in blackface. He was a retard. It was great. Yes. <laughs> are you he talking was, about Jimmy Kimmel was, or what are you talking yeah. about? Yeah. <laughs> they could, like, they could. <laughs> Justin uh, Trudeau. Justin Trudeau. Yeah. Justin Trudeau. But they were like they couldn't work out why he was jumping. They were, you know, they couldn't work out back at Quantum Leap headquarters while he was leaping around, and then it got it. it you discovered like seasons in it was actually god it was god god was making him leap that pesky god so they ripped off the michael landon there show it yes there it is yeah <laughs> yes, yes god made him retarded okay. oh Aww. yes oh here it is who's in the mirror, mirror. I thought it was going to be Ryan, so (laughs) (laughs) meme already exists. It's Ryan holding his breadsticks. Uh, (laughs) All twelve of them. (laughs) It was great. Like those episodes were really heartfelt, and they were heartfelt. 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 Well, I don't, they're I've really seen, heartfelt and they're I've really good. I've never seen that one with the retarded thing. What even is that? Like, what's the story about that? <laughs> what even is that? He <laughs> dug into the body of Daddy the Daddy Chow. What the hell is even that? Even that? <laughs> Daddy Chow. What the Daddy hell Chow. is even that? All right. Well, what is that from? Daddy Chow. Right. Well, now that now that you guys have brought up that, yeah. I'm going to have to play this clip. Yep. Uh, shout out to Yellow Flash. Shout out to and Yellow Flash. I knew it. Here we go. Here I am not go. gay. Here we go. This one. Yes. Here it is. Here it is. Yeah. Yeah. Here it is. Here we go. Oh, no. Oh, no. I am not gay. Relationships <laughs> with women. It's <laughs> with men. And I got news for you. That means you're gay. That means you're gay. <laughs> 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 a little Shout bit of music that added music at the end. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. What's that from? CSI Gay Town? Yeah. Yeah. That's CSI from the Law and Order SVU. Special, special Victims Unit. <laughs> I, How I, did I, I know it was a procedural <laughs> for some reason? With men. Very I like he, says it, he says it so I, masculine, though. I used to watch <laughs> Law and Order SVU, and I, that episode is like a football player, and there's like this underground gay football player section. <laughs> <laughs> and so what like ice tea selling I, american footballers for gay sex <laughs> so well. ice tea 
Ice T in the thing, his son is gay. So whenever anything has to do with gay people, he goes and asks his son for advice about it. He's like, what? Hey, gay what, son. Does it, what does it mean being on the down low? And like his gay son explains it to him. Also note the irony of He's like, the fuck? Police right. officer too. What was that? Was that a lot, division? He did that back in the back in the day in New Jack City. He was a police oh. officer in that. Comics died. <laughs> Comics died. They like, came for him, him, man. He did. He, he got him. Him. it out. He tried the, to under, say the underground gay football ring Bullshit. got him. Oh, oh, he's got going him. pixelated Ryan on us. So. Oh, there we go. Uh. I'm back. <laughs> 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 That's right. Aww. Born on the 4th of July. Do 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 do. 1972. Just did, he, did he leap off. into a Vietnam man? Vietnam man. What's a Vietnam man? What the hell is even that? Uh, a Vietnam man. Uh, did he leap into a Vietnamese uh, still a veteran right in one episode? <laughs> a Vietnamese veteran? What the fuck am I doing? I don't know. I'm gonna read it. It's like three o'clock in the morning over It here. is yeah. three o'clock in the morning, nearly. Uh, so yeah. Uh, Ian a so forth. Vietnam veteran. Yes. Thank you. It is Vietnam. Vietnam. <laughs> uh, Ian so forth. Uh, for 50 British pounds, that is probably. Ian. Thank you. Thank you. Yay. Thank you. Uh, new audio book of Lord of the Rings re read by Grace. Necessary. So. So. There were some hobbits and they had a ring hobbits. and they took the ring to the Mordor. And they lived in a hole I didn't even ground. know what it is, but, but I, I like the hole. diversity. But, I mean, is it even still relevant? Like, <laughs> mm. <laughs> Who even likes this? It Who looks awful, but I is? hope it succeeds. <laughs> just to own I just all like the people the diversity. who want to respect the lore. Oh, my God. Uh, <laughs> wow, 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 wow. Uh, Gary's <laughs> broke-ass monitor on the Streamlab side for $100. <laughs> wow. Yeah, the broke ass monitor set out in the fucking rain. Because uh, oh. I just lifted outside for dying like that. Oops. Andrew Garfield's bulbous head destroyed it. Uh, oh my God. He does have a rotund head. He yes. does have a big head, but he's a good actor, that guy. Robust. Great, great actor. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you forgot something, Gary. Me! But that's okay. I was picked up by oh. a homeless Raylo who constantly pleasures himself to images of female Ryan deep throating quarter black she males spicy pepperoni. Uh, hashtag pineapple on pizza. <laughs> I do have a spicy pepperoni. <laughs> Speaking of quarter black, I have this. <laughs> Uh, we is good people. <laughs> Y'all think it's a joke? That's how I talk. <laughs> I think is this the Duck Dynasty guy that you're on? I think so. Duck <laughs> Where's my headband? Hold on. Yeah. Oh, you shit. actually have one? Of course he I have does. A text, I have look a text. At, oh. Look at him. Of course he Look does. at him. Quarter mm. Black fought and died in the Vietnam War for you. The, the Vietnamese Ma 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 War for you. The Vietnamese Maz. Do 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 do. Vietnam Ma do 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 do. It is. There it is. Hail, brother. Oh, it's it's better, it's you know what that? Hey, hey, it's all, it actually it's, looks like you're a little bit Indian right now. It's, it's all better. Than I am that. a little bit Indian. That's little known. It's all, it's all better than fact. that motherfucking man bun. I'm just saying. Justin yeah. Trudeau is going to try and buy you to go to Canada for a vote. Just, you're just <laughs> jealous you can't grow hair this long. It's okay. Oh. <laughs> no, I am. And it makes me cry on the inside. <laughs> I did. It makes me cry on the inside. I did and I had no, to cut did, it because have. in prison somebody said, hey, Goldilocks, I want to taste your sack lunch. <laughs> <laughs> yep. That was the first words I heard inside. And I said, I'm going to cut my hair now. Because I hey, don't want to cut. My sat lu sack lunch is going to stay attached. Fucking Ooh, um, hey, Cody Lux. Somebody find you want to let down your hair? <laughs> down my yeah. This is how you get. Oh. This is how you get gangster. You go the, the little extra down. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah, that's right. Oh shit, that shit'll get you shot in the wrong. Yeah, that's how you get mugged. Yeah. Next yeah. time I'm called right racist, there. I'm going. I'm gonna show that, you just show this. Like, just show this him. picture. He's like, wrong I'm, not, I'm not racist. Colorless. I have a quarter Colorless. black friend. Uh, yeah. <laughs> B-boy B -boy stance. Oh, my God. It counts. It counts. It, it counts. counts. It counts. It counts. Dude, my fucking. Yeah. 
<laughs> my cheeks are hurting from this episode. Both of them. Yeah. <laughs> Tell me. My ass cheeks and my ass. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Gary's getting, getting, getting flashbacks to that gold one. <laughs> <laughs> I was watching, I was watching uh, just before the stream. Uh, you'll appreciate this, uh, Ryan. Tevin was restreaming DSP. <laughs> And somebody really? tweeted in with like a dollar super chat, and their name was DS Blippi's Clapped Cheeks. <laughs> <laughs> and, he just, and he just read it out. Nobody just went, DSP's Clapped Cheeks. Uh, for a dollar, for a dollar. <laughs> just read it. Oh. That's fucking great. And Tevin gets so many more people watching him than DSP. I know. <laughs> and he's just literally restreaming DSP while talking shit about him. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, yeah, he's way more entertaining. Uh, yeah. Daniel oh. for fifty dollars. What's up, Daniel? Thank you. Good to see you here. You're always here. You're always here. I appreciate that. Daniel's been around for a long time. Uh, I understand what Grace is saying. I'm a cricket super fan, but I never seen a game or even understand how it's played. So instead of wickets, Ooh. stumps, and balls, I substitute bases, strikes, innings, and I call it baseball instead. Don't gatekeep me. Well said. <laughs> <laughs> you mean you mean you mean rounders? You mean you're playing rounders? Okay. Oh, I remember rounders. The fuck does that mean? The fuck is rounders? Rounders is a game where you have three bases, four bases, and somebody lobs a ball and you twat it with a stick that looks very like a bat. This sounds American familiar. Into... Mm. Oh, we turned it into a long oh, wait. We improved it. Oh yeah, it sounds Cricket-ish. like just another just another group of people that are mad we fucking perfected something. Yeah, we made yeah, something yeah. better. <laughs> you guys have tea. Same, we have same with Mexicans tea. and Taco Bell. They're still butthurt over. You guys have <laughs> culture. We have America. <laughs> Ryan, American made Mexican better. <laughs> I'm not going to oh, lie. Oh my with god, that was that beautiful. Is correct. Uh, um, text, text, no, text. I like you know me. I like my sports ball, Ryan. I like my sports ball, but I cannot. I fucking don't give a shit about baseball or basketball. Fucking can't stand them. Well, the baseball one, I mean, I, I can kind of get some. It's boring for some people. The basketball one is because you're racist. So. Yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> you don't like black people. Baseball that's what used that to be correct. Baseball used uh, to be better when all the players were jacked up on fucking steroids. <laughs> yes! Yeah. 90s yes, Gary, was thank that, you. That, that's what everyone says. And Make then when a baseball I, great again. That, that's what everyone says. And when I show them the, the facts that actually more home runs were hit two years ago, like by far. Yeah, by boring, the by boring era. skinny guys uh, and not, listen, I, I fucking love baseball my entire life. It just got boring. I, I hated the, 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 I don't want to bore people with this. The pitcher's fucking around on the mound for too long to the point where they had to uh, change the rule. That, that got annoying. Block. Yeah, it's God, I was hate uh, hated that shit. Plus, I'm a Padres fan. They sucked for fucking uh, decades. Right, that's probably your biggest problem. Four fire sales. Uh, and then we get that's the team we get to keep. Stuff. That's the team we get to fucking keep, and we lose the fucking Chargers. God damn it. Uh, I like going to Padres games because no one gave a fuck about it. Tickets are cheap. So. Yeah, it's a nice stadium, too. I like it. Uh, Matthew Wright for $100. Grace is the cultural reality of a Darwin Award as she lives off a straw as her opinions fall. With her fake New York accent. Ooh, it's fake. I didn't know that. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Really? It's, wait, it's, it's, it's from New York. Is she from New York? I know she lives there now. It doesn't even sound like New York to me. No, I don't think it does. So it's weird that like, she, I, did, I didn't, didn't the, pick up on that one. She does the Barbara Wawa Walters thing she, and, and Elmer Fudd thing, you know, once in a while. Elmer. Once in a while. Elmer Fudd. Elmer Fudd. Once in a, once in a while. Yeah. yeah she, she speaks like Elmer Fudd. Yeah, she does. Silly a wabbits. little bit. Silly wabbits. <laughs> she W's her R's once in a while. She does. Oh, yes. What, what, the Eternals. What, oh. what are the wings? Yeah. What are the wings? What are the wings? What are the wings? The power of the wing. The uh, wing of power. Wogan. Uh, Wogan for $50. <laughs> I thought you were saying Logan. I am. <laughs> Logan. Wogan or Woke Hogan? <laughs> Logan. Well, 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 well. Hail to the fellowship and honk, honk to Ryan. 
<laughs> Come on. <laughs> the extra girl was going. She was yeah, going. She waiting was. for it. Yeah. Uh, oh, man, I lost my place now. You guys are a relief from this crazy world and have made my Fridays my favorite day. Oh, that's. Did, did, did he say Hong Kong for Ryan? Because that. Uh, yeah. That news report that was going around. That's like Hong Kong is actually short for something else. Racist. Yes. He. Uh, oh, yeah. I, absolutely. Probably. Did. Yes. I appreciate that super chat even more than. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> we are in the we are in the upside down now but at least we have the fellowship indeed we have each other yep, yep. Uh, star trekker 58 on the streamlab side for 50 dollars says hail gary and the fnt team keep up the good work calling out disney ripoff hotel and amazon anything but the lord of the rings terrible uh floods here in uh southeast queensland australia Oh, shit. I uh, wow. hope everyone keeps safe wherever they are. You keep me sane. You stay safe down you there. You just put that mask on. You'll be fine. <laughs> just don't get, don't get COVID. Uh, Gary, did you see I posted in the um, in the FNT Twitter room? There's uh, an employee that's justifying the price of the hotel. Oh, I oh, heard man. about oh, that. God. Yeah, yeah. Can we? Here, I'll, I'll give you the link. I'll get it. You got it? Okay. Thanks, boys. At you like oh, the, the thing is there does have to be like there's probably a lot of cost associated with just staffing it yeah because since it's since it's a hunt like it's 48 straight hours so you have there's probably many more employees per person than you would normally have in this thing with all the inter- like entertainment and bullshit and it still sucks yeah i Correct. think star wars is lame now they, like star wars used to be cool utterly like one of the fucking coolest things ever made. Uh, and it is just, it, like I said this before, but like you deserve the wedgie and the swirly you're going to get for being a Star- Disney Star Wars fan now. Uh, Could yeah. this woman be dressed any more is fucking this? blandly? Who is this? It's dude? Wendy. This is a man. Yeah, wear a fucking push up bra so we can tell you. First of all, so, so bad. First of all, for homely guys, women, man, they always they leave get the bad Wendy's now. tits alone. Yeah, uh, you guys got to do mind. something with them. I think do you asked me a little bit respectful. Uh, she's wow. uh, going for the ultimate warrior look, and she's doing a good job. So. <laughs> she just like the ultimate gas station look attendant. Look at that. <laughs> Wendy, <laughs> help that gas, Wendy. Wendy we're we're going to press unleaded. play. We're going to press play. It's going to be like, we really think the star. <laughs> <laughs> it is, ma'am. Yeah. I think, you know... I think the depth of storytelling, the amount of play, the amount of engagement that a, that a person is going to experience, I don't think you're going to question the cost. I actually think you're just going to have a lot Says of fun. rich people. And you're going to have yeah, a what the deep fuck? experience with your, with your passengers, with your fellow passengers that is unlike anything else in the world. Yeah, okay. And, you know, Disney creates a lot of experiences at a lot of different price points for people. And this, this might not be for everybody to choose. And that's okay. But I really hope people think, more about the experience that they're going to have. Fuck off, poor people. Um, yeah, she's like yeah. a scum sucking lawyer from Jurassic Park. Hey, that's a chick from the deleted like video. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait, wait, what's her name? It's uh, going to no, it's, the theater. As you said, you were surprised by the amount of and, story. And Morrow, and Morrow, and Morrow, and Morrow, I think. Of immersive yeah, because the guy's like, hey, girl. <laughs> that's also a cruise experience. That is also a way to live your Star Wars story. And so I'm not sure that it can be compared to anything that we've seen in the past. Except for like. You know, except for like the Star Trek experience. I mean, it's it, not a hotel, but the it, Star Trek experience, which was like a hundred bucks when you did the 4D one, and it was fucking brilliant. It was absolutely brilliant. And this looks like shit. You don't want to know why the Star Trek one like was God. brilliant? Because it looked like fucking Star Trek. You can go down to Quark's bar. You can get a Cardassian cooler. You can mm. uh, the board come out and get you. It's fucking cool. The the problem, and again, <clears throat> I understand the price point is a huge thing for a lot of people, but that's not the problem here. It's because you have hijacked Star Wars and you've tried to sell an experience based on Star Wars for this money, and it's not Star Wars. It's not Star Wars. Like you said it earlier, dude. Something you don't understand. 6,000 bucks. Give me fucking Han Solo, Luke Skywalker. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. You know? Yeah. Uh, it's and like, you get yeah, it, Ray it, yeah. and Ben Milo <laughs> Solo. It, it's just unbelievable. And, <laughs> it's a terrible dance, dancing, sword fight. swinging Twilek and yeah. Ray, line and, dancing. Ray and Benjamin Solo and space fucking bingo and space line dancing. Jeez. 
Okay, it you gotta make, like, make it fucking edgy. Make Ray and Ben fuck during this Galactic Star. <laughs> yeah. 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 I would pay to see that. It's a meter over I, the balcony. I, I, for, for, for years and years and years, you know, theme parks, Disney Universal, their prices have been criticized, you know, because, uh, you know, you hear that price from, from, you know, a person that doesn't go consistently or what that price is based on the market and people will pay it. And that's fine. I have no problem with that. This is about you have destroyed Star Wars in so many people's eyes and you're asking for that price point. Yet it doesn't represent anything that George Lucas created. That's the fucking problem. Mm -hmm. That's the biggest problem here. The price is uh, that's all whatever. If if you think the price, you know, people are going to pay a price if they want to. But Star Wars fans are looking at this going, number one, you're asking me for six grand. Number two, you're not even selling me Star Wars. Mm. That's the problem. Yeah. You know, <clears throat> yeah, and they don't think it's going to matter. That's that's their arrogance is they don't think it's going to matter. And I don't I don't know if it will, Gary. <clears throat> I, I don't know if it huh. will. I think that when you look at this, this fucking garbage they're putting out on Disney Plus, when you look at the fact that Samba TV, which is I know a lot of people are like, oh, I can't believe the ratings. Samba TV has nothing to do with like Disney or, or Nielsen or anything like that. Um, Samba TV reported that Boba Fett finale. 36 percent more people watched it in the first five days than the mando two season finale yeah and i the bet one you where really? Luke skywalker wow. went fucking viral and that's all so, well that's all based on the previous episode too because now mm, we don't have mm. the data from an episode <laughs> following that but i guarantee you that fucking finale pissed off uh 75 of that 36 percent that was more uh, uh you know Plus yeah. 30, 30, 300 percent plus 25 percent equals four. <laughs> I don't know. But like, yeah. you're Preach, right. You're God. right. Preach. Luke Skywalker. They ultimately, wanted to see ultimately. Luke Skywalker. They were expecting to see Luke Skywalker in that finale. And they did. You, like, everybody was pissed because of that. Well, we they got know, a droid dropping right. off a child. <clears throat> you're right. There's a, there's a lot of just normie consumers out there who just like. Yeah, well, yeah. What we yeah. know is that is that the sequel trilogy lost 50 percent of its audience. That's what we know. That happened. That happened. Now, a lot of people, myself included, felt like Rise of Skywalker was still going to make Last Jedi money because it's Star Wars and you've got the Disney marketing machine behind it. But they 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 hurt that so bad that they lost 50 percent of their audience and barely, barely made a billion bucks yep. uh, on that movie. And again, in isolation, a movie making a billion dollars is a lot when it started out making two billion. Yeah, it's a decline. And yeah. you see how the Avengers Endgame finished off, regardless of how you feel about that movie, <laughs> that they did that the right way. They finished off that, you know, that entire phase the right way. But I don't know. I mean, it's weird. It's weird because it's weird. Uh, it's weird. It, it's with with <laughs> it's weird. with uh, with Galaxy's Edge. That's a different thing because you've got the toy. You've got it, it in Orlando. You've got Toy Story Land, which I think is pretty decent. It's not the greatest thing ever. It's fine. It gets, you know, it, it is what it is. And so you've got constant people just flowing into this park for different various amount of reasons. So even if the Galaxy's Edge isn't the greatest thing ever, you've constantly got people flowing through that park. So you're always going to have, you know, a steady line of people there. This is $6,000 for two nights or 5000 or whatever <laughs> it is. I That's just don't so see crazy. the value. I just That's don't see the value. Insane. Do you think there's Some enough Wars Disney movie? heads out there? Because I, I know some people that are hardcore Disney people, like insane, have every yeah. every little piece of merch that will I, go to shit like this. I, 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 I think, you think there's I, enough of those people? I, 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 I look at something. The, the, the way well, yes, I can look at something correct. like ba a, a bad product for different amount of reasons is a bad product so like I, I bring nintendo into this because people say like oh nintendo fans will eat anything up and, and they will typically unless you don't do a good job of marketing or whatever the wii u failed <clears throat> miserably miserably and they bounce back with the switch but nintendo fans are known to eat stuff up same with disney fans they'll eat stuff mm -hmm. up but i mean they didn't go see what was that what was that movie with taylor kitsch uh John Carter. They didn't go see John, John Carter. Carter remember that? that was a that was a marketing thing as well. Marketing thing. A good movie. You know what I mean? So I and good again, movie. I thought the Wii U was a good system, but the marketing was bad. And so for, for various amount of reasons. So I think the marketing is bad for this. Very, very bad. And then the reality is, is when parents or fans see this, they go, okay, well, Star Wars. Okay, what are you giving me? You giving me Ray and Kylo Ren? Okay, well, we already rejected that. 50% of your audience rejected Ray and Kylo Ren. So why are you focusing on that? So I think that this runs a, a risk of potentially being a big, big loss for Disney. I hope it is, but time will tell because I know how that theme park audience is. And mm -hmm. that's, it's a massive 
audience they have. How can something so cheap be a loss, though? I mean, it looks good. It's only yeah, six looks... thousand for yeah. why are they? Um, <laughs> why are they gunning with Kylo and Ray anyway? Why not use things that everyone actually likes? Yeah, totally. because they yeah. own them. That's why Luke Skywalker. Because when they set this entire thing up, the land and the hotel, they wanted it to be set. They, they put it set between the Last Jedi and the Rise of Skywalker. They made up a planet called Batu, and they connected a bunch of, uh, you know, comic books and novels and all this shit referencing this random place, Batu. And this Star Cruiser, it visits Batu during this time period, and mm -hmm. they've also written a bunch of shit from across mm -hmm. between the High Republic, <clears throat> Clone Wars era, with Anakin and Padme being on board it, original trilogy characters with Han and Leia being spending their honeymoon on it. They're trying to connect all this shit to stuff of the past, but also put it in this little sliver of time and space. I'm and so that's why. Solo. If I had my honeymoon here, fucking hell. Oh, I blame the... all this on Pablo Hidalgo. This is all his <laughs> idea. I can feel it. I can feel that all this shit's his idea. And he's so. like, I'm the guy from the from the original Lucasfilm, and I, it's my ideas, and we got to get all these little things in here. They never listened to me before. Now they will. I I'll, I'll, pay, I, I, I'll, I'll, I'll put it out there publicly right now. I'll pay for Mahler to go if he'll do an unbridled rage about it. <laughs> of a place? That would be good. That would be totally good. Hey, that's brand new content. Mahler, pay for fucking Ryan to go. Jesus Christ. <laughs> he wants fucking fast food people's families dead because of Did fucking you bread. You'll be much more entertained by his reactions. All <laughs> <laughs> time. Well, we get them together, comedy duo, uh, like buddy cop. Yeah, the straight man and Ryan. Maul is like, I'm too old for this shit. And Ryan's like, I'm just like, this, is, this isn't very good. And he's like, fuck this. Like, yes, exactly. <laughs> I wish death upon you and your whole kin. Oh, oh my God. Like, Dang, There's man, no we... way I would be not kicked out of there. Like it. No. I wouldn't survive 48 hours at the Galactic Star Cruiser. Yeah. But I'm not that's trying to be That's what's going to make it entertaining. <laughs> but I'm legit not trying to be crass here, but... What if you go with your kids? Let's say your kids are mid-teens, for instance. Uh, do you all have to go in that fucking one room with the two bunk beds crammed yeah. to the side? Yes. yes. What yeah. if you, you know, the missus, you're like, we're going away, vacation, oh, no. spent $4,000 on this. That's, well, that's that's not what you do. Uh, that, that You wouldn't do that for this. <laughs> that's not what no. You don't fucking Star Wars. Yeah. Nobody fucks You don't have Star the Wars, sexy man. time in the Star Wars, okay? Well, you could book two. You the thing is, right, right. No, the, the reason why I said I'm not being crass is this has been sold as like a romantic trip between Padme and Anakin. This has been sold as where Han and Leia had their honeymoon. Mm. So it's like for, fam for for you know, this is a uh, did Han and Leia fuck in this bed? Is this the bed they fucked yeah. in? And made I'm yeah. getting a fucking I'm getting two marriages out. that ended in, in just the best way. <laughs> this is you know? this was the bed where you know Leia realized that Han doesn't go down. Oh. That's, wow. <laughs> That's horrible. History was made. You earned that one, buddy. You really did. This <laughs> night, did Han, tonight you're gonna be Working fucking solo. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in That's why he earned his name. Oh, Mikey Gus. Been that way my whole life, sister. Uh, <laughs> Mikey Man. Gessler for fifty dollars. <laughs> Mikey. 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 Hey, uh, Mikey. Mikey. I sent you an email. I'm sure you responded, and Mrs. Oh. Nerdronic responded back because we're gonna send you some stuff. Uh, the Hell reason, yeah! Ooh, the, nude photos. Well, yeah, baby. <laughs> dick pics. You know. uh, the reason why I'm not excited oh. for the Batman is it was supposed to be Ben Affleck's film. But with how WB and Jeff Johns drove Ben off the film and Reeves not liking his script because it is tied to the DC universe, I won't want to give these people money. And that is your prerogative, Mikey. And we respect yeah, that. Yeah, totally. Yep. yep. <clears throat> yeah. We respect that here. Yep. I'm going to check it out. Uh, I already got my tickets for the Check seconds. it out. Check it out. I think it's coming out. out. There's two preview him. nights. Ah! So, Ryan, you said you uh, signed up for a free showing on on the first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So it's a Tuesday, I think. Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. seeing it. That, I'm seeing it the day after you, Wednesday. Yeah, I'm seeing it on Wednesday. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna, that's when you hope fourth? it's great. Yep. That's yeah. I'm gonna on the, on the can kill you. That, that can be bad if it, if any Lord of the Rings. <laughs> if it's it can be terrible. Really bad. You're like, oh my god. Yeah, that's I'm true. seeing on I'm seeing it on Tuesday the eighth. 
Uh, yeah, oh, are you guys getting I, we'll a see how later? it is. I, I don't I don't think it's gonna be fucking you know incredible or crazy good or anything, but we'll see. I think it looks. I pretty much thought it looks pretty good from the beginning, and like the way it was marketed, the way like they talked about it with Detective Batman and that yeah. stuff, like getting into that. I'd, I'd fucking dig that. Thought, it's got a David Fincher esque feel. Like I fucking love David Fincher movies, and especially yeah. like yeah. especially yeah. Seven, but, and that looks like Seven all up and down. So and Zodiac, like, and, I'm, I'm, and Zodiac, and I'm, yes, and I'm. I love that shit, but what uh, here's what I don't like about it is if you're gonna do that, if you're gonna do that type of character, why are you using Riddler for this? Yeah, you know, like why don't why don't you use if you want to do like a serial killer feel, why don't you go with Victor Zaz? So yes, if you want yeah. if you yeah. wanted to do uh, more of a react thing, well, you know, yeah, yeah, sure, yeah, or crazy, create a new character. How what? weird would that be mm. uh, if they actually created a new character as a villain? I don't um, want any. I don't want them creating uh, anything new in Hollywood. <laughs> but at the same time, but I don't, right, I would, no, 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 no. Like I mean, blue I mean, within, killer. I mean, within, I mean, within an established <laughs> universe like this is what I'm saying. I, I, w- I would rather them create something new in this universe than take something and bastardize it to be what they want it to be. Like, yeah, why are you this, taking this, the Riddler and doing, you know what I mean? Yeah, I you we'll have to see the movie. I, I think we don't know what the story is, but to me, this is setting up perfectly for Hush. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. That's yeah, what it seems to be for for me, if because the you know the Riddler would would be a pawn of ultimately a pawn of Hush, mm-hmm. uh, <laughs> and and with the like I don't know if it's clever editing, you know, because editing can be clever, but it hmm. if if the Riddler actually does know that Bruce Wayne is Batman and that connection there, then you know I, the, just the whole thing that's been underlying to me it just to me I just get this feeling that Hush is involved. Has he been around? Uh, does Hush come in in year one? Like this is year that, two. no, but but this Hush is it seems it, so early to introduce. It that does seem really early. Tommy, to Tommy comes. Yeah, I mean Tommy comes. Yeah, I mean Tommy comes in in the when Hush when they made Hush, they put Tommy Elliot early in this in Batman's story. So he he was he was essentially around when um, there was still Bruce Wayne's uncle uh, there. Uh, so, yeah, then, 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 then okay. Yeah. Hey, that's the head hunt, is the head hunter, whatever it is. Um, but yeah, Ooh. I just the way that this is all put together, I yeah. just I just kind of get this feeling like said, there's a court of owls kind of hush fine. It's early for it. court of owls, too, because the whole thing that court of owls was it, it was playing on the fact that Batman knew Gotham like up and down, he knew Gotham, and that's why it fucked with his head because there was this whole element under Gotham that he didn't know yes. about. Mm-hmm. So it would yeah. be it would be an interesting way Who to watch the bring him in sort of thing. Mm-hmm. Right. Yeah. To bring him in in like Batman year two. It's a little early. So yeah, we'll see. I think it, it's I'm intrigued enough yeah. to be kind of excited to go watch it and figure out is it going to yeah. be good? Because you know, is it going I, to play now? I've and heard I'm, that the Riddlers the sorry, not the Riddlers, the I've heard that the penguin story wraps up within the first sort of hour of the film. And they're doing a penguin show. Did uh, you hear that? Apparently so. I think That's everything is I think it's in talks. Everything no, is the, dependent the, the, upon the how they said it on on the red carpet. Yeah. Everything that they're doing attached to this from oh, what course. like Reeves said is very dependent on how the film does. If it performs well, if it's received course, well, yeah. then we'll get the fucking Gotham TV show, the fucking Penguin TV show, and all that. But stuff. just yeah. get, we don't want a Batman. We don't want a fucking Penguin show. We don't want a fucking no. Gordon show. Oh, we want a yep. fucking Batman show with that would be nice. Batman. Well, I okay. think they just don't. They you. don't we'll think of Batman. Batman. <laughs> what about Batgirl? Yeah. No, yeah, I know it makes no yeah. sense that we've gotten what we've gotten. Uh, a Batgirl show, a Batwoman show, a show <laughs> about Alfred, and and yeah, but in the last Batman show we had was sixty six oh fucking uh, Batman. It's crazy. We got a Jim Gordon show. We got a like, awesome. dude. Yeah, a Batman show would be a massive hit, a massive hit. It would be the thing to watch on HBO Max. It would get ten million views a fucking week if they did it right. I just I don't think they so think was- Batman is. They think Batman is too. High, you know, too to high be a TV show. To be He's TV a detective, which I, I think is wrong because TV is right. I mean, it used to be fucking awesome. You know, during Game of Thrones times, it was like TV was where it fucking was. It, so I don't think if it's, you can make it multiple slow slow super how many shows? Superman yeah. shows has yeah. there been, and you're telling me they can't do a fucking Batman? Right? Yeah, yeah. it, it well, still yeah. is the it's it's still the best way to tell a long form story it like is. that. And I That's think right. that a detective a ten season or a ten episode. You know, Batman that is based on that and like yep. slowly putting together the pieces and you know mm, taking yeah. out kind of small time, you know, crime mm. people 
stuff like that and leading up to a big bad, I think would be perfect. Yeah. So. Well, it's going to give us something to talk about. So we'll see how it goes. Yeah. But I'm looking forward to it. And it seems like most people are looking forward and to it. And you know what we're not talking about? Except the chat. The woke <laughs> bullshit. It doesn't yep. seem like it has that much. It could be. I mean, other than be. the two clear race swaps. But. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, uh, but we're yeah. talking I mean, about like the story and what could be and what we would like to see. Yeah. That's what I fucking like right. to hear. I like yeah. to hear shit exactly. Like uh, yep. Sean S for one hundred dollars. Wow, 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 wow! I am humbled as a man in the United States of America. As Ben Shapiro said, we are born on third base and think we hit a triple. We are lucky as hell. Twenty-three year old Ukrainian blew up a bridge to stop a tank advance. He was still on it. Let's be thankful. Whoa. Hail wow. Friday Night Tights, Ryan. We thank should. you for your service. Yeah, uh, oh, damn. You're very welcome. Yeah, we we need to be. That's been one of my things, and, and you guys have all brought it up too, is like the lack of gratitude amongst uh, a lot of people in this country, and they have no fucking idea what real strife so is. True. Some people do, but a lot of people don't. Uh, we they don't. We, yeah, we live in a very comfortable nation, uh, very affluent society. We don't have to dig a hole to get water. We don't have to dig a hole to take a shit. You know, like it, it, we, I mean, you know. can if you want to. Sure. Yeah. But that's yeah. Where you're yeah. about this America. country. Freedom. Or you could just shit it's, on the sidewalk. Just imagine uh, a scenario where you go to bed and you wake up at 2 a.m. because of air raid sirens. Yeah, no uh, shit. Because yeah. people are dropping bombs in your city. Like yeah. the, the, sending your wife and your kids away while to you a different stay country while up, you stay. And, and pick up an automatic weapon that the government's issuing you telling you That's to stay shit. here and die. Yep. All I can say is I am so grateful that CNN filmed their footage beforehand. And just pretended that it happened. Yeah. And yeah. then they could just leave and they, they wouldn't be affected by the actual bombings that would be going on. Oh. Fucking um, CNN. Imagine yep. if another country, uh, well, you might like this news. We'll use Mexico. Imagine if another country just replaces the leader of Mexico. Just comes in, replaces the leader of Mexico, puts in that, that uh, puppet. Like uh, the CCP puts in a puppet in Mexico. How would we like it? How would we like it? So yeah, we got to stop yeah. messing around in the world. That's all. That's all. That's I'm right. yeah. We need Agreed. to stop messing yeah. around. Yeah. Yeah. Now I can country, tell you if that happened, I don't think it'd really be too much of Europe's problem. No, uh, but a country no, getting wouldn't. invaded has every right to defend itself, of course. And Ima I, yeah. I, I, imagine, imagine living in a country where they don't get your breadsticks right, and how <laughs> terrible that would make your day. And the, uh, <laughs> the Ukraine. The Ukraine. I, don't, I don't wanna. I don't wanna. I, don't I wanna can tell you, you could have put a gun in my hand. I could have done some <laughs> fucking damage. That. Wow. <laughs> Whoa, Whoa, buddy. It's a battle. Send me to Ukraine. Did you see? Uh, oh, everybody saw the the chads from the island that told the yeah. Russian vessel Snake to go island. fuck itself. Yeah, oh, the damn. Russian warship that was saying, "Hey, just put your weapons down and surrender." And they're like, "Or we will." Russian fire. warship, go fuck go yourself. Fuck yourself. And they all died, but they, it was crazy, man. Yeah. Badass. Yeah, they are. I, I can't. Well, I just saw the thing underneath it, which says, uh, "Live free or die." Yep. 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 Yep, yep, Give yep, them yep. a death worth remembering. Yeah. You know? Uh, Wit Grebitus for $50. Says, Hail Friday Night Tights. Question for the Longoid. That's you, long man. Uh, Any yeah. chance that EFAP will review Reacher? Oh, um, I mean, if it, they'll have to force it on us like Arcane, basically. If everybody starts telling me to watch it, I probably will. But I've, I've not really got too much of an interest just yet. Uh, you guys were saying it was pretty good, right? It's pretty good. I, I think it's a solid. I, I don't know. Solid. I don't think it's very like solid. arcane level, but I think it's really solid. It kind of, it, it kind of harkens back or harkens back to some '90s action movies a little bit. Just kind of uh, a simple story, some good action, and not a bunch of woke garbage. Yeah. So. And it's not like fucking Tomorrow War. Where it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> no, it's, got, it has, it's, it's got some ass and titties in it. Yeah, and, and leave tomorrow and it's, it's war alone. Story. And, and yeah, it, tomorrow war alone. Tomorrow war is so great. It, it, one of the tomorrow war is tomorrow war alone. <laughs> one of the things that I really liked about it was because I've read the books. Well, some of the books, but specifically <laughs> the Killing Floor, which this is an adapt. This is a one season adaptation of the book, and uh, I think it follows it fairly well. So I liked it. All yeah. Right. 
Yeah, you wish Amazon Amazon would have done that yeah. with Lord of the Rings. Uh, the common nerd for fifty dollars. I like to put Amazon. <laughs> in my Amazon. 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 It's like it's Amazon, 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 but just more. Amazon. I'm running. Gary said a stroke, and we're making fun of him. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Uh, <laughs> Uh, I, smell bread, I smell bread, but I smell toast. What is that? Are those pennies? I yeah, smell like... 15 breadsticks. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, no. Well, I get upset That's when 12. I don't. So. Uh, <laughs> comics division. I may be taller than you, but only because I'm half. Love you, brother. I love that I have three of you in Texas now. Can't wait for uh, the San Antonio meetup. Cheap shill for subscribers, of course. Uh, we are Hydra. Cut us down, and we or more of us shall come. The common, yeah, check out the common nerd. Check out his channel. I like that name. Absolutely, it's okay to shill. It's okay to shill for your channel. There's nothing wrong with that. Uh, I need to. Thanks do that for more. a good super chat. <laughs> it did. Uh, oh, what did it say here? What? I thought you, no, you wanna... said it's okay to shill for your channel. And I went, no. yeah, as long as you put a good super chat in. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't want you guys shilling for your channels. Yeah. Uh, you can shill for your... If I catch it, I'll shill. It's fine. Uh, Alpha Suma for $50. Uh, for Ryan's passive aggressive breadstick payback. Was that passive? What? Yeah, I, kind of I think that was fully I think that was very forward, I would say. <laughs> I, I think that that. When I was speaking to the guy, and I think I was pretty passive aggressive. I oh, in the in, in the, the store, store. When you yeah, picked it up, yeah, when yes, you, yeah, yes, yeah, in yes, store, when you picked it up, very definition yeah. of passive aggressive. Uh, yeah. Good luck getting but, your food. Uh, <laughs> Caligula for fifty dollars. One of my favorite names out there, Caligula. Uh, you guys, good man as well. I've had a lot of funny episodes, but this is the first one where people came to check on me. I can't even chat properly. I'm Aww. fucking dying. All the time. <laughs> yeah. Having a good time. Hell yeah. That is that is what we like to hear. Yep. That's uh, uh, Marksman for ten dollars for. Ten dollars super chats. Love Marksman. Marksman's awesome, by the way. Talked to him quite a yes. bit. Smart um, dude. The members chat. Yeah, really good dude. Really good dude. Passionate guy. Like, yeah. Loves good storytelling. Uh, he does. Uh, this is one of four. A preview from now begins the tangerine. Tom, uh, we are almost done here. Quick, long man. Throw the tangerine into the sacred blender, long man. And it's, I guess it's a story here. So two of four. Oh, uh, Mahler. And you're saying this. I didn't notice how this tangerine is in a perfect circle and how unnaturally soft yet firm it is. It feels oh. like the world's most perfect <laughs> breast. But oh, must we really cast it that way? Think about it. Think about your powers, Tom. Unbreaded. Peeping Tom, by the way. Peeping. I am. I always think about my power. Yes. Longman, put down so that tangerine. I, that I can see right now. Put it down now. Mahler lifts his head and his huh. eyes filled with an unnatural orange glow. Mahler, no. I don't think I will. <laughs> Tom, Longman, no. <laughs> then he says, will Tom be able to save his friend from the corrupt corruptive influence of the tangerine. Will they be able oh. to finally destroy the mystic tangerine? Find out <laughs> in the tales of disbelief. Now begins the tangerine. The tangerine. Oh, man. Everyone's oh, really my God. That <laughs> you thought it was a I breast. thought you were going to call it the tangerine dream at the end. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. I think that's the next dude. one. That's what it's called. Will Some you save the me? Best soundtrack. I don't know, dude. I'm tangerine. Too busy tangerine staring dream. At um, risky business, fucking mm. on the train. That sound, that that the music for that is great. Oh, it's so good. Love Tangerine. Risky business, great film. Yep, yes, it is. Um, Russian, uh, Kivo for fifty dollars. Uh, Russian warship. We are Russian warship. Save your soldiers from bloodshed and lay down your weapons. Ukrainian battalion. Russian warship. Go fuck yourself. No matter what side you're on, that's respectable. Hail Friday Night Tights. Uh, hail the Lord of the Long. That's you, Mahler. Well, no. I got a little something to play here. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> it's Jeremy. It's Jeremy. 
think I know who the next one is. <laughs> Bread sticks. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Oh, is that you, Ryan? Oh, it's so <laughs> <I'm nervous>. so. <laughs> oh man. I'm retarded. Uh, something for normies. For breakfast. Touchdown on paper. Wait, I'm <laughs> bread. 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 I was literally unbreaded. God damn. Uh, unbreaded. Something for normies for forty nine ninety nine. <laughs> Just hey, on Friday Night Tides. Love you guys. Have a great weekend. Let's go, Brandon. Let's go, Brandon. Let's, Let's always go. Love go, Brandon. Eric Bailey for fifty dollars. In a past life, I was a multicultural blue elf of Middle Earth. My Ebonics courses gave rise to the Numenorean Krangs, or Kangs, sorry, Kangs, I it. And they gave me 22 brothels. My diverse working ladies birthed Atlantis, then troll named Brandon blew it up with a devastating fart. Oh. Hey. Okay. Wolverine snicked. I tried to make that my license plate in California. Couldn't get it. Snicked, and every variation was taken, but I did get Thwip from Spider-Man. Uh, and I'm almost sorry. Thwip. I got to give it up. Yeah, Thwip. You know when he shoots Damn. his whip. Thwip. You can always try and get one here. Uh, oh, I will. You oh, can I try will. Snicked again. I'm going. Yeah. I'm going. Snick. Well, you can't do, I, I don't know. I mean, personalized license plates are a bit douchey, except if they're comic book sound effects. Uh, Wolverine Snicked for $50. FNT rocks, as well as the fellowship. We will win the war of true fandom. Cheers, motherfuckers. I love that. Mm -hmm. Motherfuckers. Motherfuckers. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. Jeremy's license plates GNG. Is it? Oh, you can't do Nerd Rock. Oh, go on. I, I tried to tell him it was douchey. He said, I know. That's why I did it. Yeah. <laughs> if I could fit Nerdrotic on a license plate, I would. But I can't. Ooh. We can find a way. Yeah. yeah You'd have to misspell it. it. You'd have I'm to like N R D. Yeah. yeah. Nerd. Nerd. Or do Nerd R T C. Ritic? Uh, I don't know. Uh, the Common Nerd for forty nine ninety nine. Thank you. I got my tax return back this week, too. Mm. If you're getting God. money back, you're paying too oh, much. Oh, my God. That was my dad's mantra. My dad was an accountant. So he always what said, did he oh, say? Oh, if you get a big tax return, people are always bragging about getting a big tax return. And he's like, you're fucking paying too much. Don't oh, man. do that. I always get a big one. Yeah. No, you're supposed to like you know, <laughs> owe 100 bucks, get 100 bucks back. That's about what you should be doing. Damn. Otherwise, you're For giving the government. people that are bad with their money, it's yeah. not a terrible thing to get a bunch back. Uh, but God, I need to do my fucking tax. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Mine are being yeah. done right now. Uh, I, I know. Uh, yeah, I know. You know. I know. Y'all know. <laughs> <laughs> the common nerd for forty nine ninety nine again. Uh, I got my tax return. Love you all. Hail Friday Night Tights, and thank you. You are one of the highlights of my week. You've inspired me. Aww. All hail the chat. All hail the guests. You make me laugh so hard. The chat is always fun. The chat is one of the best parts of the show. Yeah, yeah definitely. We got a mm -hmm. copyright claim what, two weeks ago. Uh, I just kept it. I'm not going to, I didn't want to get rid of the chat. So just kept it up. Fuck it. Uh, fuck. Jor, Jorpenlope. Did I say that right? Jorpenlope. I almost Jorpenlope. 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 For uh, 100. <laughs> just make fun of his name. <laughs> 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 Because <laughs> I can get it wrong. That's my name. He's like, that's my name. Uh, Gary, since your <laughs> wife. My mom gave her that name. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'm all, I'm all doop doop doop. Uh, Gary, <laughs> since your wife is from Wisconsin, uh, would you ever do a meetup in the Badger State? Uh, yes. As a matter of fact, I will be spending summers up there. So, um, oh. uh, also, I uh, love you folks, and I'm a subscriber to all of your channels. You too, Mahler. Finally, Chrissy, do you uh, oh. do a show in Milwaukee, and I will get a group of loud Ooh. people to attend. All right, I'm writing. I'm writing it down. Milwaukee. I'm writing it down. Wisconsin. Wisconsin. I've 
If it's uh, if it's half as fun as Appleton, I'm there. Wisconsin's. Oh, uh, I cool. thought you were gonna say Kenosha. I, <laughs> dun, 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 dun. I went Bam. to a Packers Put game. Him. I saw Brett Favre. Uh, Favre. Favre as a Favre. Viking. As yeah, a Viking. As a Viking come to town, and it was oh, a hell yeah. fucking epic game. And I got you, you're, you're walking through, and they, they don't have like a parking lot. They just tailgate where the fuck, wherever the fuck they want. And they're always like passing you brats and beer. I didn't take the beers, but uh, no, I loved it there. I love Wisconsin. Cool place, good people. Uh, yeah. Jesus Devilla, uh, Devilla, Devilla, oh, yeah. okay. What's up, Jesus? Jesus. For Fifty dollars, Jesus. Hola, <laughs> uh, Thank you to everyone. I'm what the make... fuck was that, Gary? He said, he said something about a beer. <laughs> no, you're not from Cervezas. So- what? You're not from SoCal, so you won't understand. <laughs> you sounded like. Conan from WCW days. No, no, uh, no. I, I grew up around Spanish people and Mexican people. As remember, all my entire life. Uh, so being from San Diego, yeah, yeah I'm Conan, like, WCW. Uh, I'm an oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I, I've eaten so yeah. much Mexican food. I am practically a Mexican. Okay. Uh, <laughs> thank you to everyone on Friday Night Tights, the laughs, the gaffs, and uh, classically chained as. Have some huh. cheddar on me. Gracias. Oh. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Gracias. Gracias. Senor. Gracias. Gracias. Oh, you've already used up your fucking words, woman. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you laughed, whatever. Uh, it's worth it. <laughs> you laughed, whatever. Hail for the night tights, Adam and Mahler. Just, uh, just cause question for the panel. What is the oldest movie you have seen? Mine is top hat, a Fred Astaire, Ginger Rogers mm. comedy for 1935. I can speak for Ryan on this one. Birth of a nation is the first movie. he's ever seen. <laughs> <laughs> Every Sunday. Alexi for $20. Uh, Harold Lloyd shit and Buster Keaton Buster and all Keaton. that stuff. Yeah, yeah. That stuff's like, Mid teens, oh, yeah, yeah, totally. Metropolis, uh, Metropolis is 20s, I think, isn't it's it? 20, Metropolis, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So, I think, I think the silent movies of like Buster Keaton and Harold Lloyd and yep. stuff like that, um, came before then. They were, I love, I love them, love them, man. Watch a lot of Stooges, it does count, does they count? Um, as they're movies, old, right? yeah, they're old, yeah, they're they're old. Right. And yeah. Stuff. Laurel and Hardy, Hardy. Hardy. Yeah. yeah, yep. Uh, what was the other duo? Abbott and Costello. Abbott, Abbott Costello. Abbott and Costello yeah, they're versus, the shit. Versus uh, the monster Frankenstein. That yeah, that was. was. Yeah, I love the original Mummy. That that movie is great. Uh, Invisible Man. That's yep. a great one as yep. well. Oh, it's when he turn, excellent. He fucking takes off the top and he has no fucking head and you're like, how did they fucking do that <laughs> back then? Like, what? What, what was young Josiah said it, it last night? He said, I don't think they've ever done any proper werewolf movies. I'm all, bruh. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. Come on. Huh? I don't know. Wait, what did he bro. say that? Last night. Oh, Twitter. Yesterday. Yesterday. Twitter. He said yeah, I said American werewolf in London. Oh, and and werewolf and in Twilight. London. Twilight. Yeah. And, and Twilight. <laughs> Underworld. Or whatever it's called. Do you know, no uh, way. Chrissy, oh, I've shit. seen all of those movies in the theater. <gasps> wow. I'm sorry. I, I mean, I don't know. Mary. I, I, if you're gonna tell me about a werewolf movie, I don't know if, if people like this one or not. Silver Bullet, back in like the I like 80s. Silver Bullet. I love oh, Silver, yeah. Silver Bullet. Silver, Silver Bullet is fucking fantastic. Yeah. Teen love Wolf. That. The Howling. Teen Wolf. Come on. Teen Wolf, dude. Teen, teen yeah, Wolf Two. Jason Silver Bateman. Bullet. Teen, awesome. teen Wolf. <laughs> American <laughs> Werewolf. Werewolf. See, I did it again. Werewolf. 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 It's always Spanish. Monster, <laughs> Monster Squad? Monster Squad's cool. You know. Yeah, Scooby Doo? Better when you're Scooby really Doo. high on drugs, but, you know. Um, <laughs> so is there. Or a lot of movies like Pink Floyd the Wall. So. Uh, That's a good one. All right. Yeah, it is. Especially when you're really fucking high. Um, all right. We're Blade? But old movies. Yeah, Metropolis is probably the oldest one I've seen. It's a trip. That's a trippy movie, dude. I've seen a bunch seen, of silent it, movies, so yeah, mm. definitely. You seen Metropolis in 4K? Holy shit! No, I didn't know they did it in 4K. Hmm. I bet it looks uh, great on film. 
you know those 4k f- like films like movies on film that were shot on film look fantastic yes in 4k it's insane you're never Absolutely gonna get that quality insane. out of a they, out of a digital they did a uh, san francisco trolley car thing and converted it into 4k it's on youtube uh from the 1800s it's mm. uh, it looks so... they speed up the time so it's it's yep. yeah yeah yep. yep. yeah oh it's man crazy. it's a real good yeah it's crazy nosferatu it's a great one nosferatu i haven't Ooh, still, I, I don't think one. that oh what's the, oh what's the one Boom. isn't that not complete what's one's not complete <laughs> Oh, Phantom of the Opera is the one. The Lon Chaney is Phantom the of the Opera is the one. Oh, that's, that's not a complete. good one. That's, that's another remember. silent. I want to see you know, the one a, with the Joker in it. There was a Frankenstein that. What's the one with the Joker? The complete. Man Who Laughs? Is that one? The Man yeah, Who yeah, Laughs. Yeah, yeah, The Man yeah, Who Laughs. I need to see yeah. that. If it's that's complete. Lon Chaney too, right? That's Yeah, that's who the yeah. Joker is based off of. Yeah, man. That's some creepy shit. All right, let's let's wrap this up. It's time to go. We've been going for ever. Uh, and we thank everyone. Laughs and Mahler forever. <laughs> Mahler's all. <laughs> I was just getting warmed up. Hot one is complete. I thought yeah, we just like the introductions. Intro. Mahler's like, second win, let's go. Let's do this. <laughs> it's like that first Force Awakens video. <laughs> How long is that one again? Four? That was like three hours? I don't three even hours, know. Three hours, yeah. four hours? Yeah. A lot of people have been asking for another Force Awakens video. Those are good. It's be like I hated that movie when it came out, and I felt like I was alone. So I, I, I really like those videos because it picks apart fucking everything of that was wrong with that movie, and it was so there was so much. So, well, you know, Santa's been known to arrive at different parts of the year, right? <laughs> of course. Well, don't don't say it unless you mean it. Don't like, say Santa, like, Santa, Santa, Santa's coming during Indian summer. Uh, Santa Claus is coming on Ryan's fucking food. The next <laughs> time he <laughs> as long as he gets you, but he right, got man. it right. Oh, one of the added benefits of the Lord of the Rings thing it's it's woken people up to Jar Jar Abrams being a fucking fraud, and uh, that makes me happy too. That makes me very happy because he's fraud. Yes, yes. I, I didn't <laughs> realize Bill's still coming. Thought, Superman's still coming. I thought everybody home. knew that he put out that Batgirl's Instagram coming. post during the fucking riots, uh, saying no more white comfort. Wow. <laughs> what? Yeah. Fucking moron. Oh, yeah. yeah. I mean, it makes sense wow. yep. for J.J. Abrams. Yeah. Uh, let's go around the horn. We'll start with Comics Division. Hey, everybody. I'm Comics Division. Uh, you can catch me on Twitter and the YouTubes at Comics Division. Of course, you can find me over at Unsafe Space as well. And as always, Gary, thanks for having me. It was a great stream. It was cool hanging out with Adam as well as Mahler. Yeah. Um, Hello. Yeah. Have a great weekend, everyone. Take care. Take thanks, care, man. man. And yeah. we'll, uh, we'll see you in here next week, which will be cool as hell. Uh, Sounds good. Quarter Black Garrett. Yo. Yo. Uh, you can find me on my channel, Quarter Black Garrett. Uh, also, on Sunday, as X-Ray Girl and I are all going to play Dying Light 2. Ooh. So ah. catch us on oh, Sunday. We're gonna play. Nice. I know, right? Fucking nerd. So Had a fantastic night. It was funny as fuck in my upper cheeks. Are as sore as my lower cheeks. <laughs> hey, oh, big time. Uh, True. I just want to say, quarterback, thank you for your service, buddy. We appreciate it. Yeah, you. <laughs> you're, you're welcome. You're welcome. You know. I don't like to talk I, I, about it. I, but. I, I need to get a picture of Quarter Black, like just standing by the Vietnam wall, just, <laughs> just there. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Washington D.C. <laughs> that's where I want to see you. I'm gonna come back. I'll come back to Texas. And me and Quarter Black, we're gonna go. We're gonna hang out with Gary Comics. Yeah, uh, got to meet uh, Carrie. So that was cool too. That was right. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. So ah, you know. she's great. I love Carrie. Yeah, yeah it was great. Oh yeah, yeah, Carrie. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Uh, Ryan Kennel. Thanks for having me, guys. This is an awesome show. Uh, there's a lot of crazy shit going on in the world, but one thing you know will always happen is this show right here every single Friday. I would say at 4.30 Eastern, but we know we're never on time. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, I'm looking forward to getting home. That's what I'm looking forward I'm to. I'm looking so. forward to getting home safe. So just yeah, maybe skip the fast food, you know? Just go yeah. yeah, evidently. Well, what am I supposed to do? I'm fucking out... I mean, I guess I could go to an actual restaurant, but they fucked uh-huh. that shit up there too. Go, 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 <laughs> microwave, something, microwave something at a truck yeah, stop. Yeah, he was eating pizza during the stream. Yeah. Oh. Mm-hmm. I mean, I, I'll eat a frozen burrito at a truck stop. I don't give a shit. 
I, with my luck, the fucking microwave would be broken. Uh, <laughs> Mike, the microwave gets his order wrong. Uh, uh, Chrissy Mayer, who's got yes. some a very special announcement, right? I'm gay. Oh my god! Oh, that was wow. it. Beautiful. I have a shot. <laughs> Excellent. Are you telling me um, I have an album that is available for pre-sale right now. You can pre-order uh, live from January 6th from Amazon or iTunes. It drops March 15th. Uh, I think I probably will be coming to Texas uh, sometime in the next couple of weeks to do the whole uh, Blaze thing. And then uh, I'm going to be in Raleigh uh, March 17th and then Savannah, Georgia, March 19th, Tampa, Florida, March 20th. Um, yeah, and then Atlantic City, uh, April 22nd and 23rd. But yeah, if we could all pre order my album, don't you don't have to listen to it, just pre order it so that it hits number one for a day, and all the fucking woke comics will hate themselves. Please the chat right now, go pre order. Yay, yep, thanks for having me. This was so fun. I laughed a lot. Yeah, my cheeks hurt too. <laughs> Good. Good. No. <laughs> All right. Good. You're gonna be <laughs> sore, bitch. Yeah, crack my uh, my cheeks were clapped. That's, that's, Friday that's night. More like, yeah. More accurate than you know, Chris. You're right there. Right. So. Right. Uh, as I I can't talk. I can't either. I just want to go to bed. Yeah. <laughs> Subscribe to Hill versus Babyface. Yeah. Everybody. He's almost three hundred thousand. So Sunday. Quarter black, dying light, X ray girl. We're all streaming on our individual channels. So if you've got multi monitors, get us all up there. Uh, we've all been, well, I say we, Gary and I, demonetized. I got demonetized. We keep getting demonetized. So we're doing something right in the streams. Yeah. That's all I can say. I got a strike on my channel because of yeah, the what game. The hell, dude? Uh, I don't know. Wait, what? Dude, yeah, I got, strike. Strike. I got demonetized. We'll see uh, what Twitch has to say. This is yeah. this is this is this is how we run in the zombie yeah. world. That's how we go. And we're Quarter bringing Black got more strike. representation with us this week. Quarter Black got it. Yeah, they're doing that to protect themselves from YouTube. Yeah, I'm gonna, uh, we're just yeah. we're just gonna throw X-ray girl into the zombies and run. Quarter Black got a strike for like encouraging piracy or something. Yeah, that X-ray was the, girl. Have you gone through uh, the phrase. prologue? Have you yes. gone through the pro? Okay, good, good. We good. We good. Thanks. Yeah. We good. We good, fam. Thanks, Az. And uh, that'll be How fun. do you encourage piracy? What are you like? Yar, take a ship. No <laughs> clue. No clue at all. Uh, <laughs> yeah, and I hope it's that kind of piracy. I hope it's like a. Yeah, it's like you're encouraging modern day piracy. Like, like look, at yeah. <laughs> look at me. Look at me. Walk that plank. Jeremy. <laughs> Why are you gay? <laughs> Jeremy from <laughs> Geeks and Gamers. He's got G and G on his license plate. Okay. Apparently, at the kids' table. I really don't. I really yeah, he don't. doesn't. Uh, don't look true. it up and think you're no, fucking gonna own no, it. It's not. It's not gonna happen. Um, but no, tomorrow, Gaming with Geeks YouTube channel, the Gaming with Geeks podcast, will be back. Mark the Cyborg will be there. Disparu will be there. Uh, I can't remember who else is confirmed, but obviously the the normal crew will be there. We'll be talking a lot. I'm sure, Mark the Cyborg's got a lot to say. About a lot of different topics because we know how Mark is when he gets on a Geeks and Gamers live stream. He never shuts the fuck up. Uh, so, uh, and there's a lot of gaming to talk about, and I'm looking forward to it. So, tomorrow at 3 p.m. Central on the Gaming with Geeks channel. I know there's a lot of fucking channels to keep up with, but that's the one that I focus on for right now. So, and Ryan yells at me when I don't make videos for the other channels, so I have to make those too. So. <laughs> Correct. Ryan yells yeah. at everybody. So, but yeah it was an awesome friday night tights awesome trip to dallas uh not as awesome as it could have been but then garrett Aww. showed up and he gives good hand jobs so <laughs> maybe that's right <laughs> i got a lot of practice on stuff they're gonna have you back right <laughs> you are here they rescheduled uh, I, I, I don't know they'd have to they'd have to reach back out they and should. Ask, I suppose. they should i think they yeah I think they should. Ma ma maybe they can share right. a fucking private message with us considering they canceled the fucking show they could do that that would be nice of them. so <laughs> um but no i they haven't said anything to us so we got a, an email while we we're sitting in the lobby Oh Thanks. man! Like, fucking here, you know. <laughs> um, yeah, damn. Yeah. Look at how many like, how many uh, fast food restaurants yeah. do I have to fucking suffer through? Uh, <laughs> as you can see, their communication uh, is just as bad as ours. So yes, it's great to see. Yes. 
Uh, but no, it was cool, and, and it was really cool. Uh, Sarah Gonzalez is great. Yes. Uh, the Blaze people were great, in, in all honesty. It was cool. It was a great trip and everything like that. And so, yeah, I mean, they've already told us they wanted us back, um, you know, on a, for a couple of different shows there. And they got a lot of cool things going on, so it was cool. So Dallas, just man the fuck up and learn how to drive. Ooh, like, really? Can we go on? Buy a plow. It's, you know? Yeah. So, I mean, really, it's just some ice. It's okay. A lot of dudes with trucks that couldn't figure out how to get to work in Dallas. Wow. Right? <laughs> Always blocking the fucking parking spots, but whenever it gets a little rainy outside, <laughs> oh, I'm going to drive with my blinkers on. The five Ford, miles the, an Ford hour. F, the stock <laughs> four F 150. Is that what they had? You know? Yeah, with the dualies. <laughs> yeah. Fucking god dang it. Yeah, you got yeah. Like I mean, my I'm just Couldn't yeah, mine's two, mine's tires. two wheel drive. I, I, I there's a bunch of dudes in Texas with these jacked up fucking four wheel drives. You know, walking rum, 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 rum. literally with their sit, blinkers on on the highway, sitting, in, sitting oh, at home in the corner crying with everybody else with their fucking masks on because there's a little bit of uh, fucking ice on the road. There's ice on the road. Oh. I could Jeez. flip. Damn. Like, again, to to be clear, what, when the city was shut down, Ryan and I, we like we're heading out. I'm just driving. It was it was time was it, about five six that we nine, went to five? best buy we went to in and out we went to like everywhere while the fucking city was shut down because of fucking pussies like stupid wow. <laughs> were you cosplaying the lockdown we did see a lot of wrecks we did there see a lot, lot of wrecks there was a lot of wrecks a yeah. lot not us around that's what happens us. dude whenever it rains in dallas yeah i mean there were a, there was a lot I was like, "Holy fuck!" And well, then it's because there was, everyone it, in Dallas drives like ninety miles an hour, bumper yeah, to bumper. There was like detour. There was detours and shit, you know. And we were like, "Holy crap!" You know. So it's California. Dallas is stupid. Dallas is yep. <laughs> Californians drive like shit in the rain. They really do. They're not. So, they're they're crazy on the freeways, but uh, <laughs> this is how we started the day. The right? conversation when uh, all everybody talking about drivers and Jerry being like, "Drivers suck everywhere," and now we're fucking full circle. Uh, they do. Uh, Mahler. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. It's funny you say like, oh, so many shows keep track. I was like, so EFAP today, in like, you know, fucking 14 hours or so, yeah. we're actually um finally covering a video talking about how Arcane is bad. Gonna check out the Ooh. arguments, see how it goes, you know, get that balance in there. Um, and then the following day, I think I'm doing um, a catch up stream with Drinker. So you literally can't, like, it takes five seconds without someone's show running at this point, which is great. It is. Same at all time. Ex escapism distraction um and okay. yeah i haven't really you know i'm not i'm not looking to i, I i'm not going to promote anything except my own tweet here which i think is a banger okay i, wanna, I, I think you'll is all really like Hassan it. one i don't know what you mean as because <laughs> <laughs> you want to put that tweet. up garrett yeah i'm pulling it up right Thanks, now. buddy oh that's yeah. good. I don't that elden ring it. you know <laughs> and I found Hassan in the game. Oh I my god! This one. Yeah. Damn. Oh man. Oh. When I picked it up, I was like, "Man, that really does define him, doesn't it?" <laughs> yeah, <really. Yes. laughs> retweet Absolutely that perfect. Yeah. yeah. I'll retweet it later. That's good stuff. Good stuff. Elden yeah. Ring is pretty good. I've played it. It's pretty good. I'm not a never been a big Dark Souls player, but I'm I'm enjoying it. So that was a good meme right there. So gotta get hope so I can pick up my fucking pre order. Yeah. To play it. <laughs> I killed a boss opening today. week. Uh, I want to kill bosses too. And I, yeah. I was I was I, I saw a little bit of your streaming Mola. A little, a little bit. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It was like I, I saw was, you I running running tired. through some water and everything shooting at you. <laughs> oh gosh. Just things just hate me, you know. Um uh -huh. but yeah, I, uh, thank you so much for having me on. It's always sure. a pleasure and uh can't wait for whatever happens next in this wonderful world of right terrible things. I mean great. <laughs> <laughs> uh and thanks for being on, uh my man. And uh, our other very special guest, Adam Friended. Anything you'd like to plug, sir? Sure, I'll I'll plug our show. We do a Sunday show. I do a show with my good friend PSA Sitch called the Sitch and Adam Show, and we do uh, definitely talk about politics, probably much more than we should. And <laughs> uh, we basically just make fun of the woke insanity in the world. So it's a lot of fun. Like We've been it. doing it. I think we're ahead of EFAP as, as far yeah, as shows go. <laughs> Rude. It's pretty long. I know. So uh, yeah, Sunday from four uh, at four p.m. 
Eastern, 1 p.m. Pacific, around the same time. So every Sunday, and uh, that's it. Check it out. Yeah, man. It's a good show. It's a damn good show. Uh, and thanks again for coming on. Uh, I'd like to thank the Modrotics for doing a wonderful and thankless job. You guys are brilliant. Uh, thanks, everyone, who left a super chat and a donation. My score. Yeah, we're going to have some round-the-clock shit because I'll be on towards the end of Flashcast. Whenever he ends, I'll be uh, coming on for my... Uh, uh, square up on Nerdrotic no. Live. Nerdrotic Live. So there'll be a square up there Saturday night. Late. Yeah, late. No. Hell yeah, it's late. Uh, members stream sometime on Sunday. I don't know no. when. Uh, and between those, I will be crucifying action figures all over this wall. And, <laughs> and, and I might even make another Lord of the Rings video because why the fuck not? I've got more to Hell say. Yeah. Do I, it. Yes. So we'll do that. Um, definitely pre-order Chrissy's album. <laughs> yes. Hey guys. Oh, do we have the, the, the dog? Can I, hey, let's focus. This is for oh, you, Ryan. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, hey, for Ryan. You're so beautiful. You're so beautiful. Get that Hello. dumb fucking retard. Hello. You're so Speak beautiful. Oh, no. Oh, no. Just keep it trying. Look at the fuck away from you. You're so beautiful. No. Adorable. Look at that cross eyed fuck. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh my God, he's a precious baby. Cross eyed. He's like chameleon eyed. They look yeah. outwards. Oh. Also, I feel like <laughs> Squirtle's looking a little sad there for the attention <laughs> being given away. Oh, she wants to run. Adorable. Yeah, I fucking bet. I'm Drop shaming him. her. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Drop that dog. You're fucking fat. <laughs> I'm going to throw friends at you and calm you down. Aww. That dog's not fat. He's just ugly. <laughs> Jeremy's dog is fucking fat as shit. That's, that's how you. That's a full ride defending your looks. Wow. Like, not that fat. was a compliment. Thank, Thank you. <laughs> Don't forget. I'm geek, just trying to be accurate, you know. Don't forget Geek Grind Coffee. The link is in the description. You get yes. a special deal if you type in Nerdrotic off the All Hail Blend, and it ships to the UK. I don't know about mm, Ukraine. Mm, though. Mm. I don't know if it ships to the Ukraine. And we have. I ordered some. Awesome. <laughs> uh, we have listeners. In Russia and the Ukraine. So if you're out oh, there, hello. we hope you are safe. And with your speaking family, of, we always. updated the Nerdrotic yeah. podcast. So if you're listening on podcast, go back to it. It's up and it's updated. Yes, thanks oh, to yeah. Garrett. Fixed that problem. Appreciate you, man. So yeah, we're back on Spotify. I'm not leaving Spotify. Uh, and <laughs> iTunes. Nope. And yeah, and 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 again, yeah. If any listeners are in Russia or or the Ukraine, we hope stay for the best. fucking safe. Yeah, just yeah. be yeah. safe. Yeah, uh, we know yeah. it's leaders Definitely. fighting and not the people. So, oh, I guess the people are defending their land in Ukraine, and they have every right to do so. But um, yeah, we just hope you're okay. And uh, like, I'm glad we laughed our ass off tonight. It's it's. I think we all kind of needed it. So, uh, oh yeah, that's what I, you got to do, man. Yeah, it's yeah. been a little crazy. Yep. You yep. guys all did a great job. The chat was fucking awesome as usual. Thanks again. The memes were excellent. Oh, oh God. God. Tell me about it. Yes. And uh, we'll see you all next week. Please enjoy some credits. Remember, not all who wander are lost. And may the wings of liberty never lose a feather. Bye, Bye everyone. Bye. 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 Emma, Emma, Everybody's wondering what's behind that door. It's not really Comics Division's house. <laughs> <I'm sure>. <laughs> <laughs> Comics Division. That's a normal door. <laughs> I really want him to come out of that door one night during the night time. Do it.
Hey, hey. <laughs> Shit. Little fucking dick. What a dick. <laughs> the last night, we had our own little middle earth experience. We did. We did. Yo, how did it feel? <laughs> <laughs> it was so cool. And the cocktails were very nice. Oh. Mama just killed a man. Stuck him up against a tree. Watched him die and then he peed. <laughs> Mama. Scissoring's just begun. And now I'm gonna turn it all away. <laughs> Mama. Lazy and evil. For years I've watched y'all allow Donald Trump turn you to crazy people. Where's that freedom ego when you must need them? You bugging like beetles and lining up gleeful sticking needles in. 2020 was the year that y'all were losing it. Watching smart people I respect turn into lunatics. The rational became irrational. The avenue we travel through will have a few. Kickbacks will have some youth. Y'all fools so short-sighted, of course you write it. Shut it down, print money, you should be indicted. What you are doing is criminal and been a fool. The end of you is going to be the end of you and your institute is crooked. Fools claiming I hate the police. Too stupid to understand that they are what they eat. Control freaks that are use their own homies to seek power and then put them on the wall in a week. This industry is full of followers. They hollow when it's time to make a dollar and positions that they wallow in a shallow end. They don't understand half the crap that they are swallowing. Regurgitating all of it and acting like a scholar. Wait, this about all the contradiction that I can take. I'd rather you get it now, but truth is you kind of late. Your silliness is limitless and it would benefit your tendencies if you could just focus a little bit in the the roller coaster of emotion that you're going through, controller pool. I notice you letting it rolling over you. 
Logic ain't in the conversation, ain't in the realm of reality. Basic as an Applebee's, y'all chattel see that poly pundit, that'll be the sheepdog. You know your teeth soft because you weak sauce. Teach y'all the basics of each fault. I be raw, rough around the edges like a tree saw. Got a lot of options, cause the optics always popping and I'm dropping what I'm gonna do, adopting what I wanna do, liberation, so every fake kid and eight men that's pacing cause I don't have to abide by the ways I'm just Do not come. Do not come. I'm gonna come. Dumb as a man.